The thoughts, views, and opinions expressed by this podcast as well as its hosts are for entertainment purposes only. I repeat, it is not serious. It is not real. No one is exposing, revealing, indicting, or telling you anything about themselves. Also, we do not encourage you to try this at home. We are trained professionals who do not have your best interests at heart or our own. <laughs> Enjoy the show. You that would have been to just play the clip would have been foul. You shook my hand, my bad, and said, Mel. You hmm? sh- I apologize again for that. To just said, playing just, the clip. Just playing the clip. Yeah, to just play the clip will be foul. Sometimes you have to let your podcast co-hosts <clears throat> know what's going on before you come on air. A lesson I've learned many, many times. <laughs> so you, you shook my hand and said, "We're good." So you already <laughs> tried to like D- disarm you a little, disarm bit. me a yeah. little bit, bring me down. You know, so I'm gonna hit a clip. We, we, we're well, waiting because so, we we weren't good, me and you. Yes, we weren't good. Um, oh wow, I'm happy that you're acknowledging it. We weren't good. We took an aggressive walk to the hallway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we weren't yeah, good. We took a walk to the hallway. Y'all good Wilson's now, though, right? Here. Elliot Wilson's here from the start. Don't go fucking yeah. writing blogs about our internal fucking business. <laughs> <laughs> he watch it, though. Don't go take our shit over to be now. Yeah, we got to be cool. We got a guest in the building. Elliot. Got a guest in this building here to talk about the Book of Clarence Is or some shit. Is this all off the record? Off the record? No, we no, all the way on. We are all the way live. We are all the way live. Mm-hmm. All right, so me and Flip are good, but I do have a clip. <clears throat> and allow me to respond uninterrupted. Are y'all good, good, or just good? We're going to see after we hear this clip. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, we good, good. All right, all right. That's, that's what I want to hear. Okay, good, now good. who's good, good? Oh, shit. Is it on your side or on my side? <laughs> oh, I'm good, good with you. I said, but depending on this clip, I may just be good or all right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I got to find my clip. You know where it's at. <laughs> I got to find my clip. And honestly, this clip ain't even really like about you, big dog. More disarming. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's a setup. Word. Thank you, Paul. Oh, Paul's good looking. Hey. You're welcome. Y'all talking. Hey, yo, talking. how you keep your Tims looking like that? I'm starting to get jealous. Hey, yo, Ooh, Chris, I went, yo, I was going to put some on this morning. My shit ain't look parkish. <laughs> hey, hey, my shit ain't look parkish. I don't wear them outside, honestly. The That's key. why the bottom look new. Yeah. Yeah. The whole boot look new. Word. Yeah. You on his dick. <laughs> <laughs> Who on what? What? What, what happened? I didn't say nothing. Yo, you and Elliot resemble each other. Is you good? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> he look like, he look like, he look like, he look like, I swear. Light Elliot do look like, like, oh, yeah. Yes. Yo, oh, he shit. do look like. You attacking the light skin brothers this quick? Yeah, well, he, well. He look like granddad, grandfather. I'm ready today, y'all. Yo, you got me in trouble, trouble with them cool, jokes. I'm ready today, y'all. I got what? Stop, you cause a lot Elliot of trouble. Elliot look like ish if he never exfoliated, like if he drunk. <laughs> <laughs> if he drank and did drugs. <laughs> he look, yeah, he look a little older. Stupid, he look a little older. Yeah. All right. This guy's a fool, yo. Yo, how old are you, Elliot? Uh, be 53 on Sunday. Sunday? Yeah. That's why Happy I birthday. My birthday hey. present. Happy I want to kick a bitch off my birthday, Joe. Uh, yeah, come on, give it up. Give it up. Oh, there we go. Happy happy birthday to Al. Well, okay. Look at good. Clarence in theaters right now, though. Oh, <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. oh God. God. listen, please, please. I'm playing with you. I'm playing please, please, with you. please <laughs> buddy. Uh, oh, that reminds me. I got to fix my iPick account. <laughs> what happened? What? Them niggas made some changes, and then I went to log on and c- just couldn't log on one day. They was like, nigga, we don't know you. Oh, damn. So damn. I got to figure that out. Be one of them, yo, you need to change your password. I felt horrible inside. <laughs> like, when one of your favorite little apps don't work the way it's supposed mm-hmm. to work and they don't even recognize it. I have Apple Music for about three months. I feel lost. <laughs> I'm like, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> some bullshit. You, you know, use Apple Music? Yeah. On an Android? <laughs> Get them. Yeah. <laughs> really? Okay. It's some type of what, yeah. joint venture? You yeah, got some beta? <laughs> but that shit's available. Oh, yeah, yeah. I didn't know that. <laughs> Ice, they ain't, they not techies. Ice, we can't talk to them. <laughs> my little, yeah. we, we can't talk to them. <laughs> my little, we. <laughs> my little ring subscription that I forgot was a subscription expired. Oh, that's funny. And a nigga went and fucking was finagling by my door. <laughs> That's one of my favorite things to do. When niggas get to finagle them out of the door, I pull, open it out. Ah, let me see what's going on in there. That niggas was like, nah, you can't see shit, nigga. <laughs> Fix your subscription. So how you know they was finagle? I felt so vulnerable because the ring tells me that oh, somebody's still there, oh. but you can't see what's going on. Want to hear something funny? What day was that when the subscription expired? 
Recently. Recently. Right? I get a notification. Ring just charged me. I don't have a ring. I'm like, why the fuck? Who? Did I remember I set your ring up? Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> get my man a bonus. Yeah, get my, like, <laughs> yo, yo, get my, me up, get my yo, man a bonus. I thought I got hacked. Yo, like, Freeze. <laughs> that's good looking, my G. Yo, you continue to set a shining <laughs> example <laughs> of what of what work etiquette and workplace yo. life should be like. Oh, you do. Oh, he man. does. You continue to you continue to be the baseline and I commend you for that. <laughs> yo, go ahead, man. Big freeze. <laughs> that shit fucked me up. I'm like fucking Yo, oh, that's that hilarious, dog. Yeah, no, we're doing first quarter workplace assessments. All right. Uh, <laughs> so how do high-performing team members contribute to workplace conflict for managers? Now, I coach a lot of people who mistakenly think that being a high performer makes them invaluable to their company. Now, on the one hand, high performers are consistent. They drive productivity, they lead innovation, and they generate results that outpace their peers. But along with those positives may come some rigid and highly demanding personalities, big egos, high drama, and workplace division. High performers can be hard to lead if they develop a sense of entitlement, and they can be hard to work with if they only see their peers as competition. And what's challenging during coaching with high performers is that many of them feel singled out and unsupported, trying to understand why they aren't appreciated for all their hard work. And meanwhile, their senior leaders will tell us, hey, we love what this person brings to the table, but working with them is a nightmare, and we're trying to balance the cost-benefit analysis of keeping them here. And this difference of opinion is because many high performers only consider the value they bring into a company and rarely consider the emotional cost of what it takes to keep them there. Look, it's not a mystery that many leaders would rather work with low drama, mid-performing individuals who work well on teams than with dramatic, high-performing individuals who are good at what they do, but maybe not so good for the company. Like I've said it before, organizations hire for competency, but they retain for chemistry. And this is why it's so important that we learn how to stand out while fitting in and how to get along to get ahead. <laughs> Microphone check, one, two, one, two, one, two. Oh my God, so blessed. So happy to be here with all of you amazing people today. Good energy, high vibrations, all of that. Shout out to our loved ones and their loved ones. Shout out to our family members listening all around the world, fans listening all around the world. Flipping mail, mail, mail. <laughs> Flipping mail, 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 mail. Salutations, salutations. How's everybody doing? Great. Great. How's everybody feeling? Feeling amazing, man. Amazing. Glad good, to be here. Good, good. What episode is this? 690. Welcome to episode 690. The six, the 600 is getting out of here. Yeah, yeah they are. about to hit well, that seven. Welcome to episode 690 pause. of the Joe Button. Yeah, just, just yeah. <laughs> let it go. Let it go. Watch or, a pause there. Or resume. Or resume. Or resume. Or resume. See? Uh, of the Joe Button podcast. I'm your humble, gracious, grateful, and highly favored or lowly favored, depending on who you're talking to. Host here with a few really amazing people to my right. The beautiful Melissa Ford is with us today. Big Flip is in the building today, looking mm -hmm. bright as ever. Like it. I like it. Ish is in the building. Big library. Shout out to the Ishri lights out there. Y'all know the fucking vibes. Mm -hmm. Still snow, uh, plowing this snow by myself mm -hmm. or by my lonely, huh? Uh, salt my own sidewalks. Yeah, walks, fuck is they talking about? You wasn't with me shooting in the gym. I don't salt my sidewalks in my Tims. That's how I keep them clean. That's, mm -hmm. that might be yeah, man. Mm -hmm. I feel like out, out, don't shove your white privilege in fucking ish face. <laughs> I feel like somehow that was some, some sh shit in there. I'll do it for him for, for a fee. Yeah, oh, man. He don't pay no fees. Yeah, you're right. He don't pay no fees. <laughs> he keeping every rep. Oh, Big Freeze is in the building. Big My man Big Ice is in the building. Elliot Wilson is here. Happy birthday to him. Thank He's a mouse. guest, so let's all be on our best behavior mm -hmm. today. And mm -hmm. last but certainly not least. Big Parks is in the building. Yeah, Eric Simmons is here. Careful not to let him know about any sauce while he's here. He might be here to steal sauce. Uh, no, I got coming. Elliot's at CBS. Them niggas can't steal this sauce. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a CBS no more, man. Come on. You left? Interval. Interval presents, man. Shout out to the wonderful people over there, man. Yeah, but who owns that? Warner. Oh, yeah, Warner. Yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> <Come on. laughs> Don't mess up my re up, Joe. Don't mess up my re up. Man. We're close, Wait, man. When, when is it? When is it? It's we, we talking now. We talking. Oh, man. You know, I, I do have a lot of topics about the creators versus the companies out there. Mm. I know you do. What is journalism? Yeah, I want to know, yeah, what, what, what are we, we just, really here for? You here wow. to set the record straight with Kai <laughs> Uh-oh, Mel Ford looking at me now. I'm scared now. No, <laughs> no. I just I just wanted I want to know the same thing. What I think hip-hop journalism is right now? The, the state of it, yeah. Cause I think it's in a tough state. That's why I'm out here trying to fight the good fight in whatever unorthodox way I'm fighting it. Uh, sometimes I get it right. Sometimes I get it wrong. 
You feel like um, you got it wrong with Kai Sinat? Um, Yo, why you had his head tied okay, like that? Guy. Damn, right. Candy Queen, okay. Brass tax, All right. let's get to it. Um, yeah, I mean, I got it wrong in terms of... Um, uh, I apologize to the family. You know, the mom got at me on Twitter. Like, I was like, mm-hmm. I felt the the genuine part of him, like as a kid with his mom and his sister, the optics of that and how much they were Nikki fans. I kind of stepped on the kids' moment, so that wasn't cool. Um, but I stand by it. I feel like when I say things like hip hop journalism, I'm just pointing out that there's just a lack of balance. Like, I get that you want to go to these streamers, you want to go to these kids, they have huge audiences, but you know, I'm always going to fight for us to get the story. Just like in XXL years, I fought for us to get the stories against the Rolling Stones and the other magazines. So, so you're I just think it needs to be a better balance. Yeah. That's all. That's so you're hating. <laughs> Yes. Well, I always hate. I always hate right. when I don't get the story. That's, That's me and Nori. We hate, we, when we don't get the interview, as Joe knows, yeah, yeah, you know, there's a part of us that Queen's competitiveness. Like that should have been my interview. I should have get on Twitter the and let interview. people know. Yeah, yeah. So some of that is that competitive <laughs> part, but at the same time, yeah, I I was specific though. I'm not apologizing to Nikki. I apologize to Kasanat. Got it. Mm. Okay. Times has passed, okay. Elliot. Times has passed. You know, things are changing. And sometimes you have to adjust to the changes. Just like like I said, I'm coming, trying to. I think I'm just, getting it right sometimes. It's like I think when you, you were coming up, man, they had to adjust to your changes and, and the values that you brought. Yep. You know, the way you did things. And I think it needs to be the same. I think you have to extend that grace as well. You know yes. what I mean? And I, I get what you're saying. I'm with but you. But I was a monster in the XXL. I, know, I didn't yeah, have I know a lot of was. grace. I was oh. cutting people's heads off. I was Of course, area. of course, of course. And yes. you, came, you, you didn't go to journalism school, right? No. Mm-hmm. See? So... How do you call yourself a journalist if you don't if you didn't? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. What's up? Okay. 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 And that's not me Ellie, shooting. Ellie, that's Ellie, not me Ellie, shooting. No, because I, 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 I followed. I followed. No, I swear to God, yes. it was not. Ellie is a friend. It was question. not me shooting at all. I really. I'll answer your question. I, I, I had a school of experience. I did yeah. everything from independent magazines. I learned the tenets of it. I went to college. I, I didn't go to journalism school. I went to college. I went to liberal arts. I learned certain codes. I learned the tennis of journalism. I did an independent mm-hmm. magazine called Ego Trip, Beat Down, and then Ego Trip. Then I became the music editor at The Source from 96 to 98. Then I ran XXL from 99 to 2008. So I just learned by doing it. Like, being that's a legend. That. Practical experience is a, a thousand yeah. percent absolutely, you know. Yeah, I mean, we had to think, like, you know, like when Juvenile left Cash Money, you know, Juvenile comes to XXL, says, I'm leaving Cash Money. It's that breaking news story. You got to read the quotes to Baby and Slim and try to get a response to what he's saying. And mm-hmm. we're breaking the news that he, this nigga's really leaving you. Mm-hmm. And reading the quotes and you have to have Baby and Slim on the other line and whether they want to respond or not. Like, you have to cover both sides. When I did Dre and 50, which everybody talks about, I did Murder, Inc. two months later. Like you got to cover both sides of the story. So to me, that's a lot of what the tennis of journalism is about, you know, to answer those, Agreed. those situations. Agreed. 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 And thank you, Mel, because Eye Candy, you was the queen of our Eye Candy. I don't think we ever met formally, but... Mm-hmm. Um, the eye candy session was impeccable and oh, important for us. Thank you. You was you was one of the queens of that, thank so you. I thank you for your service. Yo, 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 yo. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't hate. 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 I said Mel Ford. I make sure. I can't. I can't. Brain candy. Brain candy. Yeah, brain candy. Yeah, brain candy. Yeah, that's brain candy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, brain candy. Brain candy. Brain candy. Brain candy. Oh, that sounds okay. crazy. That's not, that sounds crazy. You can't say it. Personality. No, I candy was no. I candy was the Jet Magazine Beauty of the Week. We did that shit with oh, class. Man. I felt right, Mel. I agree. We, didn't, I agree. We, wasn't, we never took it to the lower common denominator yeah. and keep it nasty. Like those shots, you be throwing shots in a different way. The way you say shit is very journalist shots. We got to We got to watch him. Elliot, Elliot is one of the one of the fucking guys that does uh, support hate. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I like can support you, hate. Can you speak to us to, uh, about my coverage of the Joe Budden podcast? Really, is is support hate? I guess right. No, because I do really think you support me. When it becomes hateful, I can feel it in my spirit. It's Who the un- it's hate. Well, when I put the prize picks, I used to be mad when I put the prize picks thing up. That would be clap that. That was hate. <laughs> How was that hate? Stop it. It wasn't hate, no, it was just pointing out that I think it's, you're very slick about the ass stuff. Like, I just think it was the fact that y'all just did it and there was no lead up that you were going to do it. I was like, oh shit, as a listener, I'm like, oh shit, I didn't notice they really did an ad here. So, I, I, my listener experience is to me like the fans, like, I'm going to share that. Oh, like, that was oh, a big thing. Oh, 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 oh. I'm you just could telling take you that. why I did it. You, and you could take that crock of shit <laughs> up to CBS. You took that money. clip dressed say, up ah, ah, look you, at the you non-ad take this nigga putting the ad out. load of bullshit <laughs> over Stop the Warner Brothers. If the non-ad nigga finally does an ad, that's a story. No? 
Don't yeah. we not yeah. no story, is that story? nigga? Ellen, no, no, no. Don't don't story. Name. Where did you show both sides? Where did you show both sides? There was no both sides. You was comfortably doing the ass. So sometimes you know, so there's no. You found sides. a worthy. Uh, mm. No, when, no. Mm. Listen, when Ian rebuttaled and explained, you didn't the call thing, me or Ian to explain our side. You didn't side. tell none of us. The listeners. So all sometimes it's not once. both sides. You no, no, no. Then I retweet Ian with the clarity. Yo, in your same example with Juvenile, he didn't. He told you. And what you do? You said you read the quotes to Baby and Slim to get the other side, right? Yeah. So what he's saying is you see the ad, you didn't call nobody to, to, to see the other side of why mm. there's an ad. You were being facetious. You no, wanted to be Ian funny. Ian came in and explained the ad after nah, the fact. Nah, that's after the fact, dog. That's after the fact. Here's the line. Shut I'm though. just a hater sometimes. Yeah, just say it. Cool. It's all right. Like, <laughs> hey, we'll feature the line. Yeah, I'm you still you still my man, no matter yeah, what. No doubt. But you can get your hate off. I like that shit. Y'all can consider it hate. I honestly do not consider it hate. I'm not hating on you. I felt like this is finally Joe found a uh, advertising partner is c- moving right. He's fucking with it, but the fact that you played it in, and also even with y'all, the way y'all intro it with Mel, y'all kept it real campy. The way y'all kind of opened it up the first time, so that was newsworthy to me too. Is we're like wink, wink, wink. You yeah. played up to it. Yeah, we newsworthy the first time, <laughs> right? <laughs> Mel knows y'all played it kind of campy it was a hate on news. the intro on purpose. Hate, yeah, hate yeah. Hate news. y'all played it campy. No. Now, you, now y'all do it right. Y'all do it like this is our shit. The first time was a little tentative. Y'all played it on campiness. You snuck it in. You didn't say you were doing it. It's what it is. I hear more hate, but it's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. all of that hate. <laughs> I'm not denying this hate. Because even as he's talking, I'm listening. I'm like, okay, <laughs> that's one POV. <laughs> The well, other was the, POV was, boy, did we smash that shit out the park mm-hmm. and was one of the you big did. dogs and, and, immediately. And, and, no, and not you did, and nigga. Up, Shut and up. And I blew it up even nah. more, as you said. No, 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 no. No? no, no. <laughs> hey, Elliot, listen. I'm going to ask you to leave. <laughs> <laughs> we, 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 we here to be honest, goddamn. I didn't even know this was the topic. I was starting I'm with sorry, like some I'm peaceful sorry. shit. <laughs> I, was I was here to just play the back too. I'm not trying to like, this no, is your show. I'm just, you yeah, know. No, we're going to have some fun today. So Big Mel. Yes. Come on, bring us in with some soulful, soulful bliss. Okay, well, you know, I, you know, sit at home and I'm, I'm introspective. And, no, we don't know any uh, of those things. Well, I am, all right? So fuck off. <laughs> you're out every other night. I you're, am not You're an out. actress. I, I don't remember not. reading that. Working, working out article. with the camera with the flex dude. <laughs> yeah, you got word. a lot going on. You got a workout partner, an accountability partner. You be in Brooklyn, you be in Harlem. You've made your runs since you've been here. We don't know you'd be home. <laughs> then. That's hate. Well, look, it's your, a little bit of hate. All right, come on, let's lie. All right, anyway, so... I thought about this question and uh, I wanted to see what you guys thought about it. So if you had a remote control and you could press pause, fast forward or rewind on a specific part of your life, what would it be and why? And it could be all three things. Mm. A couple nights that I wouldn't mind hitting rewind going back to and rewind again. (laughs) Oh yeah? What was it about those nights? (laughs) (laughs) What? (laughs) <laughs> hey Parks, that's one. That's one. That's, that's absolutely one. one. Uh, yeah, I, I would take a couple people off my jacket. Mm. Oh, you would delete some bodies. Yeah. What? Yeah, because yeah, that's a I ma- didn't that's know that guys would want to do something like that. <laughs> that that yeah, that jacket is dragging all on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would cut a little bit off of it too. You would. It's I probably know. too big. Yeah, yeah, you got one. <laughs> you got a couple fur coats, nigga. What oh, fuck you think you talking? That jacket about? is draping down the steps. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you got that chinchilla. And slow, you got the slow, jacket slow motion. On? <laughs> yeah, multiple fabrics. <laughs> Got Multiple you, fabrics you on that bad boy. yourself, nigga. I don't know what you think you're talking to. <laughs> mm, I definitely rewind on childhood because fuck these bills. Okay. Oh, no, fuck. Nah, nah, nah. nah. Yeah, I, but pussy. Yeah, I'm going to early 20s because I was having a good time. Nah, I want to be a lot. Like, <laughs> Living 30, carefree. Like 31, 32. That was a good time, too. 31, 32. Like, you, 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 you old enough to get a little bit of respect. Like, when you're in your 20s, niggas just be like, get out of here. Yeah. It's a dumbass. I, but when you're like 31, 32, you get a little bit of respect from, from, from the older people, and you're still young enough to be wowing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I if I could rewind, it would be to do high school differently. You wouldn't let them run you out of that one? T- they never, they never ran me. I've been to 11 schools, but I just do it differently. Just you cut you know, it down to seven? Just, Did just your GED a different way? I never got my GED. <laughs> but what I'm saying is that just to be there and... Take it in and appreciate it more. You should get your GED. I, I am going to do it, but I'm going to do it for content. Uh, appreciate it more. <laughs> Trying to get on college so, hill yeah. so bad, yo. <laughs> yeah. I still... Yeah, my fault. Let everybody get their shit off. Oh, no, get your shit off. Oh, 
<laughs> oh, right for me? Oh, oh, he's still. Is it, no, no, did you did you finish? Because I want I want to be fair. I want to be. Oh, wait, Joe didn't get his shit off. Yeah, I want to be a team player. I'll wait till everybody. Finish. Oh, mine's is real simple. I'm going to write the fuck now. <laughs> <laughs> you ever heard the stories from any other part of my life? <laughs> like, do you see what's going on right now? <laughs> you shitting me? Pause might be a, va- a, a valid uh, yeah. button to hit. So pause Bowl. would be your button. You'd hit pause for right now. Yeah, and okay. tomorrow I would rewind <laughs> to today. <laughs> like, so I'm all day. Shit. I'm just gonna go back to yesterday, live it over. Yeah, nah, we lit right now. I'd hit fast forward because I'm anxious to see what would be in the future. Mm. Like, I want to see what 50 looks like. Mm. But I don't want to rush to age. That takes away from the beauty of living. So, mm. That's I true. don't necessarily want to pause, but I'm very happy with where, where my higher power has me. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Ellie, where are you going? Uh, probably the 20s because you, when you're in your 20s, you think you know everything, you're mm-hmm. spending money, you're reckless, like, you know, you don't buy shit because you don't really have a significant other and you don't make, you buy a fucking uh, futon instead of a real couch because you think you're not really going to sell. So, you know, be better about money and stack your chips instead of spending them. Now, would it be going back with the knowledge you got now? Or is it just, no, you want to back down cheap. No, no, no. Because you, you were saying you look like money. Situ- oh, maybe money that's not in the stuff. answer. You, what yeah, do you mean in that sense? You mean if you could correct something or? No, just go back and read. No, go back just and go back to a, yeah, just go back to a moment. Oh, yeah, I think I want to yeah. go back to because I would have wanted to handle it better. I would have wanted to do it better. You can't and do it different. You You're gonna do it. You the same do way. it again. <laughs> it's rewind. It's a it's a video. It's a oh, VHS. No, then, it's, then it's still then it's probably the XXL era. That's like my Fonzie era of like being dominant and figuring that shit out and achieving my goal and. Doing that then. Your Fonzie era. Hey. Yeah, it was like no, eight, nine, ten years of that shit. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> That's all it is. You no, know, I don't want to live in that, but that was the great moment of my, you know, first success career wise. So it just becomes what it is. But I'm not the I'm more than just the Fonz. I'm fucking Henry Winkler. So that's just like mm. one part of that. That's why I say the Fonzie era is just like one part of it. You got bars. On my journey. Like that ish, like that ish, my last skin brother. Man, fine. Yeah, I need to start talking about Harry Potter. (laughs) 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 Get the shit on. All right, go ahead, flip. We done. Yeah, address address, address the room. So, I heard that. I I, I obtained that. But you got to also remember that a good leader possesses a combination of quality and skills that inspire others to be led. So, while you say that, I think I'm gonna flip. Oh, 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 oh. Rewind that. <laughs> uh, uh, Why you say that? That I, nigga got I, his GD. I, <laughs> I do. I do agree. I do feel like you uh you extended grace and allowed me to be myself up here. But last episode, while people don't know, um, you were doing things that we both know that I saw, and it just I chose to get off the camera, and we had a explosion. So. What I'm saying is that Pause. hopefully <laughs> moving forward, if there's any issue or misunderstanding, you can talk to me before we get on camera. Because when I'm here on camera, a lot of times I look to the left. I'm looking for you to lead because when I come and I start going, I tend to focus all the attention on me. So I look to the left like this. And if you just have the shades on and you know what you're doing because you admitted to me outside, it made me react the way I react. That's all. I'm not saying it was right. I think I was 100% wrong. I think that I could have spoken to you or went outside, but I was just caught off guard for, certain, for some things, and I just chose to react that way. So before you play about my character and personality, you also have to play what good leadership is, I which think, you have. I think you're absolutely right. Thank you. I love you, and we work through it like brothers do. Good. Aw, mm. what a moment. What a moment. Don't clap it up for that. Yeah. Clap it up. Yeah. Don't play yeah, that you shit ain't again. No, yeah, yeah. You ain't getting nothing. Yeah, that's right. Fuck Elliot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Where y'all want to go? Anywhere you want. Anywhere you want. Anywhere you want. 21 Savage. Want to get right to music? Let's get to it. Let's do it. Okay. Let's do it. Well, 21 dropped this new album, uh, American Dream. He did. I'm going to get right to it. This album is amazing. Woo. Really? It's amazing. Production. I mean, he's doing exactly what he does lyrically on the album. This is, I compare, art, y'all know me, I compare artists to their previous works. Mm-hmm. I don't really compare you to the field. Um, 21's best album to me was always I Am Greater Than I Was. Mm-hmm. This is on, off two listens, I'm gonna put it right under there right now. This has potential to be better. He smoked damn near everything about this album. 
Mm. Is there any features so, on it? Yeah, it's, it's mm. features. Um, Dirk is on there, which is one of my favorite records. Uh, Doja Cat. I thought um, I heard Thug, right? Yes, he has Thug on there. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then there's a letter to Thug, mm. which is cra- like the album is crazy. Um, it's the production. Like you know, tw- uh, Twenty One is is really a, he picks a, great a, beats. A, a mu- yeah, but this album, you know, he's really a music fan, mm-hmm. like a music lover. Mm-hmm. So you hear, you know, he's on Insta Live always singing the old R and B records and stuff. The samples that were flipped, mm-hmm. and it's a, it's a very soulful album mm-hmm. with him giving you today's you know rapping. Right, right. So it's a it's a breath of fresh air. Mm. Real talk. I'm, that's what I, that's all I got. I have nothing bad to say about that. You hear me Parks? I listened to it like in the shower on the wake up. I didn't like deep dive or listen to it in the car or in the studio or something where I can really take it in. But it sounded great. It sounded great. I'm a huge fan of Twenty One Savage. He's I've said it a million times. From that class, he's by far my favorite. He it's it's not even close to me from from his class. Yeah, he separated himself and he continues to do so time and time again and he did it again with this album I thought it was pretty interesting to drop in January for Thug for first, a first quarter drop from an artist of that magnitude is, is <clears throat> kind of strange and unique he's I, never dropped that at that time he's never but again this is separating myself from the rest of them I can drop now Cole's done it drop an album in January like some of them will pick that time where hey y'all ain't <laughs> even here mm-hmm. and I know y'all not coming I'm gonna drop a heat rock and set the bar for the rest of the year yeah. Now, now this is what y'all got to compete with. I'm not going to wait till the end of the year, see everything that y'all did, and then come and try to sweep up. Nope. I'm that confident I that I can both. go right now. Or I could do both. Well, come back? Yeah, it's potential. Yeah, yeah, yeah you could. It's a possibility. Mm-hmm. But for somebody like him, like this is his first solo project. You know, he's done the collab albums with uh, Drake. Metro. He's and Drake. done Drake. But this is his first solo project in... Since 2018 or 19 yeah. or some shit like so that. So he don't yeah. really double back like that. Mm. He one of those where, yo, I'm, I'm confident enough to what this album can do that I'll put it out. Y'all got to deal with it. And they're going to have to deal with this album. Gotcha. And, and he'll have the solo ground till about March. Oh, what well, you mean? Where nobody, ain't nobody else putting no shit out? Yeah. yeah Most likely. Fe- yeah. February, late February, March. At least no one in his. There's going to be people putting shit out, yeah. but no one in his kind of range. Gotcha. Oh, did you hear it? Yeah, I think it's dope. I agree with Ice. I think um, this is best. To me, it's his best album. You know, the whole thing about the story about, you know, the controversy. He's really from London, so they play into the whole thing. His mother does the intro. Um, it feels very cinematic. The sequence really well. Uh, good rap features, guest features. Travis, people sound a little different than they normally do. Then he hits a whole pocket in the second half of the album with, like, R&B stuff. We know he loves R&B with Summer Walker, Brent Fias, and stuff like that. I think this is definitely his most cohesive and conceptual album. I think it's really good. Mm. And it's setting up for the movie that they got coming up in July. How yeah, I hope that's not really a movie. I hope that's really just kind of a... I hope a it's a movie. Or <laughs> I really hope it's a movie. I hope it's a the album's movie. Though. Well, yeah, but uh, yeah. yeah. How many uh, mics or XXLs would you have given I it? I think it's a, off four, first, it's a solid four mics off first listen. Okay. I think. I mean, he hits a certain... You know how Savage is. It's a certain pocket, you know? But it's dope. Have you heard it yet, Mr. Joe Budden? You got damn right. <laughs> you got damn right, I did. All right, brother. I'm playing on my phone. I think you fuck with that track two. Track two, you might fuck with track two with that wishing on the star sample. Buddy, buddy, buddy. Please, <laughs> please, 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 clear, clear out, clear, clear out right now. Why I love this might be my, this might be 21's best album to me. I'm, I'm yeah, telling I think you, it is. just on first listen, if it. If I don't have it higher than I graded it, I, gra- I am greater than I was. It's right there, which is that's his. That album was amazing. Yeah, so that's I'm his not, best album. I'm not ready to jump to that. But it's point. already knocking on the door. Mm. It's at the door. Yes, twenty one for me, right? Like when I'm in the car with like younger chicks, like Shanti and them, and we are arguing over the aux, like and they'll be trying to play some super young shit. And I'm like, yo, dog, I'm 43 years old. We have to find a middle. We have to find something that we Happy both medium. That's 21. that we both vibe with. It's this. Yeah. It's him. Not only that, he's the best currently rapping of them. To By me. far. He's like the coal of them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So then that's great for him. And I figured that he would learn a little something from that her loss experiment. Mm-hmm. 
because he's a sponge. Like Ice said, he's a music lover. Ice echoed a lot of the points that I already have, but like Elliot said, uh, his mom on the intro, but then track two. This lets you know the point mm -hmm. of the album, the production, the vibe, where we going. Oh, man. What would Mouse do? <laughs> oh, man. Listen, as I was listening to this project, I'm playing out my phone. First of all, 15 tracks in 50 minutes is beautiful. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Clean. It was Clean. so smooth. Perfect. Mm -hmm. I started my shower at track one and was close to the end of the album by the time I was done. Like, ooh, that's nice. Mm -hmm. I got to hear all of this shit. The sequencing on here is amazing. A lot of these beats remind me of like Atlanta Wu-Tang. Mm. Mm. Not bad at that. He about to bug yeah, out this one, on he this. He went crazy on this one. He about to bug out right now on this shit. Red Rum, track three, American Dream. Yeah. He shot a video for this one too. We don't watch videos. <laughs> I watch videos. Look, this is ridiculous. <laughs> this is nuts, yo. This sounds like something Royce would have brought into the slaughterhouse session. <laughs> By the time I got to this, it was good to hear Young Thug. Mm -hmm. And then Letter to My Brother came on at 7. I already played that. By the time I got to track 7, I was like, this is so crazy. I'm so glad he shoved all these fucking feature niggas to the back of this shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad that he just coasted first half damn near by itself. Mm -hmm. All you niggas get to the back of the fucking bus. But boy, was I wrong. <laughs> so listen, I had my worries about Lil Dirt from all of that healthy healing bullshit that he was just on. <laughs> Boy, was that a mistake. <laughs> Me too. Boy, yeah, was know. all of that I'm healthy, right. healing, I'm a better man, choir or kids, Cole, like that fucking that. protecting the Bro, future. I like that oh, my life. Oh, none of that shit. <laughs> trying to bring me down. <laughs> that that sounds like, sound like one of them ideas the A&R ran in the studio to oh, tell Oh, that was you. definitely a big A&R record. Yeah, For yeah, sure. yeah. I like the record. Yeah. Man, I was close to writing them off. Mm. I, but 21 I'm sorry yeah Dirk I'm sorry I'm fast forwarding <laughs> your first verse cause you was just did you didn't know that Dirk had an agenda you didn't know you knew after that that third verse sounded a lot different yeah. oh my god yeah, yeah, oh my yeah, god yeah. right up the man what oh my god hold up I might leave the strip club when this comes on <laughs> <laughs> I might not stick around <laughs> yo it was at that point in the shower that I was just ready to go. I was just, <laughs> let me dry off. You know what? I'm good. I'm good. Yeah. I'm good let me get this dampness off my body <laughs> just in case I got to get active. Fuck is wrong with these niggas, man. Charge me up, Dirk. That's the Dirk I like. Yeah. <laughs> All that other shit where we trying to sell a record. When you try to sell records, you don't sell records. <laughs> yeah. Well, that very sometimes. rarely works. Sometimes. It rarely works. Mm. This is the Dirk I want to hear. If we back to this, oh man, boy, is that exciting. So listen, I was already good. I love this Nina shit with Travis. See the real. That's that that one there. See the real. See the real? Yeah. Mm. I Actually, I could almost yeah, hear it. I was like, phone. let me get out my phone. Not to compare, but I'm like, okay, coming off of her loss, I said, this is a Drake record. Mm. Like listening to it. It's it's the inspiration was there. Right. Smoked it. It sounds almost like nice for what? It sounds almost Drake-ish. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm but saying? With the but 21 spit yeah, on yeah, it. Because yeah. I would still shoot you. Yeah. <laughs> and your mans. Yeah. yeah. Amazing project again, man. And I like how he didn't need to do Drake feature on mm -hmm. there, which was great. Then I had Drake on there. Was That's dope. dope. Mm -hmm. I feel See, that was cool when that record came on. I liked it. And I was very happy he was getting in his girly bag. Right? Because... So far, he just smoked this album on on real niggerness. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so by the time we get to that, I'm happy. But that I, I did think to myself, okay, now we're taking some her loss leftovers. Mm -hmm. That was a girly record. Well, for me, it was yeah. Nigga said so you got a brand new Desert Eagle. Try to put it in his pants. It's, 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 it's a certain it's type of girl, girl that like that though. shit though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Keisha and them. Yeah, they love that. <laughs> Come on, dog. But I always said, and this is where I got to commend 21. I thought this about Drake. I've said this to Berg. The fuck is that, Faith? This is Faith Evans. 
Give me my props, son. <laughs> I've always said that some of these niggas that are doing these flips and R&B inspired joints, boy, they would really benefit if they really knew R&B. They always take the song you that, that, you t- know, take that, yeah. you know the, slap, the song they the take. The obvious hit, yeah. These are the guys, they never take a hot B-side, mm-hmm. a crazy interlude. Drake does it sometimes, but you know that 21 knows music. So, oh my God, I just had to get that off real quick. Hold up. Oh my God. Oh, yes. Bear with me. Actually, don't bear with me. We always doing it for the ladies. Ow! <laughs> summer ain't even come on yet. <laughs> and then summer came on, and I said to myself, yo, Self. what a fucking cheat code. Like, if you know R&B and can hit the fire producer, yo, flip this faith shit real quick, and then you call then Summer. get her. And then call <laughs> Summer, come down to once. I want you to hear this. A little bit. Just... I got something I just want to play for you. What? I'm skipping to her. Hey, where's this joint? Where's this joint? I'm sorry. I fucked something up. Y'all can say now, something. Again, um, this is all. 15 this, songs? Yeah. This is a, a R&B lover album. <laughs> but but also with niggerdom. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. Like, <laughs> on God. I, I got you. Got you. Got you. Like, he good, calling guys. you a pussy and saying he'll shoot you. On the girl record. On some very, very smooth <laughs> production. This joint, this joint is hard, man. <laughs> it really is. One of my favorites is uh, the outro, Dark Days, too, with Mariah the Scientist. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What a way to end the record. Great intro. He coasted. Great closing. Yeah, yeah. Grand opening, grand, grand closing. Yep. He did what the fuck he had to do. Uh, shout out to fucking 21, Mies, everybody out there in Atlanta, everybody in this camp. Way to set the bar. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Good yeah, start of, to the year. The rest of the work cut out for you. Because the guy that's stepping out there first in the year, there's pressure with that. Mm-hmm. So for mm-hmm. him to do it, and I think he's the perfect candidate to do it. Mm-hmm. Like, he had a good year last year. You're looking for the next step, and yeah, he's go, he got it this all. Is, that's, this is how you separate. If it wasn't already separation, this is how you do it. I go put a project like this out and I'm coming early. I'm not playing no games with y'all, no single, no nothing. Yeah, to wake up and have this and Kid Cudi in our phones. Come on, man. What y'all think? <laughs> what y'all think about that? What y'all think about that, Cudi? Don't hot now, Elliot. Don't make faces over there. What you uh, think? Kid Cudi don't like me, so I'm already. All right, we asked that. Well, then go ahead. The floor is yours. Wait, how could you ever? I don't be? listen to Kid Cudi. How Kid could Kid Cudi not like, like you? That's, what my, that's my all I got going on. I'm a Cudi fan. I, I, t- I cut that shit on and cut it back off. Yeah, I got, yeah, I got yeah, to go yeah. back to it at a different time, maybe, or something, but. Wait, hold on. Parks, let's get the tea. I, Why yeah. doesn't Kid Cudi like you? Because I don't really like his music enough, I guess. Mm. It's, it happens. Oh, no, there's something there. What if, like, have you said anything yeah, particularly, yeah. you know? Did you make fun of his car? Yeah. Because <laughs> Kid Cudi, you know, my music beats with him to the side is one of the nicer people I've met. Well, I, I respect when he came in the game and the impact he had mm. and changing the sound and, you yes. know, obviously inspiration for that direction. First I'm, talk, I'm talking me. about how kind he is just as a human. I, don't, I, don't, I do not know that part, no. You know that part. Oh, sure. You never met him? Uh, I met him. He wasn't, he wasn't kind to he you. He pressed you? He, I was just, he <laughs> pressed me. That's nah, what he it sounds like. Me. He never pressed me. Yeah, I heard that shit. You, I read what you wrote. Uh, now, he didn't like something I did. When I used to do the show with The Truth, uh, Jay-Z Life and Times, I, I critiqued one of his singles. He didn't like it. So he just blocked me on all social media, was talking shit. So I don't know. But I'm not, I'm not a fan. I'm a fan so, of the early stuff. So I respect who he is. But you I don't, don't know like that that still, still exists, though. Oh, no, it still exists. You still blocked yeah. I'm still black. Yo, people from in this business will beef about absolutely nothing and hold it for the next 30 years. That's crazy. But you, but you I've been, yo, I've been in this long enough. I know the artists that fuck with me and don't fuck with me. Who else mm-hmm. don't fuck with you? <laughs> yeah, you know we want to know Good that. Good job, <laughs> We'll talk about it later, man. You know what we won't they forget. Deserve, they don't deserve no light. Yeah, look what y'all are doing on the man's yeah. birthday. Right? Yeah, right. You're right. You're right. My bad. My stay bad. positive. My bad. Thank you. Stay positive. Yo. Don't say stay Come on, my don't queen's say brother. Stay, I love you, but don't stay. Don't say stay positive. Okay, my bad. I'm saying let's you know let's ease your way out. Well, I gave you the real. I, I didn't front. I said okay. this, the, he don't like me. I don't really like his current music. The last couple of years of his music, and I didn't listen to it yet. Gotcha. When is Would your, you listen to this album? Would you? No, if I had to, but I, I don't want to. <laughs> See, <laughs> what is that? Can a, can a person that you don't like put out some fire? 
Of course. I hate that, but it happens a lot. You could, yeah, you can pump. I can't deny that the music's good. He don't have to fuck with me to have good music. What's your sign again? Capricorn. Capricorn. Sunday. Yeah. Come on, right. man. Stay focused. Oh, yeah, him, and <laughs> him and HR twins. HR twins. <laughs> Single Trey. Five Trey. Don't start Sunday. Your shit. Don't start your shit, man. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> Wait, what happened? There's so much here. What you mean? Capricorn? Oh, it's just Capricorn too? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's go, and y'all's ability to... <laughs> Hold these hold the, grudges hold the, the way that oh you Oh my God. Until the end of fucking time. If it's up, it's up. Yeah. 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 It's up, baby. If it's up, it's up, man. That's but a nice kid thing, too. Yeah, yeah, you know, y'all don't have what to live mean? like it that. It can come back down, Paul. They got to stay <laughs> <Yeah>. up. <laughs> y'all niggas is 50 years old. It's correct me if I'm wrong. We're open to a conversation, but we ain't going out of our way of like. This is not him. No, that's not true. This is my thing. Yo, I think, personally, I can't. I think I'm a good person. Yep. I think I'm a good friend. So if you do something to me, I could look at myself in the mirror and say, yo, I ain't warrant that, and I'm good on you. You know what I'm saying? And then now, if you too big to come and apologize, you're going to not take accountability for the fuckery? Mm -hmm. Ish, Stay you, over that side. Do you hear why he's saying he won't listen to Kid Cudi? I'm not agreeing with that. I don't know. <laughs> it might be something other no, than I'm that. No, I'm, I'm not listening to it because I don't think he's good musically anymore. That's oh, why shit. I'm not listening to it. <laughs> based so off say it, call, based off so personal say it, call him Mid Cudi right now. Huh? Oh, shit. Well, I said call him Mid Cuddy. Call him Mid Cuddy right now. Yeah, Take this thing out. I like that. That's funny. That's a good one. Yo, man. I have thoughts about Kid Cuddy. That's journalism right I have there. thoughts about Kid Cuddy that I always keep to myself. Well, maybe I haven't. Maybe I no, have. No, you me. definitely, definitely let your not. thoughts be known. <laughs> oh, I got to get better with that. <laughs> <laughs> your segue told me. You said it just. <laughs> what? I was excited. No, you're not no, you excited. Wasn't. I was excited. Have you listened to Kid Cuddy's album? This one? Yes. No, how do I do that? Exactly. So why you get mad? Why? So I feel you know where I be at. There's no way I be at that requires <laughs> that to be on through the speakers. Of All the I saw is they said that Rocky's on there drawing a little jab at Drake. Did y'all see that yet? Oh, even more reason for me to never, never <laughs> That's listen. What they to said. This is like and I, and the I niggas see, I hate all stars. And then I went to the, tra like the then I went to the track list. I didn't see him listed as a feature. So I'm like, wait, I got to go through the puzzle to find the Rocky yeah, versus this and Drake. He do have a, 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 a XXX record on there that I want to hear. But I, heard, oh, I saw something kind of stole the record or something. Was, was Is that what you said? Yeah, something, oh, I saw shit. something online. I don't know. Fully, nah, they're yes. trying to get me. Cox sources. I'm not a fan. You're trying to get me. 21 got me to nod my head to Brent. To Brent. I did. Oh, that's true. That shit, that, his Brent joint, that joint is hard, man. The record is hard. Yes, yes. Brent is Brenton. Yeah. I respect it. Yeah. I respect it. But so no one heard the Cuddy album? I heard no, I didn't. Four minutes of it. You're minute. doing that thing again. Yeah. Don't don't what use us to do it. What what I do it? <laughs> yeah, you, we just told you that we didn't hear. You don't need to ask again. I see what you're doing. Journalism. Yeah. Yeah. Journalism. Journalism. <laughs> Projectionism. Man, fuck, fuck all this. Let's get down to the big news of the day. A nine minute D'Angelo whole <laughs> collaboration. Come here, man. Mr. Elliot Wilson, take it away. What am I doing? Yeah, come on. What, what happened? Did you hear the way my guy was talking on that thing, man? No, on, man. I didn't. I, I yeah, didn't that's, that's, yeah, I didn't that's hear exactly it what I heard. Once I got on Twitter, Sean Carter spoken word, man. Sean Carter spoken word. Man. Talked about it, man. Come on, man. That joint is so full, man. Come on. Y'all keep using that word. That's how I knew I wasn't rushing to listen so to full? it. So full? So full? So full? Yeah. Nah, I'm cool, Nah, my bro. man. What's my man name? He went everywhere. James Samuel? Said, yeah. He says, so full bliss. Yeah. So it's beautiful. My man Beautiful, so full bliss. I wish I saw some of that before I heard the song. Huh? I didn't see none of that. I wish I'd have saw something. All I heard was nine minutes. Who has the song? I got it. Let me hear a little bit. This is my first time hearing it. Me too. Mm. I've never heard anything. I didn't press play either. The whole uh, spoken part's about the, around the three minute mark, if you want to. I want to hear how it comes on, though, first. Okay, true. And then we could get to. Okay. Oh, this Book of Clarence soundtrack, available uh -huh. now. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. He is working. I'm just playing, Mel. I'm just playing. I love it. Niggas took a little Stevie no. drums. Get your, get your coins. A little Stevie. All right, all right, all right, dog. All right. Tears in the champagne, man. Come Someone got to let him some incense or something. Yeah. Oh, God. Fam, I cut that. No. Were we supposed to, we were supposed to do this, right? Yeah. That was, no, that we're was supposed real. to do this. That was real. <laughs> get this shit out of here, man. Now, now we know what he meant. Right? Truthfully, I want to rhyme like common sense. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I hope you don't I, never rhyme like I, common I, sense. I was wondering again. when that Jay Z would come out. There it is, right there. <laughs> the longest dreads get the light. <laughs> <laughs> to real earthy. Yeah, it's gonna be more of this coming. It's gonna be more of this. Flute yeah. album next. I'm not mad at that, but I know I know he's working on an album. I want to hear. It. Yeah, mm -hmm. I know he is. Let's go, Hove. 
You either working on an album. Or you're working on working on an album. No, he's working on an album. Or Hove had to get out the house and needed a line. Yo, I gotta, yo. They need me for a poem. I gotta just <laughs> drop a couple <laughs> lines yeah, over here. I got a good question with that. Which producer would you like to see him with? I feel like every Hove album is kind of inspired by a certain producer that sets the tone of it. Do you feel, do you, do you feel a specific producer you want to hear with Hove right now at this stage of his career? Nah. Uh, you know what? He gonna come out and try to do some new Hovey shit. And I just wanted to, I wanted the Blue Magic to be Blue Magic. Hmm. I know that uh, he might not be able to get the Kanye package, but the Just Blaze still around. Just Blaze and Preem. I want to. I want to hear a throwback. Just, just, just and Preem. Yeah. Who what I you think, hear guys? Do do the throwbacks. Bink. Mm. That's, that's, too. that's yeah. another yeah. throwback. Yeah. Go to the guys. Mm. I don't want to hear none of these new niggas on there. I don't want to hear no nigga you found. I don't want to hear the. No, 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 no. I do want to hear that little Partridge family group that he signed. I know who I don't want to hear him with. I, I, I know who I don't want to hear him with. True. <laughs> Say it. I don't want to disrespect none of the greats. Man. I'll say it then. I don't want to hear Hovind no ID no more. At all. I'm cool. Thank Zero. you, but no thank you. Ice, Ice pushed me over the ledge. Oh, because y'all don't like 444. No, Kaka. Like no. Definitely not. Don't get crazy in here. No. What's the next thing above Kaka? I'm not even <laughs> dignifying this. Y'all get okay. your takes on right, Get your shit off. <laughs> Yeah. Yo, but it's over there. I, I mean, love, any- I love no ID. I, I think they could make it if they did it in a different way. That the Who, album. I love no ID. I just want to tell that I just couch, don't like that song. Whoever, I mean, that album. whoever, I'll tell you because I probably don't care. Whoever is hand and hold the headphones is on that part. <laughs> yeah. Whoever's handing them the headphones to hear this clip. Uh huh. It starts right at y'all little. <laughs> right at y'all little part. He ain't gonna hear the where y'all putting the love. I'm glad I'm not on that couch. Yeah. <laughs> Them headphones is cut. Guru has got that queued up. <laughs> nah, caca. So, so <laughs> caca. So is, is who would you like to hear him with? On, you think beat wise? I like everybody. Um, I, he could go back to. Just he could go, yeah. he could go Pharrell. get Pharrell, he could mm. go get Tim. Is I might get underground? Tim, uh, miss. Tim a J and Tim thing yeah. would might be something in 2024. Like anybody, just that, that you know, what I mean, I didn't like so four. nobody, and everybody like he knows could, I'm he J. He like your beats on 444? Four, four? He couldn't yeah, do that. Like different. He might, I, I don't, eh. I ain't like the marriage between the beats and the Me songs. Either. I didn't like the marriage of like the beats was cool. I, and the raps was cool. I just didn't like. It was it the wasn't way a synergy. That he was yeah, it was, it was a synergy was that rapping. wasn't there for me. Um, but you know, y'all know why I hold Jay Z. Jay Z is Jay Z. I, I think he can he do whatever he wants. He gave the headphones back already. Damn! Now you got to tweet it. <laughs> Make sure you tell him that you went to the museum on his birthday. That's true. Oh, oh you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> stall him out, homie. You went on the step before? You did. Sure yeah. Yeah. Like, like a doof. That's hard. Like a loser. That's hard. He wore his home shirt, too. <laughs> and through the Rock. The Capricorns <laughs> agree. What's up? You missed, the, you missed the Rock Nation brunch? No, it's coming up. You ready? I'm, Let's go. No. Let's no. go, Joe. You be my date, man. Come no, on, yo, no, home. No, home. No, you be no, a date. Okay. Let's it's go. Okay. It's okay. They don't serve brunch there. <laughs> no, there's pizza. Tyler had pizza last year. That's there's not pizza. brunch to me. That is not brunch. Yeah. No, that's food. You just have I'm to work. You have to work for the food. The food's there somewhere. Nowhere on the brunch party flyer should it say pizza being served. At all. <laughs> no. At all. That's after, maybe, maybe after brunch. Like there's the chicken and thought. waffles they and got, black folks. They gotta have Listen, food. That's, yeah. that's, 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 food. that's for y'all. Why do you want to take that stand? I know when to use my whole favors. It's not for that at all. That's so far in the bottom of the list. Uh... All right. Well, shout out to everybody that yes, put yes. music out. Yes. Shout out to everybody that's living in their dreams, following their hearts, and doing what they love. 2024. Ah. Love. Love. More love. Okay. More, More love. love. More love. Mm-hmm. More love. I'm with it. More love. All right. It's time for my favorite part of the show. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Let's see who will be a lucky winner this week. It's Me. Time, uh-huh. time to let the people know about prize picks. Mm-hmm. What is prize, prize picks? It's the way that these guys have been getting extra money week after week after week. Mm-hmm. They have been hitting. Their strategy skills are off the charts. Yep. It is the biggest daily fantasy sports app in all of the land. Really simple and easy to play, but it will keep you up at night. Boy, <laughs> boy, the picks look good until the game starts. Just keep hitting refresh. <laughs> Until that fourth quarter. Yeah, oh yeah, until that, that, that fourth quarter. Yeah. That's when you start wondering about the coach's plans. <laughs> like, I got come a theory. On, come on, man. Well, 
Say it later. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna yeah, say it later. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Say it later. But uh, really simple to play. Just uh, select two or more players. Look at their projected stats and pick more or less. Mm -hmm. uh, playoff this weekend. Oh, it's wild card really, weekend. It's mm. Yeah, really excited about that. Really excited. My Joe Button genius or not so genius picks of the week. I'm feeling bold. I'm going all demon time. Ooh. Oh, uh, reminds me of my 30s. <laughs> all demon time. I'm going Tyreek Hill for more than 124.5 yards. Whoa. It's a lot. That's but dangerous. that's the point of the demon. Sure. Picks. Yeah. That yeah. is. I'm going Nico Collins more than 99.5 yards. He that, getting that. That guy gets 200 yards in his sleep. He getting that. And I have Amari Cooper for more than 109.5 yards. That's the same game. Mm -hmm. I feel like CJ is going to go out there and show that young arm, and I feel like Flacco is going to try him and, and, and try and shoot I think that, that might be, even though Cleveland is an amazing defensive team, they I think that that might be a little Could bit of a, a shootout. shootout. I think shootout. it might be a little bit of a mm -hmm. shootout there. I agree. I agree with that's that. That's how I feel about the Detroit. And, uh, oh, that's definitely going to be a shootout. That's a trap game. Yeah. That's a trap game. I think Maddie Stafford, boy. Mm -hmm. I would hate to have to deal with that. Uh, so there you go. Select two or more players for your chance to win up to 25 times your money, or if you're like me, doing Demon Time up to 99 times oh, yeah. your money. I'm on Demon Time this weekend for sure. Yeah, as, as am I. And please, don't forget to use the code JBP. That's right. That's right. Nice. That's right. Gave Spotify a code. They said their systems was hacked. <laughs> no, I, got, I, got, I got trauma from the code. I ain't gonna lie Damn, to we can't show you what it did. Yeah, we was hitting that shit out the park, too. Spotify hit the little button. Oh, deleted it. Well, all, what do you in. know? Sorry. Damn it. That's the trick. A uh, lot going on in the sports world. Uh, Pat McAfee is fighting a good fight for content creators against yes. ESPN. Big bad ESPN. Also, Stephen A. Smith set the tone. Mm. Stephen A. set the tone. Cat Williams set the tone. I'm liking the energy for 2024. Mm -hmm. Where we just get at some niggas. L just got at, you know what I mean? Come on. <laughs> L just got at Kid Cudi. <laughs> and that's the energy. Uh, yeah. That, that is the energy for 2024. I'm a fan of it, even though I'm about peace this year. Uh, but Stephen A., I guess Jason Whitlock. Had something to say about Stephen A. And Stephen A. finally had enough of it. Jason Whitlock has been talking shit for ages. Mm -hmm. And Stephen A. is such a class act that he never says anybody's name. He never curses. You know, Steve is gearing up for a re-up. Back to my ESPN news. I wonder what's going to happen with that, mm -hmm. that re-up. L's up for a re-up. A lot of content creators up for a re-up. True. And are leveraging their power. But anyway. Yeah. Uh, Jason Whitlock. Let me see if I can find out I where, the the, where this beef started. Yeah, but I don't need to send it to anybody. Uh, <laughs> I didn't know if you had it. Oh, I didn't boy. know if you had it. So I was how just, long you been working with I, me? I, I, <laughs> some Anyways, keep going. Don't show out in front of... What? We got a guess. <laughs> we got a guess, girl. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Do, 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 do. All right, look at these seven people. <laughs> <laughs> might have needed to get it sent to you. Mm -hmm. I mean, I sent or two versions. Or I could play it. I oh. sent two oh. versions to Parks. Of the sports media. Smith is a plant. Disney and ESPN installed Smith at the top of the sports media world. This is Jason Whitlock talking about Stephen A. Smith. As a journalist, make him easy to control. You ain't lying. When I listen to Cat Williams talk about Kevin Hart and Steve Harvey, my mind immediately drifted to Stephen A. Smith's memoir. Smith's story just doesn't add up. But they're not That's hate. I only played one game All of this is hate. Kept. I normally don't even play this nigga on this broadcast, <laughs> but Stephen A. set him straight. So, journalism, both sides. Is there a one and a half pointer in Division II basketball? How do you do it? He's attacking Stephen A's basketball career. <laughs> Weird angle, but. Weird angle, for sure. <laughs> I mean, I'll follow it. He's attacking his memoir, saying that he didn't it's write it. Possibility, and I know I'm not great at math, but you can't average one and a half points a game in basketball in one game. My bone <laughs> cracked in half. My first year at Winston Salem State. A bullshit. A bullshit. <laughs> 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 Stephen Smith. Because one guy, according to the stat sheet. 
played nine games, and the guy on TV is saying he never played a game. Oh, the guy on the right is Big House Games. Listen, yeah, it's enough of him. It's man. enough of him. Yeah, yeah. enough of him. It's nitpicking hate too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it is. Yeah, he went on. He said more. It just sounds like hate. Uh, but Stephen A. Set him straight. Where's my Stephen? Give him a good clip? forty-five minutes of fire. Spewing that bullshit to go. people. Did you tell them how you stood outside outside of first take begging me to talk to you? Did you tell them that once the same article in Deadspin came out. Weeks later, you wrote a lengthy apology to me in an email begging me to forgive you. Mm. You bitch. Get him, Steve. Mm. Woo. Get him, Did you Steve. Tell him? Did you tell him that? You fat piece of shit. Hey, hey, Did you tell him that? Hey, hey, got hey. We got Jamel Hill. We got Howard Bryant. You want me to bring up the other writers that wouldn't work mm. for you? Why it took you nearly two years to get an article out? Because you journalist ran beef. that shit so bad you were running it into the ground. It's true journalist beef. Journalist, real journalist true beef. True journalist uh, beef. What's journalist beef? Listen, shout out to Stephen A. Smith, friend of the show. All, always have my support. My brother in this thing. Mm-hmm. Fucking an inspiration of mine in this thing. And for as much as part of that is because he's such a class act, boy do I enjoy seeing him take the gloves off. I do too. Sometimes mm-hmm. you too. have to. Just one good time. A little pow pow. One good time. See, Shannon is on his broadcast, keep and, and his advice to Steve, he keeps telling Ocho, I keep telling him, don't lend people your audience. And while that's true, sometimes you gotta give them, you gotta <laughs> let them. You gotta let them borrow a couple. Yeah. <laughs> when some, ass will some, yeah, sometimes you just gotta I listen, firm believer, you have to shoot the J to let them know you'll take the J. Mm. Mm. You ain't gotta keep taking it. But you gotta shoot. Come on, man. The shot. You let this fat nigga talk all this shit for all these years. Get on your shit. Talk your shit. And that's why I like Stephen A. with his own platform, Stephen A. Smith Show. Mm-hmm. And he he was even kind enough to say he said I called my the the mm-hmm. heads at ESPN and my pastor. I called, <laughs> I called my pastor. I called my family, my sisters, <laughs> my nieces, my nephews. You yeah, call everybody <laughs> to let them know that I was gonna behave outside of myself tonight. Y'all ain't even got to check in on me. I, I'm letting you know ahead of time. Yeah. Yeah. And I like it. And he promoted that shit like fucking Jim McMahon. Uh huh. Well, and one million views Vince. in less than 24 hours. Vince, yeah. Vince McMahon. Jim or Jim. Or, or I mean, yeah, Vince. Vince, yeah, shout out Vince. Vince McMahon. Yeah. Who the fuck is Jim McMahon? Shout out to Jim. I don't know. Chicago. <laughs> <laughs> quarterback, quarterback, quarterback for the Bears. He just say shit. Yeah, Vince. Oh, no, I don't care about Jim McMahon. Super Bowl shuffle, man. Oh, Go ahead. No, please. Oh, Vince. I, know, I, know. I, mean, I, I meant Vince. I know you meant Vince. Go, so Vince. Uh, but, yeah, I just like to see it. Uh, esteem, uh, esteemed cast panel, what do Same. you guys think? Loved it. Loved Listen, it. I, I, you know, I'm not into sports or any of that, but I'd like to see when somebody steps, up, steps outside of their normal selves and gives somebody an ass whooping. I'm for it. Call them fat. Violate him, took all that shit. You fat piece of shit. I'm on Stephen A. side. I don't give a fuck. That's the nigga that sent books or some shit like that. Is that this, this no, dude? No, no, no. That's Mel's friend. Don't. Oh, okay. I'm, you, you I met him. About, that was I, was hate. I met him too. That's my man too. I fuck with him. Who? You. You talking about something different? The guy with the books? No, no. He's talking about he's talking about rolling. Ah. Who? Continue. No, no, don't worry about it. Sorry. It's okay. Okay. You're, thank you. You're, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I'm, with, I'm with Flip. Like, I'm always the high road guy. You know, I'm quick to, yo, yeah. don't don't respond to the bullshit. Just let him talk. Let him talk. But yeah. every now and then, you just got to slap that shit out bag. You be, yeah, you be coming out. You be you letting these niggas have it too. No, so. no, no. Just, but, I know you would relate it, to me. It's not a, a, a constant thing. It's just that, you know, sometimes you just, like you said, a pow pow. Got it. Leave me the fuck alone. One good time. Mm. Jason it's, Whitlock's been saying a lot of bullshit for a lot of years. A um, lot. A lot. He is a he troll. Has, he has. I'm, I'm 50 50. Um, oh, uh-oh. I know yeah. where it's going. I'm a little 50 50. I think uh, sometimes you do got to give somebody some Pull pow. Pull that mic closer, please. Sometimes you do got to pow pow somebody, but I'm be honest with you. I hope this don't continue for 2024 with us just beefing on air. Like, that shit is kind of whack to me. Why? Um, the content thing is one thing. So much, I, so much money to be made. I know. See, that, that's where it lives. Um, Are you a capitalist or not? Nah? I'm not. Okay. <laughs> right, you for value. He broke nah, black, black unity. I just don't, yeah, I just don't You feel like, like it's a slippery slope? I just don't like us beefing publicly all the time. I just don't really care for that. 
us mm. beefing publicly. So, so what time. about a man who's been getting attacked? And just that's why I said sometimes you just started like, with your whole grudge to the end of time. Now you don't like us beefing publicly. But I won't publicly be putting it out there for for what, other what motherfuckers the, to. Take as far. Oh, so you a halfway what the, healer. But what if the other person is is constantly out there publicly doing it? They you go, still, I'm, Stephen A. Smith is at the pinnacle in sports broadcasting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you talking to the minions? That shit don't make him no never mind. Do you feel like yeah, um, but don't attack my basketball career <laughs> in high school. So one point five, one point five, one point five, one point five. You can't say to another man one day. You average one point five points, and it's not going to be beef. Come on, no, stop talking about that. No, you only play one game, and that. Stop talking. Yo, if I'm fifty years old, my nigga, don't talk to me about my high school resume. Your triple dub. That's how I feel when people be talking to me about my rap resume. Like your triple double. That was mad long ago. I don't want to hear none of that shit. Your triple double. You guys feel like I had a triple double. I know. That's what I'm saying. That's hate. You're doing that Elliot hate shit. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing that Elliot hate shit. They, 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 they ping pong and they hate yeah, on each other. I'm bringing up your triple dub. Yeah, that I was know. your highlight of your basketball career in high school. I'm just One saying. of them. <laughs> it was a higher one than that? Just me attending the school that I attended. <laughs> gotcha. So, Ish, you think he shouldn't respond? It's punching down? I was going to say, do you guys feel like Jason Whitlock was like low hanging fruit? Because Stephen A gets attacked a lot. You know, he's he says nah. a lot of really controversial stuff, and this is like the first time where he's ever gone like balls to the wall, calling somebody like yeah, you know, out their it's name. It's because it's personal; it's such a long yeah, history, so, and he yeah. finally mm. said, "I'm gonna give him this one yeah. good time." Yeah. Like we and y'all probably but, not really understanding because yeah. most of y'all are pussy. Who who y'all? Y'all. I don't know y'all. Adam is shooting at you for months. You take the high road. Tracks. Is taking the high road being ba -ba -ba -ba. a pussy though? No. No. Yeah, sometimes. Facts. Okay, no, so oh, wait, wait, wait. So no. how, okay, wait, 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 because I'm, I, I'm, I'm, I'm triggered right it's now. It's not pussy. So you, how? You pussy. It's pussy for y'all because <laughs> y'all niggas do anything for content. You think I'm a pussy? Ah, there you go. Got you. Here you, you think go. I'm a pussy? It's not the truth. Yeah, you're a pussy. You let a man shoot at you. I'm gonna revisit that. Oh no, you let you wanna you uh -huh. wanna. Oh, let me finish. You let a man shoot at you. You want a big broadcast with a voice that people want to hear from you. You letting this Caucasian, no disrespect to my Caucasian brother, man, keep playing around with you. He's going around with different people, throwing your name and stuff, and you have nothing to say. You have nothing to say. So sometimes we look forward to hear what Ish has to say. You could do it classy. You could do it in Ish style, but we want to hear you say something. But classy, but classy is... Oh. No, you're ignoring... Classy this is what I... I but Yo, let me don't speak. mansplain for Ish. Let me speak for me. <laughs> oh. let me don't speak, mansplain. Let, me speak let your me. Newark brothers talk. Let me speak for me. We I don't wanna... care if you flare your nostrils, Hold nigga. Hold up, nigga. We from... getting at you, nigga. I'm waiting for him to finish. Let I don't want to cut him I'm going to speak for me, and I appreciate that. That's, <laughs> you're learning. You're leading by example. Great leader. I want to hear what you have to say when it comes to that when somebody's playing with you and keep playing and keep poking I want to hear from my brother and I stand with you go first of all you don't give me permission to go secondly oh, shit. I'm the person that don't pick and choose so uh, if I'm a pick that's and a shot again I'm, I would love to speak true I'm the person that don't pick and choose so if I'm a if one dude take a shot at me and I respond I'm not gonna go mute when another nigga take a, a shot at me mm -hmm. so I see us pick and choose who we choose to respond to and I think that's pussy. So okay. if one nigga that we know get busy shoot at me and I don't say nothing, I'm not gonna go over here and fuck with the mice that's shooting at me and go ape shit on the mouse. Got so it. it's niggas up here that have taken shots at you and you cowered a little bit, but other niggas took shots at you and you jumped up here on your yeah. green flip, take my shirt off, rah, 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 shit. Yeah. I don't do that. Some so niggas, I'm not going to put their socks that. on. So, let me, so let me finish. Yeah, I'm I'm not 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 sure. Sure. You see, the problem is... No, 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 I'm not no, finna. I'm going to fry you up. When you got dressed, you put on no socks. That's what he's trying to say. That's true, that's true. That's what he's saying. So what I'm saying is, if I'm going to address one person, I'm going to address them all. If I'm not going to address any... You know what I'm saying? I'm going to just do that. Got it. You done? Mm -hmm. Here's the problem. You picking and choosing now. See, everybody, your, your, your friend that for, for years also protects relationships, nigga. If you're not going to tell him that, don't tell me that. I came in here with relationships, number I think one. he was shooting at me, too. Oh, stop, stop. <laughs> I on. was shooting at Joe. Uh, no, let, let, let me finish. I addressed you let because me finish, you sir, me. sir, Karen, let me talk. Thank you. My hands are up. I want no smoke. What I'm saying is that we respect our relationships. So where we from... No matter where you go, no matter what woman, no matter how somebody responds to you, if you have a relationship, unless it's something that's defaming my character when a nigga tell me suck his dick, once a nigga acknowledge my family, a nigga good with me. Everybody has a right to respond the way they respond. So I can pick and choose what relationship I want to hold. A lot of times also, let's talk about you, you was cool with niggas that you met on the internet, allowed them to play around and still play the middle. You did that, and we seen you do that. You didn't take a side until a nigga involved you. So what I'm saying is that we all pick and choose. We 
fucking got him. Oh my God. We all pick and choose what to do because it's a choice as human beings, especially when it comes to having rapport and relationship. So that shouldn't be at question. Anybody that don't like me that I don't fuck with, you know what I'm going to tell them. But it's 2024, so I'm not going to say it. But they can go to a stand of a Frank, either Nathan's or Sabarit. <laughs> man, I love that. That was man, what a great yourself, exchange. Cool. We don't got to go back and forth. All right. That was so much you fun. Man, I love you. I Only like here on the JBP in front of company. <laughs> 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 yeah, let me ease the tensions in here. Let me get it back right real quick. A little Michael to get us where we need to be. Problem. Something oh. come in my mind. Real quick, I'm sorry. It's just in, in ice and everybody. But now they got me in trouble. The Newark no, 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 no. The fact that you don't take care packages bother me. I think it's an insult to us. Because we, insult. it's true. How's it insult to us? It's an insult because, like, nigga. Let them set it up to here, nigga. I'm not gonna take it, but some, one of us could take it. It may be me on the low, but still. <laughs> like, he just like, I don't take care packages. Now, I've been around a lot of celebrities, and we watch them. People send them big packages, and they take them. I'm really anal with that, pause. Joe said, I don't, and I heard even Ian co sign it. I'm really, really We anal reject with that. care packages. That sounds crazy to me. So I wanna hear. You're taking care packages. In my life, I'm sure I have. Yeah. He said, not now. I'm here. Oh, he just occasionally with someone that uh, yeah, I can not with know. the not with the big companies. Yeah, no, no. Nah. Oh, maybe know. not with that. No, uh -huh. my care packages are from an artist that I know mm -hmm. or. Just but what's your angle? That, what's your angle? But not by not taking like if, if Valencia. I, got, I don't care have no room in my house now. You gonna give me something? I'm gonna throw it in the trash. I don't have room to store it. I don't have room to put anything yeah, extra that I did not decide and handpick myself in my house. Number one. Number two. All this shit is an ad. Everything is an ad. Don't send me nothing thinking I'm about to come up here and talk about it. I am not. Unbox. Don't, don't send me nothing pressure me to wear it. I am not. Don't send oh. me nothing for my kid and then say, hey, take a picture of your kid. And No, I'm not doing none of that shit. Don't walk up to me if you see me in the street and say, hey, can you take a picture holding my CD? No, I will not. Don't ask, don't ask to record me if I can shout out your business or your brand. No, I cannot. I yeah, don't know what that. your business or brand is. I can't speak to the quality of it, so I would not mislead my audience that way. So I don't play them games. That but, is a sneaky way for companies to get some free marketing promo. Okay. okay. But I don't knock anybody that, that does uh, to sure. either hey, hey, bro, get it how you Send them shits to me. I don't know what yeah, there you go. Right here. There you go. Hit me up. I got a P.O. box. I got two of them, actually. <laughs> so that means yeah. they have to compensate <laughs> to me. But that means they have to compensate you if they want you to wear something. If you hit me, I damn near would charge you for me to wear it. There you go. That's what I'm saying. So that's what you do. You, you, I would. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm not mm -hmm. going to waste my time. My number is a number that we can't discuss in the hookah spot. Got it. I just wanted to know. Yeah, my number is astronomical. They be sending some bullshit in the it's care ridiculous. packages sometimes. And I get, so, all, not, 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 not I get a lot of care packages, bro. Half that shit go to my, my people's. Like, well, my mom be went like, here, yeah, take it. I just yeah, give it away. I want to go heads. back to uh, some me and, if it's Mel, some fire. Some me and Mel smoke. Let me just correct. Sorry. Oh, want, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because Mel ain't moved, yo. Oh, Mel ain't moved. I saw you You try to give her one of them. She tucked Oh, she had eyes closed. No, she saw it. I saw it. You think she left me hanging? Yes. She has. She has. I she did. No, she did, bro. She has an armored blouse on. I want to correct the record because 2024 for me is about correcting the record. Peacefully. No, I do not think you're pussy in real life. I think across airwaves, you're pussy. I don't think she's pussy. I think she chooses a different route. And pussy route. is in a. I'm using that. Please, 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 uh, please don't. The word police, please over, don't. Over, me. Overly diplomatic? Yeah, I would think that. Yeah, yeah. And strategic. You know what? You guys are absolutely right. And, I, and it is one of the things I don't like about myself. Whoa, Whoa. I agree Whoa. with yourself. Huh? <laughs> Why, though? <laughs> I agree with yourself. Why? JR. Because it's fucking exhausting. It's exhausting to always consider. The consequences of what you're about to say rather than what your fucking feelings are. And if your feelings have been, if you've been offended, if your feelings have been hurt, if your name has been dragged through the mud, if your reputation has been fucked over, mm -hmm. but you always feel like I got to take the high road. I got to answer bullshit with silence. You got, that is, that is an over conditioning response. That feels like jail. But doesn't it, that? It, it feels. It like, like, I'm it telling like you. Jail. I'm telling you. It, it feels like jail. I couldn't. I couldn't sleep that way. It I promise like you. It keeps me up at night. I'm not lying. This is just. So this it, is eats just, you, it eats you. It eats you inside. It really I eats me it. up. At, it, that's why I said I it's one of. Totally. I can say it's one of the things that I don't like mm. about myself, but I don't necessarily so I, know. So find one of these bitches right now. Yeah. Or that's what I don't get. We can get out of that right now. Just hey, hey, one of you bitches. Let me tell you what I think about one of y'all. All you got to do is pick somebody throughout the year like I do with Logic. 
So any, <laughs> so, so any, yeah, for real. So anytime you're just feeling a little down and out or feeling like you're suppressing yeah. yourself, just get your shit off on logic. Sometimes I... <laughs> no, man, that's picking and choosing. No, oh. leave that man alone. Poor right. logic. Shout out to logic. God damn it. <laughs> Poor man. Shout out to logic. Yeah. It's fun to do it to the people but that don't it, seem can, comfortable with themselves. But I have, I have a question, Mel. Is it? Do you do that because it's part of uh, your image? You don't want to be like everyone else, or just be out there shooting everything. Do you have a certain image you try? You know, to I used to. I used to tell. Peak? I used to tell my. I used to tell myself. You know. Lions don't concern themselves with the opinions of sheep type thing. Mm -hmm. You know, a queen doesn't come down off of her throne to, you know, meddle with whatever, like bullshit. So you know what I'm saying? Beneath, people beneath you. Well, just it, when people are acting like they're beneath you, then you don't address it. And also the queen sets a fire to the so town. when people are acting like they're beneath you, it's <laughs> safe to look at them like they are indeed beneath you and less valuable than you. Uh, you're you're putting words in my mouth. And also, you're, Mel, putting, you're putting fucking words in my mouth. Mel, you got to remember, being the queen yeah. back in the days, she would walk into the town, set it all on fire. She'd burn the whole town down. If, you know, sometimes that happens. Sometimes the queen did come down. But she would have somebody else do it. Yo, that reminds me. See, woman empowerment is why women don't need superpowers and guns. Queen, <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> what? Why did you put the gun part? You got to make it. Um, you should have kept it mystical. You can't say guns because women have guns that they carry. I feel like the woman empowerment shit is like a superpower. Oh, like a superpower, got So it. when you see the woman pull it out over like the most minuscule things in the world, all I think of is what would she do if she was like an ex-woman? She would kill all of us. <laughs> <laughs> you really gonna weaponize your power of all of the women, uniting all of the women? You are calling on the strength and force of all the women in the universe for this? Because the guy took your parking spot. <laughs> <laughs> I just feel like as a woman, we've never been able to park the way we wanted to park in this country. This is dating back to 1979. It's like, wait, what? All right, fine. Uh, you guys, mm. what's up? Pod quiz. Uh -oh. Pod quiz time. Cue up the fucking music. I'm trying to cue up the music. <laughs> what? That's right, you guys. Jazzy little number. Yeah, yeah. I've been home all week long trying to figure it out. Hey. Thank you hey, to my trusty hey. band. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. You're about to go crazy at the end. Yeah. Pod <laughs> quiz time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ladies and gentlemen. I would like to play a game with each of you. Elliot, you can help me to commentate this thing. Okay. This is solely for the people that are on staff. Okay. Because they fucking ticked me off last part. <laughs> uh, I went home to fucking come up with a game. Very simple game, ladies and gentlemen. Three categories. Music covers. Black cinema and television. Sorry, Flip. And internet sensations. First one to three points wins. You have to go through each category once before you can pick the same category twice. Mm, okay. That's dope. In the event that you need help for one of these, your one lifeline is called a work together where you will pick one person on the staff to help you solve this question. But be careful, that person may be trying to deliberately feed you the wrong answer. Mm. As the, the plot thickens. Pretty good, man. Oh, shit. Yo, you got crazy. You had, you had some Yo. time on yeah. you. Yeah, you <laughs> he was upset. He was really upset. Yo, get up. Yo, get up. Get he up. was really upset. Yo, I went home steaming. <laughs> Yo, I went home so mad. And I was like, well, what can I do? What can Let's play a game. Let's play a game. Let's have a little bit of fun. Why not? And I couldn't rely on who was, going, who was or wasn't going to drop music on Friday. Like, all right, enough putting it, putting it in their hands. So if, if for some reason we have a tie at the end, because somebody's going to go first and somebody's going to go, if both of y'all have three, then we'll do a fucking final bonus playoff round maybe the next time we come. Got it. Okay. Which way would you guys like to go? From Parks on or from Mel on? 
Y'all pick it. Come on. Park hey, look alive. Park park look alive. Park 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 look alive. Park 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 let's make some noise for the contestant. Let's make some noise for the contestant. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. What we win? Ooh, good question. Oh, oh, cash prize. How, how much? Cash prize. Uh oh. <laughs> cash can be relative. Yeah, yeah. How much? And they yeah. get it right Four now. Four figures at the end. Right now. Four, Four figures. Four figures. Four <laughs> figures. Without decimal point. Four. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you pay me to be a real. Yeah. <laughs> We gotta go to dinner again. We gotta go out. Now we gotta go out and talk. Take it outside. Fuck four it. Oh, four figures without decimal points. There you go. You should see an increase in your next in your next stipend, your next pay cycle. Nobody said thank you for the Christmas bonuses either, bitches. But anyway. Oh, thank you. We got Christmas bonuses. I bet. Yeah. We got Christmas bonuses. Oh, he okay, going. so let's start the game. Thank, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> he playing dangerous games. The knot will show on your phone if I throw up on your head. If I throw this phone at you, you'll get a knot. Yo, I'm sick oh, of him. Man. We got to go out this weekend. Uh, oh, all right, man. Parks. Which way do y'all want to go? Parks. From Parks saw, on or from Mel on? on. I'll start it off. Parks. All, all right, Parks, pick your category. Music Inter covers. Internet sensations. Internet Sensation. Yeah, question, I question, question. Even. Let me ask a question. So if Parks gets it right, I mean wrong, it just, that goes same question goes to somebody else or is it a new question for Ice? I didn't think of that. Wow. What do you guys think? Good job, old man. Should the question, well, because he didn't pick that category. No, I was just saying, so, true. How much, is it a time limit on the question? No. Oh, okay. Gotcha. All right. Okay. No, but we're on a podcast. So. I got so, you. Yeah, no, gotcha. 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 All right. that, so the question it. dies. Like gotcha. The, yeah, question, the question, dies. question should die. Oh, Internet man. sensations. Let's go. A gentleman by the name of Relly B took off by singing, Where the money resides, where the money resides, uh -huh. where the money resides, mm -hmm. as he exited a vehicle. Mm -hmm. What brand vehicle did he exit? Honda. Honda. That's right. He said that real fast with a lot of is that vigor. That's my is, final answer. Conviction. Yeah. Your final answer. It is. You are incorrect. Damn. What it, was it? It was a Hyundai. <sighs> Damn. That's why I had to. He was so close. close. He was close. He was close. Yeah. Did you the have H's. an idea? Or no, you just the H's. Guess? I, I, I thought it was Honda. Oh, yeah, no, true. the H's. Yeah. The H's. Oh, big big freeze. Crazy. Sorry. Big parks. Freeze. I would have said Honda too. I'm sitting there like, what the fuck? Freeze. Pick your category. Black oh. cinema and television, internet sensations, music covers. Um, I'm going to internet sensations as well. Mm. Y'all okay. trying to bleed it. <laughs> y'all trying to bleed the little topic y'all think is easy. <laughs> no, that's the hardest no, one. I've, that's, yeah, that's, yeah, the, hardest that's one. the hardest one. That's the hardest one. Pay attention to these niggas. Yeah, but Ice is good with this internet shit. Oh, no, he not. Fuck. Not with them. All right. I'm going to follow them. <laughs> In the infamous Why the Fuck You Lying <laughs> video. Uh oh, Flip's going through it right sung now. Sung over next to close. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That video was shot where? Outside. No, where? <laughs> yeah, outside where? <laughs> outside. Uh, what? <laughs> Does that count as an answer, though? <laughs> no, 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 Elliot. It was no, no, an incorrect answer. Can we answer? Oh no, no, no! I'm gonna okay. give him. No, okay. no, I'm not gonna grace? do that for him. I don't know. I knew you would want that question. I knew you would want. It's Queens, nigga. Of course it's Queens. Down south, Queens. Of course it's Queens. Oh my God! Pew, pew, pew. All right, no one has got a point. <laughs> Yo, Flip is going through it. Flip is like, without well, my questions. These, these questions are not the easiest. No, yeah, no, no. I wouldn't expect them to be easy. What, what's, the, what's the three categories? Ish, black TV and cinema, internet sensations, and music covers. Woo. Fuck. Um, internet sensations. What the fuck? Yo, what is going on <laughs> with y'all? That's the hardest category. No, it's not. Y'all like no, black television? Y'all like no black television? Why y'all sabotaging me? I, I thought that shirt was going to take that black television. Yeah, I thought you'd take a black television. You want to get that one. I'm sorry. I acted up last week, nigga. Damn. I'm sorry. They boxing you out, You know what's funny? They boxing you out. When I was in Chicago, I said, damn, Flip would kill some of these internet sensation questions. Damn. 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 Damn.
<laughs> All right. Boxing you out, I'm so bro. shocked that you picked this time. This yeah, it is. I, I'm not. He just you got, got the internet. You got to go through all the <laughs> <laughs> internet so sensation. Free, free, free. Are you ready? Shoot. <sighs> Erickson is texting me that he thinks it was a Honda. Ooh. Ooh. Then, then we'll get go back to, to the it. Judges. Go to then the we'll, judges. Then we'll, then we'll get back to it. Quavo. Mm. Bagged Sweetie. By DMing her a snowflake emoji through Instagram. 100% was a Honda, by the way. Oh, Look shit. Oh. Look at that. What emoji did she respond with? Um, a heart. You are incorrect. Mm-hmm. Mm. We should have done a steal. We should have done steal like somebody could steal this. No, we should no. so Erickson, you checked. It's a Honda. That H was a Honda. It's a Honda. All right, we have one point for Parks Redemption, on a correction. They, right. they, they, they threw the flag. Big Parks. Big Parks. We have oh one point. Parks. I'm stupid. All right, we have one point for Parks. Zero for Ice. Zero for Ish. Ish is trying to Google the correct answer, trying to pull a Parks. <laughs> it's not going to happen. No, it's good. Flip. <laughs> Wait, Joe, Joe you didn't tell him the, the correct answer. The, the correct was. answer. Oh, uh, a bowl of soup. She wanted to eat. She's going to eat. A bowl of soup. You knew that, Elliot? Yeah, I knew that one. <laughs> you hip-hop journalist, I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> flip, yes. your category. You Internet it? sensation, Internet sensation music flip? covers, or black TV <laughs> and black cinema. TV. Black TV. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> Even though I got white people on my chest. <laughs> Black TV. Do I want Flip to get a point right now? <laughs> yeah. Or should I just keep it tough? This is a tough category. It's mad question for this one. You got it, Flip. You got it, Flip. Come on, Flip. Big Queens. In the classic John Singletary movie, Boys. Singleton. John Singleton. Singleton. I mean, John Singletary. <laughs> John Singleton <laughs> <laughs> movie, Boys in the Hood. Huh. Doughboy and friends carry out a revenge shootout at a restaurant. What is the name of that restaurant? Ooh, that was, come on, man. I was home manager. I told you. He was working. Doom, 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 doom. We can get commentary while these people oh, are thinking it's still a, a podcast. Great, I don't know this. Doom, this right? is a tough one. That was a good one. That was a good one. Was a good one. I definitely right. turned my face I up at I first. I knew it, but then I feel like you don't know it. Right? That's, that's no, that was a good question. one. That's a good one. Right Turn now. your bitch ass over. Go ahead. Because everybody knows the scene. Yeah. yeah. Everybody. Yeah. yeah, everybody. But where were they eating God that damn. night? Roscoe. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That wasn't a bad guess. That, was, that, wasn't, that wasn't a bad one. Guess. That was a bad guess. In and out. It was a really bad guess. It was okay. bad. That was a great guess. Yeah. Because it does look like it in looks and like out. In and out. Mm-hmm. Mm. And it's called. Uh, do, 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 Eat a burger. Uh, Wait, hold on one second here. Yeah. Hold yeah. some fake up. shit that they needed. Hold they made thank it. you. Hey, it's it, some fake shit. But so, okay, so, they, they didn't have so, the bread. They, right, they couldn't right, pay the right, price. So it's really that in and out. So in and out. There is an in and out. There's oh. yeah, it's yeah, major yeah. in West Coast. But I guess that's like the take on like what a burger. I yeah. don't know. Yeah. Maybe. Wow, so you're, pick, you're, question, you're picking some obscure that shit. That was a great question. That was a good question. Yo, I don't care what y'all It's not supposed to be easy. We, yeah, we yeah. all have Wi-Fi. Like, I have and to guess who has, mm-hmm. guess who has the, the first point? Park, the white guy. <laughs> 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 off some hard shit. <laughs> Melissa <laughs> Ford, <laughs> please. Uh, pick Black TV Cinema. Black go, man. TV go, and Cinema. The actress in the building. Pick Golden Globes. Fuck. <laughs> At the end of Menace to Society. I, I'm Here we go. It's, it's, it's already a wrap. <laughs> you can't do that. Stop For real? All right, then I won't ask it because that's a real no, good question. Don't they question. have a lifeline too? I don't want to waste this question no, on no, you. No, no, no. Don't waste, don't waste yeah, this question right, on me. Yeah. Oh, I, I got one for you. Let okay, me try to okay, get Mel okay. a point. Oh, Let me fuck. Fuck. pussy power. Fuck it. You can do that? <laughs> for Mel, ladies. Thank okay. You. Only on round one. Melissa Ford. Mm-hmm. Antoine Fuqua's directorial debut mm-hmm. was what? Damn it. She should know See, that. now that feels like a Melissa Ford question. She should know that. 
Oh, she looks dumbfounded. She should know that. Audience, she's know. looking stumped. Erickson, please zoom in <laughs> on the visor. You got the camera. Oh, you got it? Do, the camera is game show music. Do, the camera is currently do, zoomed do, in on do, Melissa's four eyes. As she's in despair and confusion. She's confused. She looks lost. Fuck. Whoa, is that a movie? I'm really like. Oh, man. Come on, Big Mel. Because I know his catalog, but I don't know what the first movie is. Nobody going to know. Can she take a hint? Genre? Wait, okay, wait, wait, wait. Question. So you can't. Oh, wait, hold on. No, 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 no. It's not about the it's not about the question. There we go. Yeah. Is the part of this being black the fact that he's black, or is it the movie is a is black cinema? Good question. That is an amazing that is an amazing question, Mel Ford, but I am merely a host. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just a man. Are, I'm just a host. Are you saying you would like to use a lifeline? Your lifeline. No. And ish, that's you can't do that. What? You can't look up the answers to these questions. Phones down during. Phones the game. down. Phones oh, down. Just in case she uses me as a lifeline. Yes. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna give her oh, the bullshit. Mel, <laughs> <laughs> like, if you want to use a lifeline, it cannot be ish or ice. I'm not gonna use a lifeline. I'm gonna get it wrong. Um, I'm going to assume the question is, uh, you know, in using him as black cinema because he's a black cinema director, but this is not necessarily a black movie. I'm just going to use guest Tears of the Sun. Oh, she was heating up. I thought she had it. I thought she had it, too, she had it too, based on that yeah. question. No, the had. answer is The Replacement, replacement Killers, Killers in 1998. Damn. You were close. You were... I gotta that give it to you. Some, some fire ass questions. I, yeah, gotta, I gotta give it to you. Yeah. Let's get him upset. I'm not gonna hold you. Shit. All right. Piggity. Parks is in the right, lead. Round two. Everyone round two. else is at round two. zero. Black cinema. All right, he gets this one. Whoa, hold on. Really? <laughs> he might have jumped Parks. All right. <laughs> Let's go, Parks. Let's go, up his Tim's. Facts. Real quick. Black I'm about to get on the phone. Cinema. All right, Parks. Okay. Parks at Black Cinema. He didn't want to. Do I want Parks to get two points right now? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. They never let you get a 2 0 lead on my Black Brothers. Are you fucking crazy? Oh, man. At the end of Menace to Society, mm-hmm. phones down. Phones down. <laughs> at the end of Menace to Society, Kane was packing his car to move Woo. before a drive-by uh-huh. ended his life. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Ain't bank. Where was Kane moving? Oh, shit. Yeah. Come on, Fox. Uh, <laughs> Oakland. I don't know. Is that your final answer? I don't remember. Yeah. Atlanta. Yeah. It was Atlanta. It was Atlanta. Yeah. Yes, it, it was. It was Atlanta. They are moving to Atlanta. Yeah. Three people are telling you Atlanta, you're saying no? Well, if the judge is wrong, then we'll correct the record. It's Atlanta. Well, he's wrong either way. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's wrong. Yeah, That's not wrong. Oakland. It was I have Kansas. Atlanta. No, it was Atlanta. Erickson? Jada Pinkett wanted him to move with her yeah, to Atlanta. Yeah, to Atlanta. Erickson, you check. We're moving on. Ice go. Our phones are down. Ice. Phone down. <laughs> Pick your category. I'm going uh, black cinema as well. Mmm. They think it's sweet. They think no, black. They, they think. think they think black. Questions. Questions. No, they think black cinema is sweet. I thought this was and the now, hardest one. That's and now I'm gonna crack your muffins. You really up. smoking the questions? I'm gonna keep it nah, up. I only got one right so far. I ain't got none. Well, no, Atlanta. You got none right. <laughs> no, we talking about that. We knew the answers. Oh, that he's been asking. black cinema and television, the classic black show, Family Matters, oh, oh, fuck. debuted in 1989. As part of the TGIF sure, block, sure, primetime sure, block. Sure okay. Please give me the three television shows that premiered alongside it. Ooh. All three? The whole block? Yeah. Sheesh. TGIF. It wasn't before. Right, let me shut up. That's a lot. Give me the four shows to debut I think I know. the TGIF lineup. Easy, easy. Hey, hey, hey. Let me take the hey, 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 down. Hey, Voices hey, down. Hey, Phones hey, down. I want to remind the audience, nobody here has used the lifeline yet. No, nah, I'm yeah. not using a lifeline. Um, I don't know. I'm going to be honest with you. Damn, I should use the lifeline. 
I'm not gonna use a life though. I might need that. Yeah, I need the life one. Okay, we're well, moving on. What's the answer to family the matters? Family. Full, Full house, house, perfect strangers. Step by step. And nope, that came in ninety one. Uh, it debuted with just the ten of us. Well, I ain't never I even heard that. I ain't never even heard that. I don't remember that one. Yeah. Salute. Salute. Ish. 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 On the hit television show Martin, season two. Pivotal season. <laughs> in the sharing a bank account episode, mm. Martin went out and bought a big screen TV called the Hashitashi 2000. <laughs> 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 what did he pay for said TV? You mean the amount? Yeah. Dollar How much amount. did he Dollar pay amount. for the Hashitashi 2000? He's got to hit the numbers. Let's get exactly. some life in this room. Elliot, yeah, yeah, what yeah. Do you, exactly. how, do you think, how do you think our contestants are doing I so far? It's, it's, it's tough questions for them. Does he have to hit it exactly? Can yeah, he have ballpark? Like, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, Come on. Three grand? This guy's almost good. Is that your final answer? Yeah. No. <laughs> 2300 That was the discount. The original price was closer to three grand. Mm. Mm. Flip. Internet sensation. Internet yeah, flip. sensation. All right. Please. All right. An internet sensation. Himself. Himself. You know what? <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, you didn't pick that last time. No. No. He no. Black All right. I'll give you one. You my man. And we just got over a little fight. We throw you, throw you a little bone. In 2015, this a picture of this viral dress drove people insane. But there was a discrepancy. What was said discrepancy? In 2015, there was a picture of a dress that drove people crazy. Layup, the New York, boy, the New York hey, yo, boys are going crazy. The New York boys are going crazy. Flip, stop looking at, stop looking at what? Kino. <laughs> stop looking around. Yo, would you flip, like? Flip, would you, you like to use a lifeline? Would you like to use a lifeline? Brothers, come on, you fucking lifeless fucks! You dragging my show. <laughs> lifeline. All right, Melissa. No, Melissa, the Melissa Ford mm -hmm. is his Melissa. work together. Oh wow, okay. Mm -hmm. Can she help him come up Dana. with this? He tagged Big Mel. Lie. Hello? <laughs> did she say it to Yo, him what? in private and he says it? Or how does that work? How, like how, what's, okay, hold on one second. The work, like, how do you give somebody a hint? You, you, know, you, you can, can tell him the answer. answer. Tell oh, him you tell him the answer. answer. If you know it, you can tell him or the answer. Or you can lie. Or you can lie. My favorite option. Hey, and Benny the Butcher just walked in. Looking beautiful. You look beautiful, <laughs> Benny the Butcher. Wait, no, no yo, no, we're doing a show. What are oh, y'all doing? Oh, I didn't know what you said the fucking No, just, Mel, just say it if you're going to say it. What are you whispering in his ear about? The discrepancy was about the color. What a fucking Canadian. <laughs> I know, right? Aren't I? Do you believe her? Yes, I do. What about the colors? No, that's it. We got it right, man. That's it. That's it. That's it. <laughs> we got it right. That's exactly what I did. Yeah. What about the colors? Don't matter. We got it right. I can't believe that Mel would give him the right, right But hold on. Wait. Here's what the is, kicker. Here's the what? kicker. You know what? You gave it away that I was actually we're being on, honest by calling me ass. Canadian. Hey, hey, we're on your ass. Right? right? It's, your go. it's, it's your go. That's it's your go. That's what pick. you gave it away. Parks with one. Parks with one. Flip with one. I one. Newark one. boys have zero. Mel had zero. Big Benny the Butcher. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We're playing a game show right now. We love you. Glad you're here. Album and stories. I know you're doing the runs. We're getting right to you. Or you can come sit with us somewhere. Uh, huh? Where's the shit on the Benny, don't do that, man. Don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. I only wore it because I knew you was coming. 
know. That's that's only because I knew you was That is a fucking lie. We're going to talk lie. about it. We're going to talk about it. Now, now for I'm on your fucking head. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe that happened. Pick a, I'm tight. <laughs> I'm not but that was the, I had that question here to give somebody a point. Mel Ford, I'm not gonna pick your I'm category. Tight. What was your first category? Black uh, cinema. Black so cinema. you cannot pick black cinema. Music, co- musical covers. Musical covers. This Melissa Ford. I already know this category because Joe going to be an asshole. I know. I'm anticipating. I this one. I'm fucking anticipating this shit. Case Missing You mm. is a cover originally re- released on this artist's London album. Who is that artist? Tim Pendergrass. Missing You. Case Missing You. She answered. She answered. Is that your final answer? Yes. You are incorrect. I figured. The answer is Joe. Missing You Joe. is a Joe song. Shout out to Joe. Parks. Really? Yes. Later in the broadcast, I'll play it for your little Canadian ears. Did we check the <laughs> Mr. Society answer? Was it Atlanta or I Kansas? I did not did know we that. We haven't gotten confirmation. We'll get it's confirmation. We'll get it. It's Atlanta, though. It's Atlanta. Parks, we're on you. I only got one left. Music, musical that. covers. Oh, musical fair. covers. You got two points? No, no, no. He, you one. can't pick, oh, the, same you can't pick the same category. You're right, you're right, you're right. No. The lone cover on Brandy's Never Say Never album is what? I don't know. Uh, Lifeline. There you go. Yay! There you go. We got a Lifeline. This guy's good. I don't even know that song. You, you're asking me what the picture is? No, no cover, what's the cover? cover. cover She's got song. one cover oh, oh, song. Um, cover song. I'm going musical covers. That's the only one I could choose. Fuck. Um, Single Park's got two options. Three options. Listen, you got a bullet in your foot? I don't know, yo. I'm sorry. That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. I don't know. Well, Brian Adams. Everything I do, I do it for you. Wow. Wow. Mm. Shout out Brandy. Right, Joe, no way gonna th- come on, man. Stop it, man. Oh, shit. I thought you had some hard ass questions. That's my Ice. Ice. Fellow Canuck. Musical covers. Musical covers. Prince, <laughs> Tank, and Will Downing all have this very classic song in common. Along with some other artists, Bonnie Raitt being one. It's quite a few. What? Is the name of that song? Oh fuck! Um, Lifeline, Big Ish, right there. No, I think. Uh, really distinguished panel I, hey, we fam. have here for you guys today. <laughs> so <laughs> so, so, well, so I don't know, bro. So I well versed. You started with Prince. I definitely don't know. So knowledgeable. You started with Prince. I don't know. I don't know. I have no idea. Star Spangled Banner. Yo, <laughs> and it might all perform the It's the last song on Diamonds and Pearls on that album. I don't remember that track list, but the very last song. I uh, I can't make you love me. Oh, there we go. Salute to them. Oh, maybe not. Ish. Who's uh, is that. it? Bonnie Raitt's song originally. It might, she might have covered it from somebody too. Okay, because that's what I was thinking. I, 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 gotta, I know I gotta, her. She was one of the, the earlier most. versions. I yeah, do covers. That's the cover. Huh? I got to do cover. Oh, <sighs> you guys. <laughs> Some hard Damn, this question. This is too easy, right here. Yeah. I'm never giving Ish that. It must be a Jay Z question. Well, that was too easy. <laughs> <laughs> well, Luther. Mm. You know what? Fuck it, man. Let's throw a bone. This classic Aaliyah record mm. peaked at number six on the Billboard Hot 100. What is that record? Um, that rock the boat shit. Mm-mm-mm. Is that your final answer? Yes. That's not even a cover. <laughs> <laughs> your no. Best. Oh. Mm. Well, that is the answer. That is the correct oh. answer. Fuck. Oh God! I ain't know that. Flip. <laughs> I like got music covers, right? Give me that one, right? I should have knew that. 
Is that where he is? E- yeah. Yes. Everybody got to go yes. through the, yeah, every yeah, category. Yeah. Except Parks. Damn. At your best. Fuck, man. At your best. Mm-hmm. You a bird for that, son. You should have <laughs> gave me that. <laughs> now you should have gave me the dress question. Yeah. Oh, you okay. You do that shit up. Damn, per- where did they go in Minnesota Society question? We do have to break. Okay. We do have to break because we have a guest. Very special Man, guest. Benny. Uh-oh. Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, we have one of my favorite MCs. Blessed us with his presence in 2024. He did a couple other shows too, but them shits don't count for nothing. <laughs> we here, man. Upstate Ladies and building. gentlemen, Biddy the Butcher in the building. The Butcher it go. All right, all right. Let's turn this my off. Music. Benny yeah, the feel Butcher. Like Happy New Year, everybody. Benny. Happy New Year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Happy New Year. Damn, don't do that. Stop. Don't pick your wrist up. Stop. <laughs> if you do that, the sun is already shining. It's tough Stop. to see. Stop. Last time, last time I seen Benny, we was on the Grammy red carpet together. You know what I mean? Yes, we were. Mm. Yes, we were. Stunt. Little, That's it. Little flat. Stunt. It felt good to see you. Good to see you, man. You know I'm saying. Or did y'all win? No. I ain't win shit. Yeah, we, <laughs> we had a good time. Balance. Yeah. Balance. Balance. Yeah, that's hate. That's hate. That's hate, that's that's hate support. That's, that's hate support. That's, that's that Elliot shit. That's that Elliot shit. Hate support. Stop, man. Hate support. Benny, how you feeling? What's going on? What's new? Who who do you hate right now? Who do you want to fucking diss in a verse? What's going on? Project out. Come on. Nope. Talk to uh, me. Oh, man. I'm feeling good. It's New Year. Just dropped a single. Pull the mic closer. Saying? Just dropped a single. The Braun Joint. Uh, album uh, January 26th, my first Def Jam album, my first album on Def Jam. I'm feeling good. Uh, I love everybody. I hate a lot of niggas too. I want to <laughs> I wanna, I wanna diss a lot of niggas, but I ain't going to be messy. You there know what I'm saying? I ain't, get, I ain't get here for that. There you know what I'm saying? Go. I wait till they play with me first. There you go. I'm just chilling, man. Enjoying this shit, man. Enjoying Word. the ride. How much pressure on you? Mm, from a one to 10, I say about a seven. And that's pressure. That's pressure. I ain't going to say it's a lot of pressure on myself, but I know. It's people looking at me, but I deliver under pressure all the time. Ain't like I'm, ain't like I'm trying to compete with Beatles numbers. <laughs> I just gotta, I just gotta take what we do to another level, and that's I'm definitely gonna do it. I feel like that's already done. You're doing it. You're doing it. Right. I feel like that's already done. The you singles I mean? you have dropped, you can mm-hmm. hear it. You can hear a difference. You know what I'm saying? Your brothers have definitely switched it up. Yeah, they have. Sonically, they just have on their on their projects. When I say pressure, I'm even speaking to that. Like, how much pressure is it to live up to the Griselda bar? Mm. I don't, honestly, I don't think I don't think it's a lot of pressure because we are the Griselda bar. You know what I'm saying? I, f- I feel like a lot of people forget that. You know what nah, I'm saying? Nah, niggas stole y'all shit. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> a lot of niggas stole the shit, so they so they forget it. it the shit is watered down crazy. Oh, dear. But I believe we are the Griselda bar. All Absolutely. I got to do is get in there with Derringer, Alchemist, and, you know, the shit just takes over us. You know what I'm saying mm-hmm. it, it, it does it it does its own work you know what I mean honestly when when is it when are you trying to come pause yeah pause <laughs> on that one uh, yeah that was good. January 26th yeah I'm dropping yeah. oh you here yeah uh-huh. it's, See? it's right around the corner you know what I'm saying oh, it's, it's right around the corner oh, I ain't drop an album in two years in two years you know what I'm saying in my off time I, I got a gold record and I got an Emmy you know what I'm saying and I don't even I'm not really Heavy in the, in the TV shit, but I'm, I'm about to be, but I, nigga got an Emmy in. And that's my off year. You know what I'm saying? This shit that people got to pay attention to. My God, so, so that's why I feel the pressure. EGOT, you know what I mean? Shit. <laughs> that's what for. The Emmy for uh, something mean Deion Dawkins did, uh, they had, uh, basically speaking on the shoot in the Buffalo at the grocery store. Mm. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Man, we did it with the Buffalo Bills, so shout out to them. Shout out to dope. Doc. Congrats. You know what I mean? So, but I was saying is basically the pressure on me to take what we do as Griselda, as a collective, to another level. I feel like I've done that. I agree with that. I agree with that. Damn. That's Come on, man. Ask me some hard shit. To <laughs> it's tough to not be messy. No, I'm it's very tough. The, the mess is in I live in the mess. <laughs> it's, I'm just it's, fucking with it's you. It's right there, especially when you talk about positivity in, in, in Buffalo. Yeah, man. You know, uh, you know this, the, the, the negative shit come find you. Mm. you know how, do, how do you deal with that shit? You know what I'm saying? Cause motherfuckers be on your ass. He go, he go to it. Yeah, he okay. runs, he runs head on towards it. He go to <laughs> it. He the negativity that that finds people. Just like you go to it too, though. You go to it. What do with ninety yeah, niggas? Like, yeah, nigga. <laughs> Stores and shit. Somehow, when it bumps into you, I know, I know, you I have people flip, with you. Flip gonna do it. You got dog. Yeah, you got it. You know, yo, people say that about me, Benny. But honestly, like I'm in my Zen era now. Mm-hmm. 
Like all that shit that niggas say, I'm rubbing your glue. Like that shit bounced right. Mm -hmm. I get up and get to the work. I get to my family. I go to my kids' school mm -hmm. and fucking talk to the other dads about bullshit like soccer and you just started. Like you, just, you just started doing that. Don't yeah, yeah, like, don't like, stay on that hill, nigga. You just got to that hill. You at the entrance. Twenty twenty four. Okay. Oh, okay. Twenty twenty four. I'm yeah, not. Turned over a new leaf. Yeah, I'm got not. It, I'm, it, not I'm not. I'm not. I'm not punching down. I spent too many years punching down. Like I'm mm -hmm. on some frequency energy energy vibe type. Shit is where I'm on it. Yeah. What are you looking to do different in 2024? Oh man, just like the album car, everybody can't go. I'm I'm narrowing my focus. You know what I'm saying? Even mm -hmm. even even if it might not seem like it to everybody, I take it back to to this shit. The first time, you know, a lot of people heard of me was on your show in 2016. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's 2024. A nigga really been in the mud and, and creating opportunities and hustling and making a name for myself for eight years. You know what I'm saying? Close to eight years. So it's like, man, I'm narrowing my focus. I'm focusing back on myself. Uh, same thing. Old boring dad shit. You know what I'm saying? I love it. You know what I'm saying? You know, just chilling more of the family and more just focused on the business and, and not the politics of the shit. You know what I'm saying? Everybody can go. Sound like we cut a couple niggas off. The entourage was much smaller coming in today than it was. Than it was free before. Because Some niggas might have cut, no, no, we cut, we cut a lot of niggas off. Guy. He said it. People cut themselves off. And that goes for family, friends, uh, business associates, uh, even me, it's habits and it's traits that I got mm -hmm. that I can't move forward with, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? And another thing, when the niggas say everybody can't go, we also gotta focus on the people that can go. Word. You can't focus on right. the people that's, that's not that's in the room. That's right. real that's right. shit. The people that's in the room after somebody make a statement like that, you know what I'm saying? Well, yeah, mm -hmm. we, I know that by picking out my list of who can't go. 100%. We're going to try to pick the niggas that I'm down to travel with. You know I mean? got a question for you. In 2024, are you um, giving more grace? Meaning, like, are you going to let, like, tweets or p things that niggas say just go above your head and not approach it head on anymore? No, you know? he's still going to tweet. Flip, Hold I'm going to try. I'm going to try, Flip. Please, yeah. yeah. I'm going to try. And did you pay? And did you pay? Was the, rest, was the restaurant compensated? You know, you know, I'm, I'm pocket watching. <laughs> was the restaurant compensated? Was oh a lot going Jesus on? A lot of, a lot of, I, I pocket watch, nigga. You can't come in here like that, nigga. Did you compensate the restaurant? I got a problem with that, nigga. Who you think you are, man? Nigga? I, Shaking shit up. I Uber eats, man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm moving on. Look, I'm learning from y'all. <laughs> Betty, what's the difference uh, creating with like Def Jam oh. behind you as opposed to doing it independently? How y'all been doing it for so long? It's, 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 it's a lot of hands in the pot because uh -huh. it's a lot of different departments and me mm -hmm. being a person who came up independently I got I got my own staff mm -hmm. the Griselda staff uh, Rock Nation mm -hmm. and Agent 78 it's, I, I got a lot of people with me you know what I'm saying but does that make it hard does it muddy the water does it make it more difficult Like not, not to me be, to be honest with you maybe for the uh, staff because you know what I'm saying they got to go through a lot of people, but to me it, it, it's perfect. They're letting I, you do what you want to do. I got more people that. doing. I got more people working for me, but hell yeah, they let me do what I want to do. And people been asking me that lately. They, do they really be getting in the room with these niggas and telling these niggas how to do it and what to do? Yes, they, yes. They absolutely. Yes. They they, do that with they, me. They man. fold like barbecue chairs in there. Damn. They get you go right in there with what you got. So you and they say no, we're not going to do that. We're doing this. You yeah. had complete creative control. Complete com creative control. That's I'm dope. surprised that people surprised at that. You know what I'm saying? What I always say is, man. You know, they ain't come and get me off a, off a street corner. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I was on a street corner at the gas station at a point in time. Maybe if they would have came and got me for that, I would have signed for 30 albums. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but that yeah. wasn't the case. Like we right. did. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But that wasn't the case. And I think they respect that. And that's why I love Dev Jam so much. Uh, they let me pick my producers, let me do everything. Nobody sat me in a room and said, yo, you need to do a song like this. You ever thought about this? Uh, not saying they would have been wrong for it, because maybe I, I could have... That could have helped me, you know what mm. I'm saying? Mm. I'm not, uh, I'm not, I'm not like close ears to nothing like that. But mm. they ain't didn't do it. Also, I mean, respectfully, is I don't know if Def Jam today is in a position to try to change someone's <laughs> creative direction. Mm. Mm. Like if they yeah. tried to do that today, I might fucking throw their roster in their face and say, "Mind your fucking business." Yeah, some some people might not be with that, but they just like helped me amplify what I already was going to do. You know what I'm saying. That's dope. Talk That's to fine. me about the difficulties that come with managing personalities as a label head. Uh, you said manage your personality as far as what? As, as a label head. Like, you got your own niggas that you got. Oh, yeah, about. as a label. Oh, oh it's tough. It's tough. Uh, I'm doing my thing. I'm responsible for people's careers. And me, I love I love to be in the midst of it, so I keep signing artists. <laughs> <You know what laughs> I keep doing that shit. Or 
Uh, it's hard, but what I do is, this is one thing, I'm, I'm, I'm more of a blueprint than I am of a, a teacher. I'm a leader more than a boss, you know what I'm saying? So, so I show by, you know what I'm saying? By, Lead by example. By design, uh, you know what I mean? I yeah. let people know, this is what we're doing, this is what this built off of, and I let everybody follow the path. And, and how they do it is how they do it, you know what I'm saying? I make sure everybody got situations, all my artists got independent deals at, at companies, you know what I'm saying? And they open, I take them all on tour with me, uh, all do merch, and you know I'm saying? Whatever they wanna do. It's about how hard they go, and what they, yeah. how, where they see themselves at in this shit. You still speak to Paul? Yeah. Man, hell yeah, man. I seen, I seen Paul uh, a few weeks ago, and then he was just telling me, like, yo, man, congratulations on everything. And, and that meant a lot to me. I ain't going to lie. That meant a lot to me because I wanted nothing more but to be signed to Shady Records at a point in time. You know what I'm saying? Watching them boys do their thing. I just knew that my time was coming, so a nigga was almost noticing was they, was they paying attention to what I was doing over there. You know what I'm saying? Mm. But I know it's all love, and you know what I mean? You talk to Paul lately? <laughs> <laughs> no. Man, he's but, proud of you, though. I'm but pretty I, sure. I'm, I'm sure he is. But I'm happy that you spoke to him. Salute, mm -hmm. salute to anybody that's helped me along the way. Yeah, 100%, man. 100%. Real shit. Tell y'all these niggas mad I'm growing up. Look, 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 look. They mad. They mad I won't give them some mess. You spoke to Paul. There is no mess. That's Yo, the mess. Right. That's the mess. Right. Thank right. you to Fuck everybody that helped along the way, along the journey. Mm -hmm. It was rough. Sometimes I was rough and maybe thought y'all was rough. But today, right. we don't get here to today. Man, without, it's hard, man. Without like, all of those lessons. Doing this shit and like people feeling like they're responsible for your success. Mm. And, and, and a lot of people don't see the work that you put in because it's, when you come up under some somebody, it's like these huge figures we come up in who got resumes longer than mine or whoever's. And people be like, man, this person that did this for you, you only this because of that. I'm like, man, you out your fucking mind. Mm, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Well, that people say that? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, they say mm. that. Nigga, they ain't write the raps. Fuck you talking about? Shit. And why they ain't create that other nigga over there if it was so easy? That ain't never mattered. <laughs> Word. That ain't never mattered. Never mattered. Shit. Yeah. Yeah, You'll be on some bullshit. Make another hole. What What do you think the most grueling part of? I don't want to say the come up for you because mm -hmm. you're you've arrived, but just the struggle of being someone home that wants to be an artist that's trying to figure it out amidst all of this streaming shit, mm -hmm. amidst all of the fucking budgets being cut, fucking just all the shenanigans going on out there. Like, what do you think is the toughest part of that? And, bo and what was the <laughs> toughest part for you? Man, the toughest part for, for the new, for the artists that's coming up is the, to, to realize what to focus on. Because to me, it's like, it's, when you jump in this game, it's, it's two different sides. You got the lit side, and you got the side that, uh, that really matters. The artsy side. You know what I'm saying? The shit that really right. matters. So you could, it's, it's certain uh, podcasts or shows that people want to go on, but them shit's not punching. And there's certain shits that you could go on and, and it really matters. And there's certain artists you could work with, you need to work with this artist. That ain't gonna do nothing for me. Even, I don't give a fuck how lit he is. And you could work with a lesser known artist and it'll mean way more. So it's like, people yeah. don't know what to focus on. A lot of people chasing a the lit, they chasing the lime, like, mm -hmm. but you know what I mean? It's like, <laughs> you gotta know what to focus on. It's definitely a gray area too, where some, where some things get you both. Mm -hmm. So it's like, try, learning what to focus on. Like I be seeing niggas, who just want to do a feature in a, in a, in a, in a music beat and a picture with me be more important than the music. I'm like, nah, nigga, mm, got it that ain't it. You're wildin'. Are you still doing brown bag verses? I am. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 What the fuck you talking about, dude? Bro, I used to sell cocaine. Nigga come yeah, from. Word, that's what the nigga sell cocaine. What the fuck you talking about? I ain't mad. Not at all. I wasn't trying to say stop it. No, nigga. My yeah. whole career, I did brown bag verses. <laughs> Shit, yeah, man. Yeah, and, and, and that's another thing, you know, they try to act like, they try to shame a nigga into, into getting money. Nigga gonna get money. Like me, like right now you can get a, you can get a verse from me for $15,000 from Benny the Butcher. But if you, if you hit me up on the right date, you think I'm not taking seven thousand dollars? Ten word. Uh, uh, five thousand dollars. I got a wife and kids. They got a job. I got shit to right. for less. <laughs> I got did hit under cars for less. You crazy? Man, God bro. gave me this talent to, to chew off of it, and we gonna sit down at the table, man. Word. That's it. That brown bag money do feel good. It's nice, it man. It's not, I missed miss the days a little bit. What? I still get a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I say no to a lot of shit though. Somebody hit me like, yo. I think a nigga said he want the song and video for eight thousand. I'm like, you wildin' now, my dog. Wait, wait what? <laughs> we ain't doing that. A song and video for eight thousand. I mean, we ain't doing that. 
Oh no! Nah, let me let me send you my iPhone footage of me. Performing. <laughs> 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 yeah, AI, 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 AI butcher. Fuck AI, 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 let me send you cartoon Benny yeah. for this one. <laughs> Go to get to the fuck they talking about. See, that's the thing. I like the brown bag, but we're talking to them niggas now. You gotta have a middle person. Cause them niggas always wanna build about the song. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Them <laughs> no. Niggas, them the niggas who wanna let you know before they do the verse, before they send you the money, they wanna let you know they a real nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You know what I'm doing is I'm let a real nigga. Like, yo, know this where this money came from. Yeah, I'm I don't nigga. care, no my rap nigga. nigga. Yeah. I know where it's going. <laughs> real shit. Don't give me no bullshit back, bro. <laughs> So how are you dealing with family members that assume your wealth to be more than it is that want to borrow money every other day? Mm. Mm. I just saw Fabio talking to Meek about that, and it was interesting to me. How I deal with that? Man, that's hard dealing with it. I'm going to be honest with you. I apologize to anybody watching this. Sometimes I just don't answer the phone. That's oh, that's real spill right there. No, yeah. that's self-preservation right there. I mean, I might just... like that, huh? You know what I mean? I might just not even answer the text back. Because people don't realize. I come from a... A big family, right? Uh, I got a few businesses. I got a lot of artists, and it's, it's just not there. And people don't realize I'm in my hustling mode. In this game, the first ten years is about like building, about building. Yeah. Now, after that ten year mark, then you start making some real money. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So people don't understand that. They see the jewelry, they see the cars, they see the house. You know, a nigga is doing great for itself. I wake up every day like, wow. But it's like it's it's more ground to cover. They don't realize that because their goal was what the watch cost it. They go mm. was what the bins cost it. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So they don't realize that it's like, man, I'm still digging. I don't, I don't know what you thought. <laughs> Plus, I like to spend money. Oh yeah. So yeah, I talk, like to spend money. Shit. So it's like I, I rather I rather do something with my shit than give it to somebody who ain't gonna do nothing with it. Oh, hold up, mm. hold up. Wait, wait. You like to spend that money there? I mean, you like to spend it. Of course, when you give it to them, they're gonna do something with it, but they're not gonna do what you may do with it. Yeah, it's your shit, or the money. Let me explain this to you. Yes, please. Wait, listen, let me explain this to you. When, when you when you got somebody, what? Listen, let me say this first though. People treat this rap money different because it ain't because it ain't from the dope game. Now, if I got this money from the dope game, niggas wouldn't ask me for nothing because they know like this nigga done dodged twenty felonies mm -hmm, today mm -hmm. for that. I see what you're saying. You know what I'm saying? So that's another thing that's uh, offensive that they think the money is. It ain't shit. Like, you, nigga, that. you just wrapped the verse for that. Yeah. Like, damn. I don't you know miss what that. I mean? so that yeah. But they think that about that. street money, too. All that easy-ass money. You yeah, like, they what? Do, but but, the, but the, so, some people know. Like, some yeah, people respect some people. it. That's true. So it's like this. If you if you somebody, if you somebody leading your team, and, and, and you put, and you providing opportunities, and you put, uh, creating shit that people, nobody around them ever did for them. None of the, nobody you know ever did this for you. And we got the homie doing this for us. And it's people knocking at his door and he don't get it. He, he, he fucking with us. He could be hustling with anybody, mm -hmm. he fucking with us. When I provide you opportunity, you have a responsibility to mm -hmm. do something to it, got to it. do something with it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or, or, or if you don't, take the little handouts. Yo, bro, I need 1500, take those. And don't be mad with those. Yeah, go get yourself a Whopper Junior. And then, uh, and then when that six figure check come in, <laughs> <laughs> and, we, and, I, and I open up the door and say like, yo, and I call them names in and break that bread up and your name not called, you can't be mad. Oh, wait, now you can't do that while they in the, Are they here? Are they present? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they hear you not calling in. You know what I mean. Everybody else, yo, come, we break this down right now. Not y'all, Not y'all. Stay over there. I, I call I you in a, a little bit. Yo, we'll be back. I ain't start coming. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean, though. They definitely can't be in a room. I'm saying? They definitely can't. They don't get called to that meeting, but you can't be mad when you got people who busting their ass to, to help this shit move further and you not. You just got to take the little side. It's the, co the commitment. To co yeah. The commitment and seeing it grow. And that's what, oh, Joe, yeah. you know, real quick, Joe and I had a conversation about that where he said that sometimes, well, a lot of, he don't give a fuck about loyalty. He care about the commitment to make the brand grow because sometimes people feel because you're loyal to them, you're obligated to do something for them. So Joe was the first nigga to tell me, yo, Flip, I don't care about loyalty because you may have a friend that was loyal to you for the whole year, for years, and he's a bum. And mm -hmm. every time you give him money, he just keep coming and coming, but because he's loyal to you. nothing about that loyalty. So the commitment, mm -hmm. that really changed my perspective mm -hmm. of things. It's like, fuck the loyalty. Now, I, I care about, if you committed to the yeah. work, if you committed to seeing this brand that. grow. I know people mm -hmm. that, that are so committed. We ain't the best of friends, but I know if they on the job and I'm on the job, oh, shit. We yeah. out of here. NBA mm -hmm. Jam, me and, me and that person. Mm -hmm. Now, the opposite, I know people that are so loyal that because they loyal, they feel like they don't have to commit and they don't have to do the job. Mm -hmm. Loyalty is a commitment they look at. Yep. Yeah, mm -hmm. and I'm cool know, with that. You, that could, you could go be loyal to one of them other niggas down the street. Mm -hmm. I'm cool. Yeah. Well, we over here to get to work. Life is short and uh -huh. fragile. The fuck? That triggered me just now with some of that shit. Nah, that's <laughs> it. Yeah, that's real shit. Like stupid, yo. Hit that spot on. It's
All right, so tell me, come on, tell me about what I can expect from this album. I hate that yes. question, but uh, nah, not it's when it's people good. I like listening Man, you to. You can expect this shit to be refined uh, hustler street music. You mm. know what I'm saying? And you know, this is my lane, and, and I do this shit well, mm. and I love it. Like I say, to take what I do to the next level. Mm. What does that look like? But that looks like Hit Boy, Hit Boy production. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Anybody know Hit Boy had me in my bag. No doubt. Mm -hmm. uh, that also, that also. You gonna get him away from his dad? Yeah, yeah. I, I, they I, banging. I, I got shit with Big Hit. They too. banging right now. And when he walked past the mirror. I bang on myself. I bang on myself. I bang on myself. Hey. hey. Shit, Look, don't hate. Don't hate. Don't hate. These Shout niggas hate. Hey. No <laughs> hate. That's a lot of hit. banging. That's my man. You know what I'm saying? And, and and it looks like uh, Alchemist production. Mm -hmm. I always do go with Alchemist. I ain't, I ain't go get them by mistake. I went to go get the people who I've been the most successful with, uh, with the highest budgets I've been <laughs> I've been given. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Just to take Deadpool. what I do to the next level, and that's what we've been doing. You know that's gotta be nice too to go back to people that you've been building you with for a minute, the and, and now I got a budget, bro. Yeah. The same niggas who was shooting my videos. <laughs> Uh -huh. Before, when I was paying them out my pocket, yeah. you know, I linked them with Def Jam, huh? Call this number. Fire. Mm -hmm. I'm saying, tell them Blocko sent you. You take, um, <laughs> you take, Fire. Any, you now, take any risks? Now you know well, who's not that's paying you. Yeah, I took risks. I took risks. Risk. Something outside your normal. Yes, I did. You got the grill record on there? No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be. I need any, a Benny the Butcher Benny Girl Butcher record. album if I wasn't scaring the holes. <laughs> some type of level. Yeah. I do oh. need a Benny the Butcher Girl record. My next one. Come on. Your, both album. of your brothers is girl recording me to death. Come here, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> fire. Fire. That's fire when he did that. I do need one. I need, I need one girl uh, from you. Man, nah, yeah. I'm, I'm going to get one. It's, it's kind of Because Drake bullshitted. We were out of here. You had a tad your joint. Yeah, well, I was out of here. I was out of here. No, but that was out of here. Out of here. I was yeah, going to do that, that. That was a good one. I'll be doing all the bitch records right now you can think of. <laughs> <laughs> Come with me. <laughs> Um, how man. can you speak to how tough it is in this business being a faithful black man, or can you speak to the bitches? Uh, One I'm, or the other. I'm gonna speak to both. I'm gonna speak on the men. I'm gonna speak on the men first. Uh, me personally, it's definitely hard. You have to. You have to. Like that's why it's hard for the athletes and shit, man. I'm gonna say that because you know them, them guys been in school. You know what I'm saying, and they had to pick at a litter with the with the with the school girls the and Beckys. shit. Now now when they get out of school, it's all type of it's all type of. Them, 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 it's all type of chicks on yeah, the animals. Vultures. See, those guys from the streets, you know what I'm saying? Those dope boys, we've been used to that a little bit. So it's kind of that's why I, that's why I married my wife. You know what I'm saying to help to help keep me going straight. You know what I'm saying? Come, come on, on, come on, come on. Yeah. Come on, come on a lot of married men in the building yep. today. Right. Shout to y'all. Oh, I got some. Where my married brothers at? Married? I'm married. L married. Okay. Parks married. Yes, sir. 18. That, that's yeah. it. That's the oh, end. I love oh, it. Oh, no flip, man. No, flip, no, Mary. flip, Mary. No, I pointed to flip. Oh. But that's the way to listen. That's fire. It's open for that. You know what I'm saying? She out here. She ain't come. She it's a good four of y'all in a room full of like 20 men. <laughs> four of y'all made the jump. Now nah, it's good, man. Y'all boys got to get down on that knee, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. yeah. Get down yeah. on that knee, brothers. I'm not opposed to it. I told you my. You got a girlfriend? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You always got a beautiful girlfriend. You know that. She cool. <laughs> She's cool. She's cool. <laughs> and thank you. I, I appreciate that. I told her to call a lawyer. I'm, I'm cool. lawyer up. Come on, let's, let's write it down. You Come can't on. get none of my shit, even <laughs> if I do. <laughs> you see, and you then see, I'm ready uh, to go. You seen what Spostra just did? Uh, yeah, hardest yeah. shit in the world. Ooh, hardest crazy. hardest that shit in the world. Clap it up for the Miami Heat. Miami Heat. Classy, classy organization. For the people out there that don't know, Eric Spolster was going through a divorce. Uh, the Miami Heat waited for the divorce to be final before they presented him with the largest record contract. Breaking, record breaking. Record breaking. $120 million. For eight years. Hell yeah. Oh, shit. And that's how it's supposed to be done. Or get Basically, right he said, bitch, take all of that. You know what I'm saying? Take this and start my new life. You know what I mean? Support like that. That's nice. What? Word. Nice. Go Eric Spolster. What? In Go Miami, heat. too. <laughs> and she used to be uh, one of the cheerleaders for the Heat. Oh, I didn't know that. A word? Yeah, she used to be one of the Chile. That's how they met. Thing. Swag. That's how they met. Oh. That's exactly the woman that you're supposed to marry, milk to the useless, get your money without them, and then go on and do and something better. And there's no state better. tax down there? Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> Can't knock you. What the hell? What'd what? you think of that? <laughs> oh, Big Mel. Oh, Big Mel. <laughs> <laughs> Big Mel. Yeah, let's let it fly. <laughs>
Uh, but I'm not, uh, opposed, I'm not opposed to marriage. Uh, we got some guys, some brothers in here that may be getting married soon. Just a few of us. A few of us man, in That's here. beautiful, man. Join the club. Join the you club. Gotta, you got you to... Gotta, David Yerman just emailed you, right? Yes, they did, man. Come on. Give it up they for did. Ice. I don't know how that happened. Give it up for Ice. Ice. Give it up for that's Ice. That's nice. And Zales. Okay. Mm -hmm. You shot yes. <laughs> little birdie, Every kiss a little birdie told with us K. that you on the market, so let's talk. I was mm -hmm. like, all right. Yeah, you Still Ice? Ish? What's up? It's good to see you. Likewise. <laughs> it's, just, it's just good to see you. That's Likewise, all. my brother. I, I don't want no smoke. You heard 21 album yet? I did. Fire. It's fire. Yeah. Do you get in the zone? It's fire. But do you get in the zone where when it's when it's my time to come out, I ain't really listening to none of these other niggas. I don't want that shit to be on my brain as I'm working, as I'm rapping, as I'm moving around. Sometimes. Sometimes. But uh, lately... I ain't been like that. Last couple years, I ain't been like that because it's like it's a it's it's a season. I'm excited. Everybody dropping music. Mm -hmm. I'm excited when people drop around when I drop because that that worked for me over the years. People always say, "Man, don't drop." When man, that helped me so much. Is when 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 the top artists drop when I when I really was a known like that dropping. I became, I got in a conversation. That's how I got in a conversation because mm. they see me mm. dropping that day and it was good quality music dropping on the same day as your favorite artist. So people appreciated that. So I like when niggas drop around my time. That's what I used to say. Like, I don't understand why you'll push your shit back. Yeah. Like, I think if you put your shit out on the same day that somebody else put their shit out, it's like, oh, damn, his shit came out too? I'm going to grab Fuck it. Yeah, 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 let me grab it. That's both. how I think. That's, That's how what I think. my brain When I go on. shop and buy albums, I buy two or three at a time. Same. Mm -hmm. the mic. Oh shit! Like, yeah, that's, that, that's what I used to say, but they explained to me otherwise. Who are you a fan of right now? <sighs> Who am I a fan of right now, man? All the '90s niggas. Yeah, I'm trying to not name none of them niggas right now. <laughs> who who I've been listening to right now? It's like it's kind of like people that that's not on the radar. Uh, like I always be saying, Trench Runner, Pooty all the time. Uh, Ot the real. I listen to that a lot. And I be listening to old shit, Rick James and I was gonna say I was, I was gonna Future, yeah. Buffalo, yeah. old Future, uh, what's in there? Old Jeezy, that's what I'm listening to right now. That. Old Nas, I mean it's like I love the new music. I listen to that all the time too. But just Some in passing, old. Sexy Red, I can't, I can't. You know what I'm saying? I, I listen yeah. to Sexy Red all the time. But it's like I don't really get a lot from it. You know what I'm saying? So nah, like, like I, we ain't never met, but before I even know who you was, I'm like yo. Remember I, used to I know you like, said oh, this, this nigga right here. This is my mm -hmm. bag. That nine, it sound like you fell so, off a clue tape. So you was a mm -hmm. fan mm -hmm. before yeah. you met him. Yeah, I appreciate that. And I be, that, nigga. I be doing cool shit. shit. Yo, yo, what the fuck you doing, <laughs> you nigga? Ass, nigga? Yo, yeah, but, no, it just, it just, just yo, yeah, 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 shit sound like you fell off a clue tape. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Oh, and that's shit. I'm 47. That's where we come from. Mm. No, that's a that slow all of that, that shit right there. Oh, I would have been honored for you to be a part of that whole clue. Yeah, tape. like oh, that's what don't sound like that. Yeah, yeah keep it crazy. Crazy. Yeah. That don't sound like that. I'd have been trying I'm to. I'd be, be doing cool <laughs> shit. I'd be, be riding in the back of these trucks. I'd be pulling up in my whips and shit. Like I gotta have shit that hit. You know what I'm saying? It's like none of the shit. Sometimes you know you can put the song on before you pull up. Y'all still do that, right? <laughs> uh, I don't no, go to them I, places I, no more, but I, 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 I know, I know, I know the feeling. Yes. yes. Come on. Yo, you cut your lights you gotta, on? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, you got to have your thing. You don't cut your lights on. What you mean? Yeah, you outside more than me. Back in the day, nigga, we used to put, put you stop at the corner, you set the shit to the song, <laughs> mm -hmm. right? And the, let out, we cut the lights on. Oh, that's what you do? See, that's what I do. I, I, you're talking 20, about the 80s. That's 25 years ago. <laughs> you're talking about the 80s. You're talking about the 80s. You're talking about the Jets. I'm like, I'm like, right all the way there. I'm cut the... No. I'm like Pe right Peppermint the Lounge. With the, with the top up. Yes, but as soon as I get five minutes, 20 minutes minutes, I put the top down. Yeah, exactly. Play my shit. So you don't got to cut the lights on with the top down. Exactly. You know what I mean? So it's, so it's like, none of that shit give me the feeling. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm pulling up banging Hove. I'm pulling up banging DMX. Mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? I'm pulling up banging that shit. Uh, I don't know if you have been keeping up with the Young Thug trial, but mm -hmm. you mentioned listening to artists' older songs. And the other day, uh, they played Lifestyle. They Ooh, did. That's the, shit. In the club. Yeah, in, in the club. Turn room. Turn up sound. That was a moment. <laughs> Didn't that, that shit was, sound? Ooh. That shit was slapping yeah. in the court. Yeah. They played that shit in the court. I don't know. They played it in the court. Yeah. Yo, and, and, and yo, the lawyer was like yo, this real quick. I don't know how they sat there trying to keep a straight <laughs> face. <laughs> and doing that shit was. I did a lot of shit. Did the thing. Did the I'm looking at Thug like, nigga, it's slapping. That's your shit. You make that move, nigga. Nod something. I don't know. Stoic in there. Yeah. See, That's I need crazy. my shits to sound like that when they come on during my Rico case. Yeah, right. <laughs> during my... That's crazy. What's it the fuck? Hold on, like, Rico case for yourself? No personal well, shits. Well, I'm not... I, I obey the law. 
So just making sure. If they're getting me on a recall, that ain't stopped them before. <laughs> There's some people inside that obey. Uh, they've been giving rap niggas. The they've been giving rap niggas Rico cases, and they've been giving the moguls sex Ricos lately. Sex Rico. Sex yeah. Rico's is a bad motherfucker. Sex Rico's. That's where you're spooky. Yeah. <laughs> that's where you're spooky at. Now I shot you down. Bang, bang. <laughs> <laughs> the Sex Rico. <laughs> Yikes. That's crazy. Yo. You can't laugh at that. <laughs> For real. You can't laugh at that. That's what, they, that's what it means. That's what it means, though. Yeah. Yeah. Sex, sex Rico. Sex, sex, sex Rico. That is, you the can't laugh. Fans. That's but the sex fans. That's crazy. Yeah. And they be snitching in the sex Ricos, too. And that shit work. Hey, yo, fam. That, that shit work. Is that work. the only pl place you can snitch at? On the, on the sex Rico? People don't seem to mind that snitching. Yeah. <laughs> It'd be I did not do that. It'd be all types of people. I don't like, yeah. think, think it's called snitching in the sex with the sex Rico. It's like, that nigga was wrong. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That nigga was wrong. But, you know, that's a touchy subject. I, yeah, yeah. I, was, I, I had a joke or two, but I shut the fuck up. Saying, like, please, it's, it's nothing to joke about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to chill. It's nothing to joke about. That shit is nah, a touchy that. subject. And that make me, that make, that's why I'm happy I'm married. Same. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, it's scary anything. out there. It is a serious matter. Mm -hmm. So much so that the mayor of New York, Eric Adams, deployed... 6,000 police to the train stations of New York City to find the tunnels that they were over there. Those little tunnels. Yeah. They was, you know what they said was going on in the tunnels. Is that what they said? When they did that, when he did that, stop it. They said that it's related to some ST. Yeah. Really? Damn. Yeah. Yeah. Some ST. Yeah. What do you think niggas got tunnels for? And they said when the tunnels got too hard to dig, they hired, they called the Mexicans to come Yeah, they it. called the migrants. To oh, this, shit, this, shit, this shit deeper than what we just yeah, said. Oh, crazy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, somebody snitched. Yeah, them. these uh, niggas. I told y'all that's my somebody, point. Somebody they get that up. They getting the low hanging fruit uh, essays. They need to get the ones with the tongue. They cost yeah. too much. They underground with that shit. That's wild. Get them niggas. That's wild. Yo, you stupid. And S A, not S A. Don't try to come for me. Don't try to come for me. Just being clear. Journal, journalism. 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 He just did it with his head folded. Now, now, Benny, you have had you have had some critiques about the music critiquers out there. Mm -hmm. When I first heard it, I was a little upset. But then I saw you clean me up. You got me out of there. Paul, you said, no, Joe, yeah, Budden, like, could, Joe, Joe Budden could critique. Save but these other you, niggas got to shut the fuck up. <laughs> so now I have Elliot here because <laughs> I knew you were coming. <laughs> this is what you said. What do you me? think about these niggas that can't rap, can't pick a beat, critiquing us out here? Uh, This guy here, he has a long, extensive I'm shady, right? career in this. I mean, That's experience. You feel what I'm saying? He has a professional opinion. Listen, I put it there so you could big him up or put him down. right on left. It was your no, choice. No, I, yo, I got you. <laughs> I'm saying his, his career is long and extensive in this game. So he's seen the best of them from the golden era. His opinion might be a little brash and harsh because it's not based on what's happening now. And we got to respect that. You know, niggas used to play with leather helmets. So when they call these football players soft now, you got to be like, okay. Niggas was playing with a leather helmet. You know what I mean? No face mask. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? He come from the leather helmet era. And we, yeah. it's, it's hard to accept Yo, my this nigga. shit. Yo, you hear this nigga rapper brain going? I'm listening to this. You're pretty good. You're pretty good at cleaning this shit up. Analogy, yo. They claim that. You're pretty good at cleaning this shit up. That's that rapper brain. That's that rapper brain. Elliot, 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 credit him when you use that shit. I'm running with it. Elliot was super full. He got nervous. Elliot, that leather helmet ball. Yeah, that shit. You my guy. That's rapper brain, yo. Leather helmet. Hey, yo, Flip, I know you know people who rap, right? And I know you're from, and I'm saying, I know you're from that era, so. Even though y'all, when y'all, when people like, yo, let me spit this to you, Uncle Cuz, and they spit, and, and it's that new shit, and it's okay, but it's like okay yeah. for now, yeah. for what's happening mm -hmm. now. Uh -huh. yeah. So it's like it. They ain't web nitty era, man. They don't know they're about not, that. They not. They're not. They're like, not. It's like yeah, I it's hear people timeless. all the time, and they shit sound good for what's going on now. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. But if you like 15 years ago. Don't do it. But the Shame problem with that, it wasn't the Benny we, we we now, A lot of times, the guys he gets into Benny online and they critique him, they want to get on. A lot of them just like recognize me. I want to get on. Oh yeah, exactly. A lot of your back yeah. and forth on social media is that like other artists that are, want to get on, like Griselda, like mm -hmm. they get inspired and then they try to cut you down. To get it. up. That's it. Mm -hmm. I take personally. I take offense to, to to the whole. You have to be able to rap or whatever to 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 offer a critique. I can't do none of that shit. Never could. Never tried. Never wanted to. I am a true fan of hip hop from. 
when I fell in love with it back in 90... 99, right? Two... <laughs> fuck up. Um, so, bling, and, bling. And, and, and I, Don't live it, Eric. Get rich or die trying, right? <laughs> no, 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 we can square up. No, no, no. We can square up. No, 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 03, was, 03 was crazy. Was crazy. Was 03 up. was crazy. Good year for hip-hop. But, but nah, when people say that, like, oh, shit. I'm a, I, I'm a consumer. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I spend my money... I purchase, I go to shows, I buy merch, all of that. And I feel like as a consumer, I have the right to say if I like or don't like something too. I'm not telling nobody that, hey, don't fuck with him. Don't do this, don't do that. Because a lot of time, like for me, I started off just giving my critiques on Twitter. Mm -hmm. Back in 09, 2010, all of that. And niggas was tight. Because I say I don't like your album, or I say I don't like your song, or whatever, your project. Niggas was... I, they know niggas are highly upset with me. Shit, I got into it with Gun a bunch of times because I wasn't a fan. You pieced it all up though. We cool. Right. I mean, right. think about. I, I'm with you, you're my man. Not okay. bad. But when you're here comes at, the shot. No, nah, at I some know. point, no, nah, at some point, Ice's voice got so loud it did. in 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 the music industry mm. that he could potentially sway your album sales. Mm. So now, if you're an artist, and that's the argument that Nicki had with you at one point, like, yo, you might not know how big your voice is. So if you're saying certain shit, you have a following that's going to listen to you. You could affect how my kids eat. So now I have an issue with that. That was her. It's about the weaponizing of your opinion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You, that's okay. true. That's yeah, yeah, how you do it, true. really. Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 really, it's really how you do it because me as a rapper, like I don't, I don't like speaking on, I don't like telling nobody they shit whack. You know what I'm saying? I don't mm-hmm. like it. Because first thing they go As a they, rapper, that's like a rule. You, you, can't, you can't say do that. that. Yeah. yeah, you know what I'm saying? You can't They're going to say the hater yeah. car or whatever, but... What I realize is that uh, long as you're giving a whole bunch of effort to it, you know what I'm saying? I can tell when somebody getting in there bullshit. For sure. Because some Talk of them niggas it. who mumble yeah, rap, yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk some about of them niggas it. who mumble rap, they get in there bullshit. Some of them mumble rap niggas work hard. And, yeah, and, 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 you know what I'm saying? And be saying some and shit. And be saying some, some shit. That you take seven about what years they to decipher in. what they say. So, yeah. so this is what I was more saying about the about the critique and shit. Mm-hmm. Like E said, it's a lot, it's a lot of people who want to do what I do, who want to do what we do. Mm-hmm. So they yes. were like, you know, this, this nigga told me the other day, he was like, yo, you would, if you were, if you wasn't signed, you would you, you would just be an average rapper. I'm thinking like, That's brother, brother, brother I just got signed two years ago. I've been doing this shit for 20 years. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You think I got yeah. signed, nigga? And then, you know, first average. thing I do, I go look. He got a little to page, page. page. Link in bio. Uh-huh. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. Because success, I was saying this, success is a mirror that you show when people face. And they get to see what you've done and they get to look at themselves. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So that's true. they take your success negatively. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? And, and that's what I've been experiencing. So many people helping me on the come up. Mm-hmm. When I was in the projects, I had no problem. Nobody had no problem helping the butch. Fact. I'm saying now that they see me, you know, n- niggas don't want to do the verses. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's like, like shit getting a little tough. I got to work a little harder because this nigga's like, that shit you doing was working. You know what I'm saying? So... Back to these cr- niggas critique, and it's like, man, it's, it's, it's nerds critiquing. Let me get back to the nerds. I love y'all, but y'all get on my nerves. Uh, a lot of the nerds critiquing shit, they don't, they don't know what's what. Let's talk about it. Just because somebody got an opinion, they don't know what's what. True. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So it's like you, 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 you speaking on some shit you don't even know about, but you got True. a loud voice. I'm saying, I, you know what I mean? So that's what I was talking about. But I believe a person like you, you've been in this game for so long, and, and you're nice with the pen. Talk your shit. You definitely talk your shit. You listen to hip hop. Talk your shit. But people ain't no, always gonna like it, as y'all both know. Absolutely, you know for saying? sure. Yeah. Before twenty, what year are we in? Twenty twenty four. Before twenty twenty seven, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta do it. Yo, yeah. shut up. We gotta do it. Man. <laughs> Why did you? Why did you do that? You know he's full. Do you know he's full of shit? No, stop. Because this is one of my favorite rappers. I didn't know though. This is one of my favorite rappers. Full of shit. He used to get me with this. This is one of my favorite rappers. Oh yeah, Benny. Benny, I need Benny. I need you. Benny, Benny, I need you to give him a hit so he can get out of my world. I'm like, I was telling niggas like, yo, me and Joe. This is one of my favorite rappers. I'm telling you. You see what he said? It's top of 2024. He said 27. Right? That should let you know. That should let you know. We still gonna be around, God willing, in in three more years. No, he is. But I want, I want. He want to run media. That's Rose Gold right there? Huh? That's Rose Gold? 
<laughs> you got your, your bracelet. You got your bracelet. You got your bracelet. You got your bracelet. Show them the bracelet. Billy. I want rose gold. Show them the bracelet. We don't have to do that. Look at the bracelet. Have, that's what I see. Show them the bracelet. That's what I want. Let's Joe. see it. Let's see it. You're violating workplace rules oh, and policies. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Touching on me. I'm sorry. Um, a little moist tonight. A little moist tonight. Ah, stop it. Please. Yo, what? But what's wrong? We keep asking this. If a rapper was to wear some moist tonight, though, like, what's wrong? It just defeats the purpose. True. Because the people, this is what I tell niggas who be doing that. The people you trying to impress is not impressed. We could see that shit. We, we over here talking, yo, you see, look at that Dog, shit. You got on. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm yeah. Stupid. And then the Spotty. bitches you could fake with that. It's like, is they is, is the bitches really worth that? The bitch you going for the Moisenites? Like if she's I don't you know, want the bitch that's going for the exactly. moisture. So I like, want the bitch that could tell dude is wearing some clown shit too, so facts. we can chuckle together. It's only <laughs> it's only two people who believe that shit real. It's 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 the weak bitches and the jack boys. Mm. So don't mm. wear that shit. Mm. Stay shit, away from yo, that shit. My shit for certain it's niggas, What's that? that borderline weak bitch is worth it to them. Yeah. That's true. They got they got a staff. They you got, know what I'm saying? They, they, got, got, they, they got a like 20 weak bitches on their roster. There you <laughs> go. There you go. <laughs> they, they can't afford the strong bitches, so I'm going to go ahead and eat where I eat at. You get what I'm saying? Like, I'm going to eat where I eat. I, I, I guess you can't knock them. It's dangerous, though. <laughs> no, 2027, I'm serious. It is on, it is on my bucket list. <laughs> no, I'm going to do my bucket list. No, that's too oh, far, you know, man. Three boys, years? five. Because Benny is one of the niggas, when I, when I hear him, like, I hear, like, old mouse a little bit. I'm yeah, like, oh, I got to get, get in there. One year. Not yet. Not yet. I got to go start the race. Shit up. I got to go. Know, you know that'll go up. I know it would. I know it would. And even if it didn't. Just to do I ain't it. No that just shit going to up. just for me to do it and press play before it's out. Like, mm. you know, it's like, you do that. Oh, no, Yo, Yo, can, you, can you stop? Oh, Joe, that'll be out as soon as you're done. Can you tell the uh, Griselda knockoff artist that they can find something new now? That's hate. Yeah, they Yo. you can't. You <laughs> can't do that. That's hate. Yo, let's show this nigga right provided a way in a. Is that how we feel, Park? Yes. No, People been no, copying no, the camera for too long. You can't do that. That's hate. You can't do that. I can't do that. I think it's a good thing. Only reason why. It's a great thing. I'm a great. For y'all on this because they trying to they trying to use the lane. Some of them trying to use, not all of them trying to use the lane we created mm -hmm. and weaponize it against us. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. So in this, that's case, how it goes. How so? Yes. Okay. Why so? you? Why you? Beat you at your own that. shit that you created. Yeah. It's like I created it. Be rapping over a fake Derringer beat, talking about some nobody can't fuck with me. I run this shit. You got someone's <laughs> eyes blocked out yes. on, the, on the cover. Like, you know what I mean? It's like, dog. Whoa. Right. <laughs> Calm down. That's my flow right there. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? We get that. But uh They beating that shit. I, to I death, love that. Though. I love that we created the lane. I, I just say that because look, you gonna you gonna get further showing the love in this shit. We not kids. Mm. We're not going we not going viral on going live with each other, cussing mm. each other out. We old niggas. Pull up, oh, you fuck with my pull up to the show, nigga. Your shit fire. Facts. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, That's the part I'm working on. You know what I'm saying? You ain't gonna get nowhere with that. No, I'm working on this part, the love part. You gotta do the love shit, man. Because he's right. You get yeah, further you get further with the love. And right, where we are in 2024, so many niggas I hate are in successful positions that can help yeah. some. <laughs> like, don't let my hate for you bitch ass niggas stop us from working together. <laughs> <laughs> Contact Ian Schwartzman. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hit, hit him up. Hit him up. I'm with it. Don't, I know niggas who, 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 who like my shit. Everybody don't fuck with me. I know that. And it's all good. I'm here for it, man. It like it's so tough to be a real nigga in today's hip-hop. What do you think of all the hip-hop 50 celebrations? I feel like Harris won. Mm. I hate all them shits. You hate all of them? Every last one. I ain't really get to catch them. See? So you just, exactly. And that's that exactly. I ain't, that's I ain't point. dislike them, but that's I, I understood what he was saying. Who like cares some more? of the performances was dope. Like yeah. even the even the performance at the Grammys. You know I'm 47, so that shit was alright for me. But I understand what KRS was saying. Like yo, y'all wasn't giving us re no respect and no props. What, so have, what, have, what have they could have done better though? A, yeah, they could have definitely. They could have. What have what, 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 yeah. they could have? They, they, they could have celebrated hip hop and honored hip hop, which is what mm -hmm. KRS One was saying. He's saying, why would I show up to these events to celebrate hip hop and there's no hip hop there? And when I say hip hop, I'm talking about the four elements. I didn't see anything honoring DJs. the fucking DJs, the graffiti, producers, graffitis, the dancers, the MCs, the fucking no. It oh. was none of that. So, so it was just it. performative uh -huh. record label run out this artist that clearly looks like they've been having a rough 40 to 50 years this, this past few. How can I celebrate that? 
How can I celebrate yeah. seeing my favorite nigga who I thought I grew up thinking this nigga was God mm -hmm. out here looking like fucking Boo Boo the Pooh? Or East Side Crackhead or, or some shit. So it's more Talk, like singing we, the slap. gonna give you niggas that. That's depressing. Yeah. That's not a celebration. That's sad mm. for me. And that no don't make real... me feel good about my participation in this thing. There's no real sense of cohesiveness to it. It's like there was no real, like, you know, big mm. label participation. It just, Man. It, was, it was lackluster at best. Yeah, I felt that. I 50 felt that. years, give something back now. I was, yeah, mm. that's what I was about to say. It was leechy. Give something mm. back it now. Was you showing us all the niggas that have carried this shit and performed for y'all. For y'all's hip hop for 50 years. Now give something back to them. And no that check. would be a celebration to me. They ain't writing no check. Well, then, we, then, why, then why are we celebrating? Yeah, the, then what, the you, then what are that. all these niggas showing up with their fancy, fanciest prom shoes on to do their they, they fucking song, song, do their little tune? If you ain't writing no check, if you ain't giving back no splits, no masters, no it. royalties, no. Something gotta give. Or it don't, because all you niggas show up and get to shucking and jiving for the look of it. That's what they do. Yeah, they don't have no the shucking and jiving. That's how, they how they it don't, felt for me. They don't have any demands. I don't want to speak for nobody else out there, but that is how it felt for... Uh, and the problem is, uh, for the ones that say no, it's 100 that'll say yes. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like, all right, cool. You called me? No, I'm not doing that shit. Fuck out of here. They on the same type of time you on. Fine. They hang up with him and call 10 people who we on the next flight. It's going to forever be like that in hip-hop because it ain't in Dog, that's, that's life. That's true. Especially in hip hop, because no union. That's gonna change mm -hmm. soon, though. You know what I'm saying? What? The union shit. I still don't think so. It, Trust it, me. Um, it, it's that'd be like impossible. It sound impossible to put together because mm -hmm. you got so many people from different eras and so many. You know what I'm saying different. I have. But it's to, like I that's have, the only thing that'll help and save this shit. So I have to of, stop uh, potting and go and find the fucking future stars that are now 10, 11, 12, and thirteen. Right, because this is really is the long game that you got to play. Now we just got to do like the, uh, the the unions in the cities do and put the big inflatable rat out in front of whoever breaks the strike. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all know that big ass rat they put out there. You know but, the then, only, but then, but this is why it ain't gonna be no union because uh, hip hop is the only shit. You know what I'm saying? Somebody, a rapper, could go outside and and piss on an old lady. Nobody's gonna reprimand them for that. Exactly. NBA niggas can't do that. NFL niggas can't do that. So now when it's when it's shit like that going on, you could tell these niggas what to do. Ain't no way. And, going and we like gonna that. keep it a buck. The rap culture is one of the only cultures that comes directly from the street. My bad for that extreme. Uh, nah, I'm no, good. Okay. Okay. No, look. So the nigga that pissed on the old lady uh -huh. might play with them things. Mm -hmm. Now you gonna step out on the limb and reprimand them? Yes. No. Sounds, some niggas it would. sounds good. Some niggas would. That's it sounds not true. good. But that's how you're not going to get people involved in it because that's what it's going to entail. Mm -hmm. So niggas ain't be like, yo, you sign up for the union. That's everybody like, can't go. I ain't go. fucking with that. Everybody, everybody can't, can't go. Everybody can't go. Everybody can't go. This ain't for everybody. <laughs> yeah. A few of us got to get out on the front line and do the work for people that wasn't willing and didn't mm -hmm. really see the benefit. Mm -hmm. It will affect them too. But they don't, they don't have to go to Alabama and march. Mm -hmm. That's the niggas that care about it. The nigga that is this near and dear to their heart and soul. The niggas that show up to do it without the check, without the incentives, it's, it's going to be us They got to go do it. And I'm not off of that. Like, I ain't going to keep sitting on this couch and talking about it. I'm going to get out there and try to affect some change before I die. I was going to say leadership. Yeah. yeah. That's what it comes down to. Yeah. That's what this shit needs. And we say we don't have a union, but fucking Rock Nation's the union. They just <laughs> only do it for Rock Nation people. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's, that's, how how that's how the union works. It feel like, it feel like that's the you closest thing to a union. Yeah, yeah you got to sign up. That is how a union works. You got to pay your dues over here, <laughs> Pay your dues. And that's not true. Like, if niggas call hold for advice that's not on Rock Nation, he gives it freely. So let me not do that. But Absolutely. if you want the real help. <laughs> Go ahead and sign this paper right here. Yep. <laughs> Shout out Rock Nation. I'm over there. I'm yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh -huh. You going to the brunch? Elliot told me a brunch is coming. <laughs> Elliot told me a Rock Nation Hopefully. brunch is coming. Yeah. You know, people be talking about the brunch, but it's, it's cooler shit that go on than the brunch. It's, Talk about it's it, the Benny. holiday party. You Tell know what you're going to see at the Rock Nation holiday party. Benny, he said there's it's no been, food in there. Tell Benny, him there's food I'm going to be honest with both of y'all before y'all continue. Hard food it's hard to get the food in the brunch. <laughs> we watch it, and respectfully, with all due respect to old it's not even about hope. He always look cool. Most of the people there don't be looking like it's cool shit going on. Mm. Like when we watching from home on the internet, we don't be saying, oh, they look so cool, most of them. A lot of people are standing around because they're waiting around for the photo op. I could tell the niggas that only bought this outfit for this occasion. We've mm. been seeing you the rest of the year looking dusty and sloppy. Now look at you here with your khakis on, nigga. I don't give a, don't give a fuck about this shit. You can tell the niggas who's the plus one of the plus one, the niggas that snuck in trying to hover around Hove and get that. Yo, dog, move, man. 
It definitely get like that, like like any party, man. But it's a, you might, you know, what I'm saying, you know, you've been famous for a long time, so you know, what I mean, shit wore off on you though. Yeah, you know but I'm saying? trying to reach a different level of fame now. See, being not even being in the room with them niggas, man. Couple black billionaires and Mark Wahlberg kicking it with him and getting to chop it up with. In, in, in a different setting, you know what I'm saying with E40, this is my last experience. Yeah, you know what I'm saying Beyonce walking through like nigga, I don't give a fuck. Beyonce, nigga, Beyonce, it's Beyonce. Oh, if that happened, you gotta go and break. That's what I'm trying shit. to say. Like, is <laughs> Beyonce? You gotta set the bar. Uh, just a whole bunch of shit, man. You know what I mean? Like, but I can see where some people like I ain't going to that shit. You Rock Nation niggas haven't been invited to Michael Rubin's party, have you? I haven't been. I don't think I'm rich enough for that. How shit. about you? Uh? <laughs> no, I have not. Oh. We ain't rich enough oh, for that shit. Party wars. Nah, nah, you gotta step <laughs> our game up, Benny. Let me pay my taxes this year. See if I can get there. <laughs> Met, Met Gala? I'm nah, crashing that shit Gala this now. year. Nah, you I ain't did Met Gala. See, this is shit. Can Def Jam help me with this shit? See, that's what I signed in them for. They can get, <laughs> get you in there. You know what I mean? See, this is the shit I'm talking about. I'm not pocket watching you. This is one of my final questions. You look great, so there's no need for me to pocket watch. But in terms of brand deals, what brand out there do you think is a perfect match? for Benny the Butcher to align with? Uh, Pyrex. <laughs> yeah, it's Pyrex. Pyrex. I'm yeah, one of the biggest shit. advocates for Pyrex. Is they, they one of the most dur dur is, is durable, 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 durable. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Cookware. Sound, sound it out. Cookware. <laughs> <laughs> it's got you. One of the most pieces of durable cookware, mm -hmm. kitchenware you can find. That's true. Uh, at places like Walmart and He's Target. doing a commercial yeah, this right guy now. Is good. Yeah. This guy is good. This guy is good. Jim Stars. <laughs> uh, I don't have anything else oh, for Biddy, man. Well, Bitty. shout out Monster Energy Drink and Big Dog Leaf. I got I got brand deals, you know what I'm saying? Ooh. Ooh. You know what I mean? Doing See, a lot of tours this summer? Yeah, I'm going to Australia. I just got my paper back to show me. Oh, Once shit. I clear my warrant up in uh, Atlanta, I can go to uh, Australia and shit. And That's Canada. what's up. Don't you hate that? When that Atlanta traffic ticket ruins future business in no Australia. Traffic, no ticket, I was nigga. speeding. I'm just saying, whatever <laughs> it is. They locked me up and shit. I was oh, speeding, man. I got to the customs at Toronto. Them niggas want to know everything I did wrong in Philly. Mm -hmm. I was like, wait, why is this? <laughs> why is this applied? Yeah, that, that makes sense. Yo, when, I came, when I came back from overseas, I knew I had a warning in uh, Georgia, so I didn't fly home. I flew to New York. So they called me in the back room. They was like, you know, I'm like, I know. I got a warrant. Yeah. They was like, yeah, don't go down. You know, these police here, they kind of cool. They like, yo, just chill. Don't go down there. And you good. You did the right thing by flying in here. I'm like, thank you. Let me get my passport back. I'm out of there. <laughs> you got the new passport or the old passport? I got the... I got the new shit, I think. The no, I don't got the new shit with the... Fly. The new shit with the ID right? thing. Yeah. That new shit. You got my back fly. Yeah. Let me show you my passport, The man. new shit is funny. It's now the national. new shit look good. And you get the passport card. And I, you, you ain't got to show. You probably on your first passport still. <laughs> I just wanted to show uh, my Rock Nation passport case. Yeah. <laughs> talk to him, Benny. Oh, talk to him. Oh, oh. Yo, no, he shit is cooler uh, than a bro. That's hilarious. hilarious. Yo, see, and that's the problem <laughs> with these Rock Nation niggas. The Rock Nation case don't say nothing on it about right. It just look like. Nah, it says uh, the paper plane teaches you to imagine. Once you dream, you set your intention. This is what I want. Where I want to go. Hove, Damn, enough of this. Enough of this. Poetry. Hove, no more poetry. <laughs> no more spoken word, please. Uh, Just give me the passport done. cover so. without the spoken word. You know what's so crazy? Because you know you can't even use passport covers. Yeah, they got, you got to take it out. You got to take it out. You got to take it out. But, you know, you put a plane on it, y'all jump. <laughs> That's yeah, it. Man, I appreciate y'all for having me and shit, man. Benny, Thanks for o out, open man. door policy for you, man. You already know. Any, anytime you want to come. Really, that's how you and Elliot ended up here today. I had a busy day lined up. I was going to tell everybody to get the fuck out of here. But you two, open door policy. Y'all are fucking friends of the show. Anytime y'all want, y'all are more you, than man. welcome. We have here, appreciate man. you, brother. Put your jury on to come see us, man. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I got to call my brothers. security to hang out with y'all. I've seen y'all yeah. brothers do y'all thing. It was a close one with Dr. Umar the other day, man. No. Yeah. 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 But uh, I do want to know what you. Uh, I never met. I never, I'm saying we never met personally, have we? Yeah, and we met now. Yeah, no, he just got outside a couple years we ago. Met now. He said what? I he just came outside a couple of years ago. <laughs> yeah. That's a crazy dude. Yeah, nah. Yeah, it's gonna be crazy. Out here. Before you go, I mad at you? Um, no. Okay, no. no. That was good to see because I watched your video where you explain your part. Uh -huh. And I'm like, damn, Cam had that wrong. And I'm, I'm happy you brothers pieced it up. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know so it's yeah, so. no, it's not him. He's mad at Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Billy, tell him best debut since uh, Why you DMX, keep Def Jam, man. I'm trying to tell him that, man. Let's go, everybody. Kick it. Everybody, kick it.
I'm dropping stores. 12 albums this year like X did. You know what I'm saying? 12 albums huh? this year. Really? You know what I mean? I do want to know mm. what, you th- uh, what you thought of Cat Williams before I let you go. Mm. Oh, that was crazy. Did you love it? I do, but I don't. This is the only part I don't love about it is when people in our position spew a lot of that shit. The broke motherfuckers at home be like, I knew it. I knew it. I knew they always yeah, yeah. Illuminati. Yeah, That's the yeah, only yeah. thing I don't like about that shit. Yeah. He was speaking his truth. Now, now I got little cousins who think I'm Illuminati. And shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nigga, he sold your soul. Nigga. <laughs> that type of shit, man. Yeah. So you're not Illuminati? I'm not Illuminati. Yet. He's shouting out Pyrex, nigga. He's not Illuminati. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Benny the Butcher, man. Honored to have him here. It's our guy. Ah, January 26th. Let's go. Everybody Everybody can't can't go. go. Everybody can't go. January 26th. If you're looking for a girl record, go somewhere else. Late in the year. Two albums coming. (laughs) Second one to the ladies. But your lady still might be listening to this. Now, girls like this type of shit sometimes. I'm try- I was saying the other day, like, a female be uh, be posting uh, this record in my mm-hmm. story. She got the panties and bra on, nigga. <laughs> she listened to this shit like it's, uh, I mean, like it's R&B. <laughs> she, will, <laughs> she will line you. <laughs> you she, yeah. she will That's line my you. only problem with these <laughs> Griselda niggas. House. They will not get no bitches at the show. We, br- we got to bring them with, a- with us. I know, but, man, other niggas want to come bag and go. Yeah, for real, though. But it's BYOH. It was like, it was like, <laughs> nah, I ain't gonna lie. You wanna get on home? Last tour? <laughs> this last tour, <laughs> bring it on home, Bob. <laughs> it was there. Stop. It was there. Maybe not. All right, All right so I'm coming to the next one. I'm Come coming on. to the next one. I want free tickets. Hey, I'm coming look, backstage. I'll put you in the flyer. The whole week. Hey! <laughs> so we got an invite to your listening session, right? And y'all ain't come last night? Dog. Mm. He never texted uh, me the address. Look, I called the publicist. Well, if you do it as a musical, yeah. cool. <laughs> <laughs> he you might come. The color purple? Nah, he said. No, hold on. My, wife, my, my wife made me go see that on Christmas. Bro. I wasn't. Did you like it? Sure. It's bullshit, right? <laughs> you can say it and still be black. I, I ain't like it. <laughs> sure. I ain't like it. Black people think they can't shit on color purple. They're going to lose their blackness. <laughs> no, bro, that's how I feel. I feel I'm going to betray him if I say I, I didn't like the movie, but I, I didn't like it, though. Shout out to everybody who was in it, though. Go what did you think of that, man? <laughs> the, the original one was way better, right? Have you seen it? I haven't seen it yet, no. Okay. Wait, you, you, you see the original? Wait, 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 still wait, ain't seen it? Oh, for fuck's sake. I got shit going on. Yo, man, all of us not seeing it is why Taraji in there, you know what I mean? Wow, we don't right. be supporting. Oh, nobody in here. Black seen. women don't support oh. other I'm black women. I'm going to go this weekend. I used to do that. It's been out supposed, for weeks. I was supposed to go last weekend, but the weekend was fucked because of the you weather. And we were going this weekend. Oh, yeah, you got to Can't go to the weekend when it's, when it's raining. Uh, but y'all going to go see the new Aquaman, though. Quick. Word. Yeah. yeah. Shit's crazy, man. Marvel oh, film. Man. You ain't like the color purple, nigga. Don't go see the Aquaman. That's why Taraji beats them. I'm saying I bought the popcorn and all that bag. <laughs> now, hopefully this weekend you, you take some time out your busy I schedule did. and go see uh, go support I, your black I, I will actress sister. Yes, I will. Don't don't be up here acting like uh, Vivica Fox. Oh my god! Oh my god! She, oh, she, was, she was like, I'm good. Yeah, make some noise for Benny the Butcher. Yeah. 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 Big BSF, big Griseldas. <laughs> Yo, Benny, could you believe that these brothers said that if I gifted them a JBP chain and pendant, that they wouldn't wear? Zaire, I'm telling you too. Do you believe that these brothers said they would not wear a JBP chain and pendant if I gifted it to them? That's crazy. Tell them yeah. niggas what you said. No, no, no. You shut the fuck no, up. No, tell them what you tell, said. I'm nigga. telling real niggas right no, now. No, because you got to put your ex. Put your, tell what you said. This nigga said a picture with his face. Is what he said. <laughs> that's what he fucking said. No, 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 no. I was being funny, but just a little JBP. About, yo? Look, he's still like, fuck that JBP pendant, right? I'm, I'm gonna get you. We going to dinner. Hey, yo, fuck dog, you. The money that you're gonna spend on the JBP pendant. Give it to him. Look, yo, this nigga crazy. Put it in my JB pocket. Oh. <laughs> what are you about? Nah, my own girl gonna make the pendants. I, uh, out of what? She, she gonna make it. Out of what? From moist tonight. <laughs> well, my whole girl gonna make fuck it. Out no, here. My fuck whole out girl here. gonna make it. Oh, man. Shout out to Benny the Butcher. Shout out to Benny, man. Friend of the show. We got a busy, busy, active day up here. We do. Where my man at? My man. We're going to talk to Zaire in a little bit. That's my my guy. No, I'm saying. 
Let's see him. He's here with us. He is. He's here. We're going to console him. Man. Ellie, you all right, man? How's your endurance holding up, man? man L looking for his coat. <laughs> L, yeah. L falling asleep. Yeah. He had to take his Mad glasses off. Hey, his sugar level was low. He yeah, leaked his sugar the blood level. He got some slime. Ellie was like this. Oh. He trying to get the sugar. His no, glasses like was fogged up. <laughs> These Warner Bros podcast, they not used to sitting here and really getting to the work. They Marathon. come in Marathon journalism potters, real man. quick and get out of here. I salute mm-hmm. y'all. No, 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 yeah, after you hating on us, yeah. Yeah. nah, Tag. but don't just post the content like you do. Long captions, yeah. Facts. Yo, for my birthday, all I wanted was to go up there to the JBP, see what's going on, and I must admit, use the word must. <laughs> capital, capital must How about I, must? I must admit. I must admit, those guys are the, some of the hardest working podcasts take that, I've, out. that I've ever seen, and all the success that they have, well deserved. As hard as they work, man. That's what I want to see on the album. Mm. Verbatim. Captions right there. Yeah, verbatim. Yeah. Ghostwriter. Yeah. For the writer. Big Mel, you at two? And yeah. also, Mel, you got smoke it. with him? You been at two? Yeah. 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 Yeah, we got smoke, no. nigga. At two, Brute. Yeah, nigga. We, Brute season, whatever you want to call yourself. <laughs> when you leave here, you write a long monologue of how great and how hard we work. Right. You went over there, you, you, you was fiddling with the lights, you try to find your coat. Nigga, yeah, we over here. You try to escape. <laughs> we try to escape through the balcony. Hijack. Yeah, nah, we here. We here. I didn't we leave with the butcher. I'm here. I'm here. Yeah, here we go. Good. That's right. Now, I will do that. I definitely will act mm-hmm. accordingly when it's time. We like that. I asked like you that. off air before we got on the mic. What was I didn't know what buyer's remorse was. You were sh- taking shots at Jr. I didn't know that's what you asked me. Buyer's oh. remorse. Buyer's remorse is uh, having regret or anxiety over a purchase. Oh, mm. I didn't know that. Yeah. Mm. I thought it was a fly shit. No, to, to it's, usually you it's usually remorse doesn't usually no it's yeah. a, until my man checked me. <laughs> I was like, hey, Flip. <laughs> this nigga can't stop. Let me laugh. Let's sprinkle some, some laughter. <laughs> Are you laughing at me if I, ha- if, cause if I got by? No, I'm <laughs> laughing at you because you really, I was really lost. I'm just saying that. I'm just lost. My salute. My, my, shout out to my man putting me on when I ask. I thought I didn't know what that meant. I don't have buyer's remorse. As long as when I fire niggas, I can stop paying. <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> Some of these niggas. Fire's these, remorse? Yeah, these cool. <laughs> fire, fire's remorse. Damn. I missed that nigga I fired the other day, man. Yo, that nigga was fly, wasn't he? That nigga was great. Great times. You saying? Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, what you got going on tomorrow? I heard you got something going on. I do. <laughs> I have uh, an. Uh, Oh, I'm, lo- I'm loading up that fire some more. What do you got going? <laughs> no, I have an event tomorrow. Um, interrogation room. You know, it's just a, something. I heard, I put I heard you have a live event. And I do, but, but you but didn't not, tell but him not your live, brothers not, or sister. It's, it's live on. It's live streamed, and you know, a couple of people are coming to support. You know, shout out to Asia and Mac. They they coming out here, and a couple of people from Flip the Network. It's just you know putting things back into his perspective. That's all. So Getting back where I need to be. Bro- like your brother support you. Your sister yeah, support word. you. Yeah, word. You invite none of us. Um, Did you get invite? No. Well, I oh. wanted to, but the last part, you know, I was kicked out. Wow. Then I had to run back in here during Patreon to show that I was a champion, and I wasn't leaving off of a motion. Mm. So I didn't have time. All right. So at Please Patreon, don't play that clip again. With when that. you came back in the Patreon, <laughs> you ain't have time? You, <laughs> Got him. Got him. Get your hands out my pocket, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Malcolm X, nah, rest in peace. But listen... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I love y'all. Yeah, yeah, it's just something. It's just something small. You know, the bigger ones. We, we, it's gonna be lit. I need you guys there. I you just, know, I just, you know, I felt the way for a minute, but I'm, I'm cool now. Thank you. All right, I'm in our group chat trying to find a clip that Mel sent, but she spent, she sent all she does is like send this sexual abuse shit to the. <laughs> Yo, I gotta like siphon it out. A lot of memes and shit, Mel. What? Yeah. Since you've began working here, mm. no one here but me has replied to you in here. <laughs> I think I've thrown. Ish some sends a bunch of shit in there. Don't look at me. I don't know. I don't even open it. Ish doesn't. Yeah, you do. Ish doesn't, I see it. Ish, I see it at the bottom. Ish little icon. Ish doesn't speak to you in here, Mel. I don't, I don't necessarily want to talk <laughs> to none of y'all motherfuckers in there either. Oh, oh, I just said, put stuff in there. I'm in here right now. Mm-hmm. Ish hasn't said a word to you. I was not talking to him. He sends so stuff in there too. He Ish sends talks? stuff in no, there. No, he sends stuff. That's what I, I said. He doesn't. I was saying he doesn't speak to you. I wasn't saying he spoke to me. I'm saying he he sends stuff too. No, but you can't too. say that because he does not. <laughs> I'm not saying he speaks to me. <laughs> stop it, Bill. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. You. All you right, post. I got it right here. Just like I told y'all, homeboy that fucking lunged at the judge. Yeah. Yo, you exaggerated that too. 
What? My Paul, he exaggerated. When I saw it, it, they ain't bring him in like. Yes, they did. It's like. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. How you answering? I ain't even Sorry. getting my sentence out. No, no, no. Wait, I, I, I thought the same thing. It's until but I how was it. you answering for my interpretation of how they brought him in? Like if you, you felt last, last if part. you felt different, then cool. But I don't. I don't think I did. Oh. I think they brought him in there like a monster with a stocking cap, mask over him, surrounded, orange, stupid, mad shit going on. But come on, let's get to it. Here we go. Mr. Redden, have you been given a copy of the criminal complaint this morning? Yes, I have been given one. You're being charged with count one, attempt murder, victim 60 years of age or older, a felony. Count two, battery on a protected person resulting in substantial bodily harm, victim 60 years of age or older, a felony. Count three, extortion by threat, a felony. Count four, intimidating a public officer, a felony. Count five, six, seven, eight, and nine are all battery on an officer, the same name victim. Oh, and by the way, I do not know any of the other victims named in the criminal complaint. I don't even like that tone while she reading these shits. Count 10, performance of act or neglect of duty and willful or wanton disregard of safety or persons of property resulting in substantial bodily harm or death, a felony. Battery on a protected person, count 11, that's a gross misdemeanor offense. Count I never 12, even heard of a gross a misdemeanor. A felony. Count 13, unlawful act related to human excrement or bodily fluid, a felony. Well, he spit All on allegedly it. occurring on January 3rd of 2024. You, Mr. Redden, have... Mm. How do you plead? No Joe Biden. No matter how you play. Cooked. They say, yeah. <laughs> Cooked. That's how you plead. Yeah, they're sending him up. Well done, nigga. Yeah. Burn. Now, I was expressing that I think he's about to get done horribly, and I'm not sure if it's correct. I know that what he did was foul. I do understand that. I'm not trying to justify it. I don't condone it. I'm totally against that behavior that he displayed. But I'm also against what they are doing to him. I do not think it's right. Uh, this clip, it says that the slave patrol is still serving up revenge. And while that may or may not be extreme, there's a lot being ignored here with how he's being handled and treated. Who here disagrees so we can find some <coughs> shit to argue about? Please, the Newark boys. <laughs> I, I don't... You attack a public officer in court. Like, they are not going to treat you any way other than like this. I don't... This is justifiable to me. Like, mm. yeah. I'm, su I'm surprised it wasn't worse. Like we said, I'm surprised he didn't get his ass whooped. I'm surprised he was allowed to make it to court. That's speculative. We don't know that he didn't get his I'm ass I'm about to the point where he could not make it to court. I'm, well, I'm surprised he, did. he didn't get shot. Yeah, but he missed the court date, and we don't know that that's not the reason why he didn't miss that court date. I'm just saying. Okay. Yeah, no. I'm sure they beat his ass at some point, but go ahead. Mm. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to say this. Oh, my bad. I apologize. I'm just saying I'm Step surprised the dude's still, brother. I didn't. Probably the dude's still alive, honestly. Okay. I'm, I'm going to say this. If your mother was that sitting judge, and she was up there going over his charges and he jumped over the motherfucking booth and started kicking your mother and punching your mother, trying to hit your mother with the flag and spitting on your mother, you would think that every single thing is warranted and more. That's not you, true. That's not true. That's I, I hate when y'all do that. That's you. I'm only speaking for me. Me. Nigga, give Did your mom go to work the next day? I don't know if that lady went to work the she next day. She went to work the next day. Okay. That that means that what? changes nothing for you. Nothing. Not, 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 not I want to kill him. I want to kill him. Not one thing does it change. I want to hurt him. I wouldn't give a fuck what it changed. So you can you can ex both of you can explain to me the attempted murder charge. Because the other day when I said to you they charged him with attempted murder, you looked like wow that's crazy, and now you don't see a problem with it. No, what I'm saying is I, I ain't say I don't see a problem with it. You saying that the the overall. I thought you did just say that. You're saying the overall attention that he's getting. They brought him in with the thing over his face because he spit at somebody. I don't care spit about on that. somebody. They brought him in with all the guards, and you said they had him shackled and cuffed. Regular criminals be shackled in front of them and shackled on their ankles sometimes just to go over presiding a trial. That's not somebody that ran at a judge, jumped over the podium, and started hitting them. Did he try to murder her, Ish? No. I don't think that was his intent, however. Can we can we all uh, uh, agree to this? There have been times when niggas just have regular fist fights, and you could punch somebody, they slip, hit their head on the curb, and die. And Joe, you we don't know what his intent was. He, he might, and I think no way to know. Yeah, and, so, he, no and, and he hit it with the flag. So this entire room is totally fine. He hit with the, the, he hit the with the flag pole, pole Joe. Not, I, heard, I I researched the shit. I, I know what he did. All right. I'm asking so now, the entire I'm room. My, I'm, I'm not my... debating with y'all. I'm asking y'all just for clarity. I don't. I don't think he attempted. This entire room is fine with that gentleman getting an attempted murder charge. I think attempted murder is speculative. No, I think that this. I think that. Um, 
when you hit a 60 something year old woman with a flagpole then that yeah. comes with it I think I, I, I'm, I'm not looking at black or white in this instance Me I'm looking at what happened and find every loophole to charge him with whatever y'all could and I think that's what they did we could we hey we hey we could say it was attempted murder in here too. Cool, tap that on. Cool, if that cool. we could say this happened. Cool, tap that on. Exactly my point. Making a full example, yo, you can't do that. Like you jumped over here and beat a judge ass in court. Everything that I'm surprised they go find some more charges to try to tap no on. Bullshit. You. They found them all. I'm just saying. They, like, they, they found they everyone. Like, I never even they heard found yeah, everyone in this some gross misdemeanor. Gross misdemeanor. Gross misdemeanor. Never I never heard made that. that shit up. That might be a Let's go pack. Let's go sign this. But I'll be sure he hit her with, wait, with the pole, though. Wait, hold up. Before. I'm, not, yeah. I'm not they sure. They said he hit her with the pole. Because that, that was hey, some of that was off camera. All right, you did all this. Yeah, we're going to say you did that, too. I wouldn't give a fuck if he did hit her with that pole. That nigga was not trying to kill that white lady. Mmm. You stand on that. He was, I, yeah, he was not trying to murder that white lady. He didn't, so it's not like, he, it's not like he picked Stop up the it. pole. The Stop pole it. itself. So what was he trying fell. to do? Stop. It. Okay. Then, in the, then, in then the process of we the scuffle, and think, then he started to use it. I think, I think, I think for it. them to even charge him with a, the attempted murder is an indictment against the system. Them, the men that were present, like for this crime scene to be where this happened. That y'all can't charge this nigga with attempted murder. Stop it. Let me ask you this. Stop it. No, I'm about Let to say, because uh, now it's about legality versus... Uh, when well, I, they win because right. they set the law. No, no, I could shoot somebody, right? And I could shoot a nigga in the leg. You could get an attempted murder charge from shooting somebody in the leg. Yes. And these are just Did the charges. Did that person go to work the next day? Because that affects my judgment. That lady went to the hospital, checked out of the hospital, and went to work the next day. Let me ask you a question. She Had just nobody, committed to the work. Let me ask you a question. Had nobody yeah. intervened, and he just was allowed Ooh. to stand there and wail on her. That's Do you a think good he would have killed her? That's a good if one. He, if, if nobody was able to pull that's him a off great, him, That's a great point. And he was just it's able to a, do... It's not a great point. It's a horrible just, question. Uh, yes, that six foot four athletic ass Superman ass <laughs> fighting nigga would have killed that lady if nobody was there. So that's an attempt so that's an at attempt murder. murder. That's not true. Stop. I totally disagree with that. And it was... You serious? You just made up a scenario. I know. I, I know. I, I made you up... You just made up... I uh, ma listen. In the scenario y'all made up, I agree. So That's not what happened. And I don't want to sound like I'm trying sure, to cake for this nigga. Happened. That is what happened. That's not what happened. Hold up. There, he, he did not attack some lady on the street while no one was there and wouldn't stop until she so was almost his, on her deathbed. So what do you think his Yo, intention was? Stop. I can't speak for what his intention and was. His intention nobody was can. To, so you can't say it was an attempt to murder just the lady. Just slap up a couple times no, because more he didn't than like that, that you yeah. You said I can't really speak to what her, his intention was. I mean, was. it's not like yeah. this guy doesn't have a jacket full of, like, you know, oh, violent actions too. towards Yo, the women. other day when we had this talk, a few of y'all was on the other side of the fence. Hold on. Now, but you was one of them. No, wait, wait. You was one of them. I, wait, 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 I didn't really remember you. You won't let me talk. You two niggas, especially you. You won't let me talk. Especially you. won't let me talk. So now everybody understands an attempted murder charge No, but you won't let me talk about why I was on the other side. Because we start talking about mental health and you throw up your hands like, oh, fuck, here she goes again with the mental health. But that is a factor that's being largely ignored. The fact of the matter is, is that he's been diagnosed with like with schizophrenia. And this has been a known fact, but he has not received treatment. This is a factor in this, you know, in considering intent in considering everything. You in think consider they considered his mental health problems no, I do when they charged I, him with, no. I don't meander now. I'm not meandering. I Pick do. the side of the fence. I, do, you, do you agree that, hey, this fucking uh, lawless Cretan nigga needs to be charged with attempted murder? Or do you feel like this is a mental health problem that has yet to be addressed and this is probably harsh considering that this was the result of some mental health shit? You can't do both. I'm and you not, be coming on here trying to do both. And I'm not going for it and it can't stop me. Pick a side. It's, I am not quiet, doing like fucking now. both. That is the side that I stand on. Which one? The mental health side. The fact that he is, his mental health issues have not been addressed. And this was the fucking outcome. That is the side that I stand on. My question to you is, how can you stand on that side and think that an attempted murder charge is justifiable? That's I didn't. I, you asked the she Newark boys. She, she I didn't, didn't say, say anything. anything. <laughs> she didn't say nothing, nigga. I can address it. <laughs> Ice asked you a question. He said, you, you, no, you answered Ice, and you said you don't know what the gentleman's intent was. If you stand on, I don't know what his intent was, then how can you be so adamant is his intent was not to kill the woman? That is a direct contradiction. We don't, you said you don't know what his intent was. So his intent, if the police don't come, could have been to beat that lady's brains in. Mm -hmm. That could have been his intent. If the police don't come in the courtroom? No, if the police if they don't, don't get come in the manner in which they got to him. 
If you no, think at that if, time if, he's if, thinking that I'm a joke no, her, they, they're about, gonna stop me from killing her, though, but I'm a joke on her. Word intent. What yeah, was wait, his up. intent? My answer to that is yes. You think I the mentally not, unstable I, person was thinking of if I jump on her, they will stop me to keep me from killing her. I do not think that, and I'm not operating by his mm -hmm. brain. I'm operating by just the world and mm -hmm. life. Mm -hmm. I do not think in any instance that man would have the ability to jump over that thing and kill the judge in a courtroom before somebody stops him. I do not think that that's what he was thinking. Do you think the person if, that even thinks to wait, jump over... Can, you, oh, can you respond to what I said? And then I'll respond to what you're saying. I'm going to respond in saying, I don't think that person's thinking it through at all. Sure. I'm not thinking they're going to sure. stop me, not stop me. I'm on you. That's what made There's me no even trip to There's no limit to the violence that. that he's trying yeah, to project. Yeah, it's not like I'm going to go yeah. to this and point only, and they're going to stop me. They're going to hold me back. I'm not, not only this that. What do y'all say, say about the student uh, with the mental health issues that beat up the teacher that's facing all the time? Do y'all feel like that's warranted God, as well? which one? I don't no. know. I don't know. I don't is it the one that ended up having a seizure after the... the, well, the Nintendo the, Switch. She took the Switch from I don't the Nintendo Switch. Yeah, yes. I, don't know, I don't know all yes. of the, uh, the, the, the factors around it. I think, I think this. I think she that, took his Nintendo... I'm telling you the factors. She took his Nintendo Switch. He beat the brakes off her. It took a few teachers to get him, get him off. They struggled to get him off. And he's facing 50 years or something crazy. That was his thing that calmed him down or something. Yes. And, and that was... Alec, and that was... Um, implemented by the school like this is his device yeah, the school. that you use to calm him down yeah they were aware yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. maybe so, not the teacher but somebody I, again, in the school something was similar aware. to that from what I heard yes um, I, I but think, he did almost kill that lady I think it's a case by case basis I think it's something different I think that oh. um, yeah I think mm -hmm. but listen to this okay I think that rationale and logic go out of the window when you're talking about somebody that has mental health issues. So to your point, when you're saying, do you think he had, was going to jump over there and he didn't know that the police were going to come and get him off of her in time? I don't think his mind is registering all of that scenario and circumstantial stuff. But, because if it is, you don't do it, period, because you know they're going to hit you with mad felonies. My reply to you to that one point is, Again, I'm taking this out of his mind. Mm -hmm. In so, anybody's mind in the courtroom or outside of that courtroom, if you're trying to murder someone, the place to do it or the place that it would be kind of tough to do is, is a courtroom. Room. Correct. Why would we I keep agree, going I agree. to his I brain? Because he's the one who did it. He's because sick you're and needs help. To his I agree intent. with Mel. He's no. sick and needs if help. If you're speaking to his intent, then we have to. I'm not speaking to it. Oh, he asked me, what do I think? So I don't know his intent. No, you said, I said no, I don't know. You think, you you said, think he should have got charged with attempted murder? Was attempted murder. You said you don't think his intent was that. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. So I'm saying that if you can't speak to his intent, if we can't speak to his mental stability, the two things are intertwined. If I'm intending on doing something, that means I'm making a conscious decision to do it. But even mm -hmm. with so these points, this is why he shouldn't be charged with attempted murder. Yeah, yeah that's why. because of his <laughs> mental his mental <laughs> ability, he shouldn't be his charged with attempted murder. So let me ask you this: He should not be charged with attempted murder. When he when he jumped over the thing, yes, what was his intent? To attack the judge. He was... To fuck her. He, he yeah. said it. Yeah. I'm about to fuck you up, bitch. Cool. He said it. So, in that, do you think when he jumped over there, he just intended to hit her twice? Three times? Four times? What? Whatever fuck up means in his mind, he just intended to put hands on her and beat up. So, why is that not an attempted murder if his decision-making could have been, I could punch this lady as because, many Because his decision-making was based on the emotion that he's Please, mentally ill. Because she went to work the let next day. That's my, important to me in my story. Let me finish my question. Yo, gotcha. when you want, even gotcha. want to pretend Please like you let got... Me let, let me land my plane. But I'm no, first. Quote you, but let no, me first. No, because then you're going to respond to what I'm saying. Have at it. If he jumps over there, and let's say the bailiff is uh, some older man, he might have got 20 punches off versus six. That could have resulted in this lady it's, being it's, critically it's, injured. Okay, wait, wait. If it was have, a fifth, we'd all me, be drunk, let me, nigga. Let me ask, There's no if. We got to talk about so, what happened. Yeah. Let me ask a scenario. He jumped let over. Me, he didn't get beat up. He doesn't He doesn't deserve let attempt me ask murder. A scenario about, right, about, well, let me ask a scenario about attempted murder because you keep on mentioning the fact that she went to work the next day, which we don't necessarily know, but let's just say we she did. No. Okay, no, let's just say she that, did. Let me just give the definition of That's attempted what I was murder. That's about to look up. Okay. Let me just do that. In the United States, a conviction for attempted murder requires a demonstration of an intent to murder, meaning that the perpetrator attempted to murder and failed. So I was going to give the scenario of, let's just say... So you could say that just, about any fight. So, it, or, so let's just say somebody has a gun, they want to kill me, they shoot at me, but they miss. But the bullet like lands like right beside you my head. You an attempted murder. That's, an, that's an attempted murder yes. charge, but I'm 
physically okay. So you understand why they charge them with attempted murder now? You're wrong. Because they are not. I don't think I am, but I receive what y'all are saying, and I'm, no, I'm not arguing or debating it. They are charging him with attempted murder because they are not taking into account his past mental health issues. And or, they are, they are, they man, are. And they charging him with attempted murder. Because he attacked the judge. Because, because they the don't judge. care. And, and if you realize that, then you would probably realize they shouldn't charge him with attempted murder. They shouldn't. But that's a judge that you attack. So now everything that we could tack on, we're going to tack, tack on. on. Hey, 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 much luck, good luck, love to every ball parties involved. So let me ask you a question. I think Joe. that is total bullshit. So let me ask you a question. I think this country creates mental health problems and then fucking Punish punishes Absolutely. mental mm -hmm. health problems. That. There's no savior. There's nobody to understand. There's True. nobody to talk to. Then they fucking give him medication. They make billions of dollars off of it. Like this shit is much deeper. They lock you up. They make, they, make, they make money off you in the prison. White lady judge. Like, what about the kid? Not, what about the kid? And you also feel like the kid though should not get uh, yeah fifty no, years. Okay, yeah, no. I don't. I don't. I don't waver on that. Okay, I don't, I, I, I don't think that that kid, kid should be yeah, facing 50 kid. years. Yeah. I don't think that I this nigga that. should be facing uh, attempted that. murder. I think that you could have tacked enough. They, all the rest of the charges, loop them up. Hey, say guilty, do a side swipe. Guilty all of them, like ninja uh, fruit. Fruit ninja. Guilty all the way down. Five guilty combo piece. Yeah. I'm not mad at none of that. You wild out, uh, mental you health do? dude. Attempt to murder. Yeah, too far. Mental but we've seen that happen too, where they'll throw on some shit in there, and then you get a lawyer, whatever this is. Like they might kick, down. They might kick that. They'll give you sixty-seven charges. They know forty-five of them ain't gonna stick. Yeah. But we're yeah. gonna pile it on to make it. But we're gonna worse. charge you everything, and we gotta. And again, this is a high-profile case now, yeah. so we gotta we gotta show that we doing our job over here for her for the judge mm -hmm. too. And I'm True. gonna keep it a buck with you. True. We gonna throw the book at your ass, so nobody else yes. gets any ideas about how to attack a judge in the middle yeah. of a court proceeding. Unprecedented. Yeah. yeah. That's true. What, are we, what are we talking about? Uh, we're talking about what they should and shouldn't do with the mental health dude. Yeah, we're being attack, crazy. No, he's different. breaking that. He know what he just said. No, he yeah, mean, but, but I, he's not but, being literal. I want to make myself clear because their, their tone and how they're replying to it. There are places that you could shove this guy for 50, 60 years that address yeah. mental health. Mm -hmm. That's a fact. That's a fact. He don't never have to touch grass ever again. Mm -hmm. I agree. 100%. He could be gone. Mm -hmm. These places exist. They may do I that. know a few of them. They may do that. I know people that's in some of mm -hmm. them. Mm -hmm. Ain't seen them niggas in 40 fucking years. They gone. Mm -hmm. I'm agreeing with you there. Yo, he clearly has some mental issues. He went from talking coherently. He snapped. Speaking Literally. in sentences, sound like a well-spoken guy, to, no, I'm going to fuck you up, bitch. Like that. So I'm definitely agree in agreement with you that he has some mental health issues. I'm just saying, if that was my mother that was presiding on that podium, I... I you got to do what you got to do. See, and that's, and that's but that's an emotional See, response. Stop, because that's, that, yeah, that's Capricorn shit to me. Like, that's that I can hold a grudge, you attack my mom, so it's up for life. But if that happened to my mom, God forbid, and by the grace of God, she was okay at the end, okay enough to go to work the next day, I would have a talk with my mom, even if she felt like giving that nigga 100 years, and say, Ma, come on. He going through come it. Come on, Ma. Yeah, I get it. I would have that talk. I wouldn't be say, oh, get her, get her. Like, what the, y'all niggas, there's not enough compassion and grace in this country. It's not. It's not. Let me ask you this. Let's say he never hit her one time, but he jumped over and a chair fell. She hit her head on the floor when she fell. He didn't even get a chance to punch her. But with him attacking her, her chair fell. She hit her head on the ground. Trying to avoid him, basically. She's in a coma now. He didn't if, punch. He didn't land one punch. If she's in the coma, she did not go to work the next day, yes. right? So your thing attempt is to murder. still on his attempt, but the, the fact that she went to work. No, listen, he's no. saying that the, the fact that the lady, Joe, the intent uh, is the same in both on, of those scenarios. Uh, no, Joe, Joe's hung the, up in, on in the your fact example, that she's able to go to work. In your example, the intent doesn't doesn't matter. In your example, the intent don't matter. If you attack somebody and they hit their head on the fucking concrete, then they, whatever happens for them health wise falls on you. Cool. If I attack you and I try to bust your fucking head on the concrete, even do it a couple times, and you get up and go to work the next day, I don't want to hear nothing do about you know, attempted murder. Hold up. But listen, this is where we got tripped up with yeah, the uh, with the uh, mag shit. Do you know what you need in the United States of America to, America to prove murder? 
You need a motive and an intent. Those are the only two things. So if your intent is there and now you had a motive, she was about to send me to jail for a long period of time. Those are the two pieces of information you need to prove murder in there's, the United there's States. There's not a lawyer in the world that's walking in the courtroom and saying my client wanted to kill the judge because she was trying to give him a sentence. I didn't say that. I said he has a motive. And, and then what we would the motive be if you're not saying that? Revenge. You're about to send me to jail. So then you are saying that. She's, he's, so then he you are saying it. that. He said it. It's all right, bro. <clears throat> I throw my hands up. You got it. This is why. We, this is no, why, we can agree this to disagree. Is why, yeah. This is good. This is good. This is why I don't attack people. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Yeah. Yeah. I'm dead serious. Look. You attack somebody in a street fight. No, we've been. We've my, man been punch you, my man punched you in the face in the club. I could have got it from him. No, listen. We've we, we been serious. My man punched you in the face in the club. You trip, hit your head on the granite on the bar. God Never. forbid you died. Never. His intent is, I didn't mean to kill him. I intended to, to punch, punch him in the face. face. That means This is the result. That means that I died from some cretin putting his unmanicured mittens on me. <laughs> and, and you, yes, and you hitting the granite, and then you hit Oh, I know my niggas is riding. You killing him that week. <laughs> I know my niggas is riding. <laughs> he ain't going to see the next Monday. You shitting me? My niggas riding for that. You was on Hello. The, you was on the, uh, the, Hello. the, the dirty so, Ace of Spades. In, 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 in that circumstance. Floor? Y'all think L going to let that happen to me? Yo, you <laughs> laying on the floor. Big L. Not that creep. Get creep beat out on the phone, man. It's time to ride. And in Queens. Come on. Oh, You're just down there laying on a patrol. So do you? All right, so lock him up, throw away the key, right? Real, real, real quick, Joe. One question. It. I don't think so. Do, do you? Do you feel like by taking this stance, right? Are, are you speaking from a humanity perspective? Because you're, the stance that you're taking, a lot of people that's watching, whether it's women and, I mean, some street niggas say something different. We'll fuck them up. But the, the, <laughs> the stance that you're taking. It's not, it's not, you're not validating it, but you're trying to make an excuse for someone who clearly did something. Crazy. I'm not making an excuse. If it he comes off if, like that if, a little bit. Oh, well, I don't care. You agree with him. I do, but I agree with the fact that he shouldn't get attempted murder. But That's my only the, point. The, the way he's Joe, challenging that one that's charge. It, that's, that's it. it. The, that's the, the way Joe is passionate point. about it, somebody could be like, well, Joe, the nigga went, like you said, the nigga went over there. Nigga talking about he hit her in the head with flags and all type of crisp spread on her and all that. So when you hear the details, it's like, nigga, do you still want to stand on that side? Or, are we, or, or should we just say, Yo, you know what? Like you said, he has a mental health issue. Let's get him the help he needs. Y'all putting too much stock on the flagpole, too. My last fight, I grabbed in the classroom. I grabbed the flagpole, too. Me, that too. took that shit, bust that shit up. I had somebody head. in the head with a shovel. That shit wasn't no effective weapon. <laughs> <laughs> was not talented. Was not talented. But not uh, talented. You got a be. flagpole got a, a fucking spike at the tip of it. Yeah, yeah, it does. He didn't have enough time to get to that <laughs> end of it. It got a weight in You really didn't play a strong role in this. Somebody with a flagpole. Flag really did not play. Yeah, Post somebody with that shit, nigga. Just because your I bitch ass had the flagpole and nigga took it from you? I go, don't tell I, that story no more, y'all. <laughs> why? It was the official fucking flag with in Mr. Ford class. With the eagle on it. Joe, say, yo, what you doing? Man, give me the, the one with the eagle on it. Yeah. <laughs> the heavy shit. That nigga pledge allegiance on heavy your ass. <laughs> you know how you have yeah, to man. properly poke somebody with a flag to kill him? Come on. You got a weight on the bottom. I can always yes. tell who ain't got mental health problems. Oh, in your family. man, yo. Or who do and just ignoring them. Ain't fucking with those put family. On the flag pole. It's I, just I, hurt, can, I can tell who ain't seeing they fucking. You ever saw the kids when they graduate and they got to pass the flag pole? How heavy them shits is? That they shit be leaning back. That shit is heavy. That strong nigga was hitting up with a flagpole? <laughs> <laughs> with the weight on the bottom? Yo. That's crazy. <laughs> Call your cousins that ain't all the way. All together. The yeah, because now, now I'm looking at y'all shady. Like mm -hmm. I'm they, looking at y'all little shady now. Time too. My nigga hit my mom with a flagpole. Now he, I'm, I'm gonna try to kill him. They almost sent him to jail. Nigga, send him outside. Oh, great. Then all of these lives lost for what? Because my mother got hit with a flagpole. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there's a good reason. Oh, your yeah. mom should toughen up. Yeah, I, watch right. your mom. You got people. Watch your fucking see? mom. Don't be with your mom. See? Watch your mom. Nah, nigga. Look, your mom. See? He Take said, that back. He Take said that she went to work the next day, so she was like, my mom wouldn't went to work the next day. No one her. Dog, if somebody get hit by a car, and then we can move on, I, I promise bet. you. If somebody get hit by a car or mm -hmm. even want to pretend like they got hit by a car, mm -hmm. they have to call out of work the next day. That's not true. That's for that lawsuit. If they want that, it's not true. But the lady might not have wanted to And then they have to go All to right, therapy. Well, go to work and see how that money decrease in the lawsuit then. Go to work the next day and say, <laughs> oh, we had, oh, we okay. had, we had 80K for you, but 
You went to work. Yeah. Yeah, it's oh, not true. Not we even. got 30K for you. I promise you, you that's not true. I, I, I promise I you that's not true. He was everything. Truck driver, <laughs> sneaker stopper, <laughs> insurance collector. You two niggas had a lot of gigs, boy. Yeah, no, made, nigga, I, I was I, that. I, 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 I was that. I, I gave out the I insurance. Didn't, I didn't make pump it up. Shit, oh, I know. Uncreative bitch. I know. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm an analytic, you know what I mean? I wasn't a creative nigga running around rapping. L, wake up over there, man. I'm Look here, at man. You. I'm here. Look at I'm here. I'm with ice, L, like, they're still debating. Matter, they're still going. <laughs> they're still debating this. We just getting still started. Potty. Me and B-Dot just... would have been on topic 90 by now. <laughs> Had 77 lists. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. My light-skinned brother. What yeah, happened? Oh, yeah. oh, Yo, L, can you admit that B-Dot list is a crack of bullshit? A crock of bullshit? I don't agree with it. It's his list. It's not. I when I catch it, like it doesn't reflect my views. No, uh, throw your it's man. all his own independent. Just throw list. your man yeah. under the train. It's, no, no, it's, it's no, not the rap radar list. Never, it's B Dot's list. You can tell B Dot never worked for Double XL. If it was rap radar, he did. He did. That's how we met him. Double XL. Absolutely. That's where B Dot comes from. What department? <laughs> he went from the bottom of the mass at editorial assistant to my partner in crime. So he mm-hmm. was at the bottom where. He- yeah, young boy, 2005. It's his 20th year in the game. I don't, care about, I mean. I don't care about his history. So he couldn't affect executive decisions we made. No, he was the, he was the young go. boy in the meeting. That's how we need B-Dot. Challenging the whole system. <laughs> we need B-Dot to not be able to affect change. <laughs> <laughs> He's impactful, man. Come on. I love B-Dot, man. That's yeah. my guy. Shout, shout, out, my shout guy. out to him. Shout out to him. Shout out to B-Dot. Uh, how much money are you looking for in your re-up? What? It's Warner. Uh, it's it's Warner. It's planned out. It's already, it's already Nigga, what type contract. of question is that? It's <laughs> already planned out. You're taking pocket watch to another level. Word. Word. You just did pocket watch and live. Pocket <laughs> questioning. He said he's got a re up coming. He's got a re up coming. I love watching contracts. Nigga, you wouldn't even discuss. Yo, stop, man. Mm. No, the terms, you the wouldn't terms are already in agreement. It's just the green light go. That's all. Nigga, ask oh. him now. Ask him now. Mm. Ask him now. Oh. Oh. What is he's projected to make on Patreon? And then shit. after that, verbally in agreement. After or? that, free agent. So you know what I'm saying? What we, what we talk about? What we oh doing? shit! He oh, so now they're gonna re up. Wait, wait, after, after the next three contract, I'm a free agent. <laughs> One more year. What what? Thing? So what if they catch you with a three year extension? Huh? Well, then that changes. Yeah, they don't have the, to. The, the agreement is what exists the, the. now. So we would have those meetings and figure it out if it makes sense. Yeah, you look like you get a couple dollars over there. You look like you do. Yo, where you live at? I live in California ish. Really? When you stay on the east, so east coast, a humble hotel situation. Yeah, I enjoy I hotel tonight. Shit. I was going on <laughs> <laughs> hotel tonight. I did enjoy um, you doing the, the book of Clarence interview out yes. there, but not for reasons you, that you may think. You know, Nori hit me. He think I snuck and got a Jay Z interview. You know how Nori is. No, like, Congratulations, <laughs> yeah, you guys. Great you work. Content, you content guys got to stop. <laughs> <laughs> I woke up to Nori. Great work. I was like, okay, Dory. I watched the shit, and I was thrilled to see you ask a question and Hove step on it. That was my favorite He set me up for that. You know he did that, right? That was fire. Because I know that he had to know you had the question coming. Yes. And he had to step on prepared. Right, and I was like, yeah, but what about the struggle? The struggle that comes along. It ain't with no struggle. Nigga, was like, yeah, 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 yeah dog. I, 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 that's a thing with me. I don't like when people but see. Speak that's like what it's he a does. struggle about it. We say off the thing. He tells yeah, me, struggle. yeah. We get on stage, alley oop, bang bang. Yeah, no, I like that. That's all good. That that was fire. Dang, just like, I'm on glad to see Joe sees this. Joe knows. Oh yeah, no, I'm glued to this. Pop out me. That was fly. I like that. Thank you, brother. Um, anybody have anything else that's near and dear to their heart, souls, and spirits that they need to share with us or the audience before we go home for the weekend? No. No, I ain't got nothing, man. Well, they must want me to go home and create another game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, wait. Before we go, wait. No, please don't. Um, it's playoffs. It is playoffs. We got to talk. Playoffs. playoffs. Mm. <laughs> what was that, Dick Vermeil? Dick Vermeil, some old nigga coach. Yeah, yeah. old coach. Old coach. Yo, is you old, son? <laughs> old as hell. Dick Vermeil holding grudges. Dick Van Dyke, you got, you got stop. You still on that shit? <laughs> <laughs> he can't let that shit go. Oh, Fuck you. Come on, let's get it. Let's get it. Come on, get it. Come on. Oh, I want to hear fuck. Uh, I, th- <laughs> oh, I, th- I think we beat him by twenty. Oh shit! Oh, right. Wait, wait, what? Wow. Wow. There we go. Finally, wait, your team in the playoffs? What? You know they got a running back, right? Of course, I know. A good one too. <laughs> I, I I still think we beat them by twenty. I think you'll. I don't think you're gonna win by twenty, but I think you'll win. Yeah. It's in Dallas, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's, that's we, a dub. we undefeated at home. That's a dub. Last two. Oh years. yeah. But I think that I think we beat them by twenty. Jeez. Ice. Oh my bad. 
Oh, oh no, I ain't got a, I ain't got a team in the playoffs. Up. I was fucked up. No, I, I saw I you. That's fucked up. Like that, like asking you what you thought. We're looking to take the sixth. <laughs> the, we're looking to take the best, re, second best receiver in the draft <laughs> at the sixth spot. Uh, what uh, do I think about y'all? You saying just overall thoughts? Uh, I got y'all winning, but there's a bunch of teams that if y'all lost this week, I wouldn't be the most surprised. Y'all are in that group for me. Uh, y'all in that group for me, the Dolphins. Mm -hmm. I think that's a tough game, but it it's is. a fun fun game. Mm -hmm. uh, the Steelers, <laughs> just get the check. You think so? Just get the check. Don't be shocked. Who y'all got? Buffalo. I would be shocked. I wouldn't be shocked if the Steelers won that game. If Pittsburgh be beat Steelers, right? Buffalo, I'm I'd ruined, be shocked. I'm ruined for, I, it would be shocking, but it wouldn't shock me because yeah. I, I respect Mike Tomlin's game so much. And I only think that's... TJ Watt being TJ, out. TJ Watt being that's, out. That's, that's, that's the... And uh, Minka's not playing either, is he? Or is he? Oh, it's over. Go oh. on. And George Pickens is in the mirror dancing right now. Man, I don't get it. <laughs> that nigga want to dance. He don't want to play no football. He don't. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What other games? What other games? The Eagles... I think if they lost, I wouldn't be surprised. I think surprised. the Bucs might get that one. I would not yeah. be surprised Yeah, the Bucs, right? Yes. Mike Evans. Yeah. 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 I, 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 I think wouldn't the Bucs might take them. I think the Bucs can beat them. I also think that um, the Detroit game is just going to be a fun game to watch. Uh, yeah. I'm I just think it's going to be a fun game to watch as a fan. Who, who are the Ravens playing? They nobody. No good nobody. buyout. They got the next one. Nobody. They look the best to me. Like, who you guys thinking long term? I had them winning the whole thing until Odell rented that yacht. I hope, I hope, <laughs> I hope somebody beats San Fran. Yeah, I think the Ravens. Somebody beat San Fran. They Ravens could be a Dallas, they could be a Dallas okay. Super Bowl. Somebody beat San Fran. And they could be beat. San Francisco couldn't be beat. I don't think it's going to be by anybody in the NFC. Nobody's even asking you. you know? <laughs> <laughs> last, last, last football question. The biggest upset this weekend would be who for, for everybody? The biggest Cowboys. upset yeah. would be the Cowboys. Yeah, it would be the Cowboys. Cowboys, a lot of people would say Miami. Though, so. I, I got the Steelers. Oh, the Steelers, yeah. That would be I'm my biggest upset. That's that actually a good point. Actually, the Steelers are probably a bigger That would be. Bigger it, would, it would be the Steelers. But they could lose, but I just... Yeah, I well, Buffalo's playing too good right now. Yeah. Just well, I guess nah, I know. Since Buffalo got that new uh, offensive coordinator, they've they been haven't, going. Not really, though. They barely beat the Chargers. They barely beat the Patriots. They barely beat the Dolphins. They not. They haven't been like going crazy. They barely beat the Eagles. But they, barely, lost, they lost, they lost the Eagles. Eagles. Yeah. It was a close game. They've won a bunch of games, and respect due to them. But they haven't looked like crazy. No, oh, well, we shall see. We, we shall see. see. Disappoints me. We all don't get together as fellas, man. Once the games like we used to. Y'all can man, come over crazy. Saturday if you want, or Sunday. Got my baby. I'll be watching. Sorry, yeah, it's fine. I got money. <laughs> yeah, you said I got money. That's what yeah, you said. Okay. Right. My friends don't want to hang. Time to time to fucking wrap myself in shallow things that mean nothing in the grand scheme of things. Ah, <laughs> uh, <laughs> a little five hour pod on this weekend. <laughs> something, something like these niggas. So much for my little game, yo. It we didn't. We, we're finishing that game. Take it to Patreon. <laughs> we're fit, no, not Patreon. Next oh. week. Don't try to. Don't try to shove my shit to Patreon <laughs> on the main. Or shit. I'm trying to build a cliffhanger to make people go subscribe to Patreon Ooh. if they haven't already. Ooh. There we go. That's true. That's true. Look at all the Hello. Yeah. You know me. Nigga. I'm doing my calculation right now. <laughs> <laughs> when a nigga, when a rich nigga asks another nigga, oh, how much he making on his next shit? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's do some calculation. Yeah. Yo, Jay would never tell me the second verse, Joe. Huh? Who he's talking about? The, this, the later verse in the song. It's very specific, but mm. I can never hey, yo, pick, him hey, yo, to tell pick it me. Up. Yo, hey, pick it up, bro. You just named it. Pick it up. <laughs> what? What happened? I expected to hear Jay if it wasn't for you. Wasn't yeah, 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 yeah. I'll figure that out. Yeah, yeah. I can nah, figure it out. It's not jazz though. It's just some I was about to say shit. jazz. <laughs> no, but it's not. But it's some street shit. But I couldn't get him to tell got me. It. Yeah. Got it. Got it. Got it. Shout out to Hove, man. Happy early birthday from Ish. <laughs> <laughs> 11 months to go, man. 11 yeah. months. <laughs> Count that, you know. That nigga playing in his December now. He got the calendar. Yeah. Who's going to be on Broadway? Birthday. Got his fit ready? I mean, mine's Sunday. Come on, Ish. Uh, there you go. <laughs> Light skin Capricorn, brother. Oh, wait. Ish, when your birthday? Soon, right? Yeah. yeah. Capricorn. Yeah, it's coming up. Tuesday. Is you Capricorn too? Tuesday. It's Tuesday? No, this is the worst nigga on... 
Oh, we gotta do something special, oh, man. Is you too sick? We gotta go. do something special. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Happy birthday. So, you bro. know, it's, so is me. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. and Ish. Then Ish. Yeah. 1456. Oh, That's why you took that Umar shit to bed. That's why you got mad at Umar, You got to stop looking at me. <laughs> it's right there. I didn't, I'm leaving it. All right, I'm cool, leaving cool. it. Hey, yo, Joe, I told you. That's why you took that Dr. Umar shit What'd upset. What'd you say, he, he right after Martin Luther King. <laughs> Coretta ain't far behind. Nah, right? she's right there. If Martin uh, is there. Coretta. Oh, man. Ish, bring all 49 years of you to work Tuesday, nigga. Don't try it. <laughs> That's what you say to your man? Don't call out? Don't you try it. Don't try to hit me in the, the morning. Little, the That's y'all little trick. Hit me in the morning. Yo. <laughs> Uh, man, early, like what? Yeah. Call out. 645. Yeah, 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 yeah. But on the day of work. Do they do the sick voice? Mm? No, nah, they don't give a fuck about me. <laughs> we do a sick. We do a <laughs> sick. Hit me and now, yo, not coming in. <laughs> oh, can we converse about it? <laughs> <laughs> do I have a say? <laughs> oh, oh, all right. Whatever. It's your birthday Tuesday, bro. Okay. All right. What type of cake Capricorn. you like, bro? You know this thing like sweets. He don't care. <laughs> What type of cake you like? Ish, what you doing for your birthday, man? Sound enthused and energetic, this please. Birthday Happy weekly. birthday, One cake. Happy birthday, Ish. Thank you, sir. Nothing. Oh, my God. What you want me to say? Make up some shit? Something, Ish. I'm what would you fire this nigga one of these days. I swear to God, What you man. doing, son? Is she 49? No, 50? 49? 48. 48. 48. Cool. 48, man. Mm-hmm. Almost time. It's almost time. It's a good age. 48 is a good time age. After for a few time after time. I can't time I won't say because I love you. <laughs> But it's time. Yo, the time after times. <laughs> yeah. Yo, man. This nigga's stupid, yo. Why you ain't doing nothing for your birthday? I got work. You know what I mean? Bef- oh, oh, shit. Oh, hey. 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 Look what y'all dap Y'all support that? Y'all support that, right? He reversed it. I could be in Capri. You know what I mean? Lake Como or something. I got work. Hey, dedication. Mm. Commitment. Man. Commitment. Commitment. Mm. Purpose. Well, Commitment over loyalty. Spank mm. you, man. <laughs> Commitment over loyalty. Exactly. <laughs> Commitment over loyalty. Spank, loyalty. <laughs> Spank you keep you out of Capri on. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Spank you rules everything what around. What that nigga said? Lake Minnetonka, we said? <laughs> <laughs> Lake Cuomo, God damn. Lake Cuomo? Chris got a lake. Mario? That <laughs> lake's crazy. <laughs> wow, shit, that lake. Yo, Yo man. Pokemon. We hope you enjoyed this podcast Pokemon. as much as... <laughs> oh. Don't what happened? No, my bad. He's, Elliot going crazy. My bad. Talk, talk, I'm sorry. Take, take a trip to the Poconos. That's early teens and twenties. My bad. I'm sorry. Man, you know, it's get offended. You mentioned Poconos. I didn't say a I'm word. Sorry. Him and Joe. You can't say that around them. I'm not mad at the Poconos. I ain't hove. <laughs> oh, that's why you were shitting on the. Po- I didn't even catch that. Yeah, I'm not hove. Mm. I will go to the Poconos, to the Bahamas, wherever Drake and Hove shit on. Uh, the- no intercontinental for you right now, Joe, though. You ain't gonna stay there. Intercontinental, come on. <laughs> <laughs> no. Why not? And and Drake shit on the Sheridan too. <laughs> Joe too. <laughs> <laughs> and he bought his and he shit on buying a the party bus. The party bus. Yeah. I keep it safe and just do four seasons. That's true. That's safe. That's real OG. That's that's like safe and reliable. <laughs> OG to me. Yeah. Ish. No risk call. You stay, you stay in the Four Seasons in Turks? No. Oh. In Miami? But, but I will. You stay in the Four Seasons in Miami? They got a beautiful wait, Four Seasons in Turks. Where do you stay at in Turks if you go to Turks? Where do you stay at? Just some shit you can't pronounce. Not important. No, it is important. No, it is. I, I don't think I so. You know it's why? Because important. lately, the heavier your hand get, the more exclusive <laughs> the, more exclusive the places you stay you know, just keep it quiet. Where no no I, risk Carlton? No, I risk really Carlton? capitalized off you guys' workload last year. So that's funny to you. <laughs> that's funny to you. <laughs> Don't take this out, Paul. Don't take this out. <laughs> Don't take this out. <laughs> You relate to the struggle. Told about, went on MTV with do rags. Made them love you. Wow, <laughs> the people will be fucking with you. <laughs> this way he Why you do oh, what whoa. you do? Hold up, stop. This way I, he was I, for you, I expected Joe? to hear mouse. This way mouse he if it wasn't for you, it wasn't for you. But, it, but instead, hold on. Let me just tell the people. Buddy, all I'm here is busting from I your crew. So I'm looking at. I'm looking at how they scheming. Let me get. Let me finish. Try to get accustomed to my moves. <laughs> I'm looking at what I see the price right here. Oh. I'm looking at what Joe says. Excuse me, hold on. Oh. I'm looking at what Joe stays. Yo, why? I'm not gonna say the name. This? He has a they bath. Can't get there. He has a bathtub. <laughs> he has a bathtub <laughs> next to the pool. They got that to loop. He bathed outside. No, they don't. <laughs> <laughs> no, they don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, can you describe what you see? 
<laughs> look at Mel now. Look, you look mad eager to pod now. All of a sudden, Ooh, oh, shit. Shit. can you send that? That's, that? Look, that's just look, beautiful. That's now she got hate. energy in hour four. Fuck you. Mouse, if it wasn't for you, but this is, this, is, this is sexy. This looks like some um, talk about it, like man. over the over the water bungalow type shit. Mm-hmm. 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 In real life, we do it right. Mm-hmm. Five and change at night. <laughs> No, no, he looking at you. No, he looking at you. No, 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 he looking at you. No, 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 no. Five and change at night, y'all. Not five hundred, neither. Wait, I, I see you walking on the water, nigga. <laughs> Wait, what did you say? Look at the floor? price. Walking in water. Yo, can I get my what phone? Page you Thatched you roofs and shit. Look at it's more than five and change. I don't know what page you're looking at. Is it more than five thousand a night? Go. Don't play. Oh shit, he said the big shit. I got pride, I'm a nigga first. I got a cock back and full of chicken first. The the funny thing, every time. Yo, that's the thing. Stop talking to me through Jay. Honestly, the the funny thing, I represent y'all every time I do a pod, and that's the shit that's hard. Woo. He going crazy. Honestly. Yo, for real, y'all never thought of that? No, it's all no, down with no, Jay Burst. nigga. <laughs> no. <laughs> Got my nine right oh here. Oh, my God. Yo, keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there. Good yeah. luck to uh, you if you have a team that's playing playoff football this week. Shout, shout to all the fantasy football winners out there. Keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there. Till the next time, we bid you adieu. Yeah. Farewell. Adios. Arriva Dirty. Hasta la vista. Au revoir. So long. Goodbye, man. And lastly, I'm treating it like the corner. Ooh. Fuck with me if you wanna. Book a Clarence in stores. <laughs> in stores right now. All platforms. All, uh, platforms. all platforms. Yo, you good with title now? Y'all good? 100%. All right now. <laughs> all right now. <laughs> 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 I've been at this nigga. Hey! Hey! I tried, I tried it, man. I tried a little bit. Yo, we love y'all, man. Remember, the baddies are insecure, the stagnant women want to travel, and the closed minded women want you to teach them things. Grab you a talent and all you might need it. Yo, we want to thank Elliot Wilson for stopping by. Happy yes, birthday sir. to him and Ish. Big L, come on. Big L, big L, big hey, Ish. Appreciate y'all. Thank they you. They call him me. Big LA. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we want to thank Benny the Butcher for stopping by. Yeah. Big we want to thank yeah. Everybody, Everybody can't, can't go. go. Everybody can't go. In stores this month. And we want to thank Zaire for stopping by, man. That's our guy. We'll talk to him shortly. Mm-hmm. Shout out to our live studio audience, Vern, <laughs> Amani, <laughs> Mac, Asia, Asia Paul. Kino. Kino was up here. Kino, Kino was here. here. Shout out to him, man. And as for the rest of you bitch-ass niggas out there, y'all know what time it is for the rest of the year. If it's up, leave it there. Pot harder, Positive niggas. vibes. Positive vibes. Pot harder. Yeah, you got to do a little more, man. Some of us been here 20, 30. You know what I mean? Pot harder. Everybody can't go. But it's fine. We not going the same places, man. When they see me, they see me. And when we see you, that's the problem. Well, we see yeah. you. Yeah. Hello. Okay. And we gone. You got to get your poem off, too, because Hov had a poem? Yeah, come on, man. <laughs> yeah. The beef ish, never ends. Ish, we out in December, nigga, the museum. <laughs> Yo, you okay? <laughs> Yo, is you good? <laughs> that was an old nigga moment. They played a video during the bond. Oh, I thought the shit was on you. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you <laughs> <see y'all. laughs> Was he looking at porn? That's what it sounded like, right? You were looking at porn? Like he doesn't Don't dribble get so, at all. He no, I wasn't looking at this. Don't talk about like that. He doesn't have any assists to feel like, but he getting threes up. That's, that's what we can't have. That. That's the stuff we can't have. You it's think that's? Appro- I think we'll figure it out. You think that's appropriate to want to know if Ish is looking at porn in his phone? They were looking at it too. The day who? Don't you think they, they were looking you at you shit? Y'all look at porn together? I mean, <laughs> what? Whatever the audio that's what was, she just said. it sounded pornish. That's they bad. That wasn't no porn. It sounded pornish. It did sound pornish. Sound like old nigga porn. <laughs> you couldn't wait till you clock out of work to look at porn. Who is watching porn up here with you, That's ugly niggas? I'm not watching porn. No, you looking at some Ivory Queen over there, nigga? New Joe Biden. <laughs>